Debbie, Debbie Cat. Oh no. <laughs> We've had an the accident. most beautiful display of conch. Oh. We've had a natural disaster. It was about three seconds before. Three, two. Dugga, 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 dugga. Right, okay. Um, yeah, it's been. I think it's because I stood on the thing. I don't know what it is. Oh. <laughs> So, so, oh. <laughs> Our shop sorry. window is ruined. I know. It's like a shop window. It's so beautiful. I loved it. Dug -a -dug -a -dug -a -dug -a right, okay. Anyway, we will sort it. Um, Debbie, how are you? I'm good, thank you. How are Saying you? Saying how wonderful Debbie looks today. So colourful and bright and gorgeous and stunning. So do you. Bit of colour. Bit of blooming colour. We're I'd rocking say. the summer. Summer vibes today. Is it going to be nice over the weekend, do we think? Oh, I don't know. Gosh, that's so cute. I've just realised what that says. This is Clemmy. Is my little, little Clemmy bracelet, which you can do with the 12 o'clock kits. That is utterly gorgeous. Hi, Clemmy. It's Nana. <laughs> oh, how old is she now? She is 18 months. Oh, see, that's very cute still. Very cute. She goes, no, no, no. Does she? <laughs> Unlike no, the no. sass that I get, <laughs> my husband, I phoned my husband this morning, he said, I'm just going to have to leave the house. I said, what? He said, well, Pippa won't come downstairs. I think she's dressed, so she hasn't had any breakfast. We're just going to leave that. Me, me and Hattie are just going to leave. I said, well, you can't just leave her. Of course I'm not going to leave her. We're just going to sit on the drive and wait for her. But, oh, Gosh, no. Yeah. That's going to be a fun journey to work, isn't it? A fun journey to school. <laughs> Complete silence. <laughs> uh -uh. The joy. Uh, anyway, I'm at work, so woohoo! Yeah. <laughs> I don't have to deal with that this morning. Anyway, uh, how are you today? Hopefully, you're really good. I'm not going to try not to touch anything on the desk. Um, we've got an amazing show for you today. We've got gorgeous conch, obviously, uh, which is all, uh, which will be uh, put back to normal in just a few seconds. Your, um, your, Early bird today. Oh my word. Take a look at these. <gasps> I know. Beautiful. Cherry blossom. Very, oh yeah, wow, 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 so. wow. The most gorgeous colour palette. It's just, it's feminine, it's gorgeous, it's beautiful. Don't worry, Kenga. We all know it's fallen down. We don't mind. No, <laughs> no one minds if they see your hands. Okay. Um, gorgeous kits. Gorgeous, gorgeous kits. Coming up in the uh, nine o'clock. Oh, yeah, the spiny My oyster. Favorite. Isn't it gorgeous? I love it. I'm not surprised it's your favorite. It is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, love that necklace. So, you know, I don't think you necessarily have to do much with a strand like this. And I'd, I'd wear it sort of, this is another one of the kits that I've got around my neck, but I would just wear it as a sort of a choker amongst yeah. my layers. Oh, that's really nice. So yeah, like that. I've got, I've got some pink there. So, so that's the gorgeous obsidian, obsidian. kit. We've got amethyst as well. Really lovely kit, that one. I think it's got the pearlized, uh, the pearlized, um, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, seed beads. Sky Moonstone as yep. well. Really excited about this. Uh, gorgeous strands coming up. They're all brand new strands. Deal of the day. Oh, wow. Where do we even start? Well, I, th this just drew my attention the minute I came in the studio. I was having a big chat with Ollie about this. Sky blue topaz with hematite spacers. Here's, oh my gosh, they are absolutely beautiful. These are top, 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 top quality. And then, how are you going to top that? Mystic Topaz. This. Oh! This. And it looks totally different against the skin. It's like magical. I love it. It's beautiful. It's so subtle as well. Yeah. We've also got them in uh, plain rounds as well, and they look like bubbles. They're just, look at all of that gorgeous oil on water, that iridescence coming from these. They are just absolutely beautiful. And we've got some gorgeous coins as well. Uh, so all of those uh, coming your way. Queen Conch coming up. Um, in the uh, 11 o'clock hour as well. It might, it might come forward to the 10 o'clock as well, but um, Queen Conch, brand new. Here they are. Brand, brand, brand new. Brand new pair of earrings, never been played before. Really excited about I'm these. I'm fascinated by this. I was <clears> watching some of um, Dave's VT and I still have questions because I didn't see it all the way through. Um, honestly, in real life, they're so much more fantastic yeah, than through are. the telly. I've seen them through the television, but they've got like 
different shades of pink yeah. and it changes. It's just gorgeous, isn't oh, it? woof, gorgeous. Beautiful, woof, woof. <laughs> woof. Uh, that's going to be coming your way uh, this morning as well. And then the 12 o'clock kits, we've got the gorgeous Heshi. Uh, we've got the gorgeous, gorgeous Heshi kits as well, which is so much fun. What's so nice about these is they can be really bright, really colourful, um, or they can be really quite refined and grown up as well, can't that's they? That's what I tried to do. So if you have a look at the brown, sort of the, the, the tan kind of bracelet. Which is lovely. You get two kits. You get one sort of um, really more nice. pastel -y kit. So that's yeah. probably what I would wear, if I'm honest. Uh -huh. And you can do rings and earrings. But then also, you've got really fun things like little mushrooms and little flowers. And my daughter's 16. She d went to her leaves assembly yesterday. Oh, and then they that. come home and, and she goes, can we do like a craft afternoon? So That's so nice. If you want something to do with your um, kids that are over, and I'm saying kids, she's 16, over the Easter holiday. Uh, Easter? Easter. Easter. That was back in April. Summer darling. holiday. You can. But then something <laughs> like this, the designers are kind of doing with the pearls. So I think they're quite versatile. Really, really nice. Kids of all ages, you know, whether you're young or young at heart, it's... Um, it's just so um, it's so lovely to be able to use things like this. You've also got some lovely yin yangs in there as well, which my girls are absolutely and little crazy mushrooms. About at the I'm obsessed with mushrooms. Yeah, they're so sweet, aren't they? Little absolutely flowers, gorgeous. hearts, letters. Yeah, really, really lovely kits today. Loads of variety. So nice to see a topaz deal of the day as well. I yeah. have to say, we're really excited about this. I'm going to show you the strands in real life because, I mean, they look wonderful on the recordings, and the guys have done an amazing job at recording them. But actually, in real life, they are. I mean. And, and Ollie said this, um, you know, production manager Ollie, he said, look, if it looks great in the studio, imagine what it's going to exactly. look like at home. It, honestly, it is absolutely phenomenal. Look at the mystic as well. It's just... Oh, oh I love that gosh, strand. so good. Oh, I love that strand. I'm definitely going to buy that strand if we've got any left. Yeah. Price points on these, by the way, are absolutely brilliant. We're definitely looking after you with these. We have historically bought you blue topaz, sky blue topaz, uh, for prices like kind of £129 before, uh, £99 before. We're going to go way 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 below that we're literally undercutting almost every strand we bought you in the last five years it's going to be brilliant um <clears throat> shall we go to the website jewelrymaker.com um go to jewelrymaker.com look at all the items we've got scheduled in this hour so your early bird special is the gorgeous cherry treat we've got bead stoppers as well which are absolutely brilliant we'll talk about those when we come to play them but um do get all of these things ahead of time we've got sliding class bracelets we've got earrings we've got uh jadeite like a jadeite mini kit gorgeous beautiful elephants in sterling silver and turtles as well uh, we've got jade rounds with ruby rondelles. We've got the gorgeous stackable jewellery trays. Uh, what else have we got? We've got some gorgeous chain in there as well. A metre of floating flower jade chain. Oh, my gosh. Gorgeous. Oh, that's the big 20 mil magnetic clasp, the really big ones. You see, you need that. If you're doing um, sort of multi-strand necklaces, you need something that's going to hold a heavier gemstone. Yes. So that's perfect. Oh, big agate bundle as well. Ten strands of agate, 24 99 So that's £2.50 a strand. Amazing. Uh, we've got the gorgeous signet rings as well. Really exciting. Oh, 9 99 for those. Do you know how much work it takes to make a signet ring? You have yeah. to cast it. So that's Huge. amazing. Um, uh, all of the uh, ring boxes as well. Uh, what else have we got? We've got some jump rings. We've got some curb chain threader earrings. Oh, lovely. So all of these <coughs> items scheduled in this hour, they're all going to disappear at nine o'clock. Um, Oh, lovely uh, Cotan Mutton Fat uh, Jade as well at the bottom of the hour. So you've literally got four, 46 items in this hour. Oh, Kinga, you think that's going to stay there, don't you? I just, I've just got a feeling. <laughs> Let's hope it does stay. Look at all this gorgeous conch before it all falls down. It's making a break for the ocean. <laughs> yeah, it literally is. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous conch shell coming up today, which is really exciting. Before we do anything, though, let's go to the Wall of Fame. Let's see some of your incredible designs. So let's start off with lovely Teresa Ellis, you're number 742. Hi, you're at JM. Here's my entry for the Wall of Fame. Uh, it's an over-the-head necklace made with four mil pearls. Ooh, oh, lucky, it's lucky. lovely. Seed beads, kiss cross and six mil pearls and seed bead stations, all rosy linked together. Good luck to everyone in the draw. And thank you for your inspiration, says Teresa. That's gorgeous, Teresa. Lovely summery piece to wear, that one. Gorgeous. Who, who's our next entry from um, Debbie? 
It's Cody Trigg. Hi to all the lovely people at JM. Please find enclosed my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. I was sat twiddling some bare copper wire, <laughs> <laughs> looking for, as us crafters do, looking for inspiration as to how to fashion a different kind of copper bangle for help with arthritis. And this is what emerged. I don't think I could repeat the same pattern again as I wasn't paying attention. Yes. I simply added some antique bronze chain from a findings pack and made an adjustable bracelet. All from my JM stash, of course. <laughs> I hope you like it and good luck to all in this week's draw. Thank you. Wow, Katie. that's beautiful. Really, really lovely. How gorgeous yeah, is that? Yeah, I love that. Uh, Barbara Hewitt, you're number 744, my lovely. Oh, sweet. Stunning. Very, very elegant. Uh, hi, my latest make rubies with silver spaces, all bought from JM. <laughs> uh thank you and best to all thank you so much barbara that's absolutely gorgeous so simple and refined that one gorgeous well done uh 745 kelly muir hope i'm saying that oh kelly kelly oh, kelly sorry i got distracted by your beautiful spinner ring hello all at jm i finally managed to make a spinner ring from the kits oh. i got on your show a couple of weeks back when claire mcdonald was on kelly that's amazing that's yeah, that is stunning. gorgeous stunning You've done an amazing job there, Kelly. Love. That's gorgeous. Carol Francis, your number seven four six. Amazonite dragon clasp kit. Oh, wow. it was only a matter of time. It was only a matter <laughs> of time. I love it. Wow. Uh, just added as per Alison's suggestion, eleven O size seed bees or from jewelry maker. Love making this, and it took me all day. It is very long. Looking forward to making the amethyst kit using a Cellini spiral. Oh, that'll take yeah, some time, but that will. gorgeous, Carol. Oh, isn't that lovely? What a gorgeous clasp that is. And you've, you've, you've set it beautifully. You really have. Thank what you. What a for clever that. lot. Yes. Very clever. 747 is the next one, and that's Gail. Good morning. Please find Attach My Entry for the Wall of Fame. A collection of jade bracelets, white, Olmec, and red, all from JM. I splashed out on some gold for my for spaces because I think they're worth it. Good luck, everybody. Thank you. Oh, I would just stack those straight on my wrist. They're yes. absolutely gorgeous. Shove them straight on. Straight on. Gorgeous. Thank you, Gail. <laughs> We've got Jade Cousins, your number 748. Hi, JM. My entry for this week is a multicolored tourmaline bracelet. Ooh. Tourmaline is th three by one and a half mil saucers from Beautiful. JM. Good luck to all. That is adorable, Jade. I love that. That's gorgeous. And our last entry today, Debbie. Um, oh. 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 Hello, little cat. Little Sorry. putty cat. Completely distracted. Yes. Susan Frost is 749. Oh, little, little grinning cat. Oh, no. Hi, all at JM. My entry for the Wall of Fame this week is two stretchy bracelets made for my great grandchildren to oh. give to their teachers oh. for the end of year prezzies. One is banded agate with hearts, and the other is tiger's eye, all from JM. And I hope they love them as I do. Good luck. As I do. Sorry. Good luck all f for the win. Enjoy the sunshine. They will. I made a teacher present once. How mine, lovely. And she burst into tears. So I take that as a good sign. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're going to love them. That's just super, super lovely. Good luck. Lovely colours as well. How sweet. Beautiful. Smuffy. Good. Oh, our YouTube. Uh, good morning, gorgeous ladies and fabulous crew. Please, please, please. What time are you doing those gorgeous topaz strands? Gorgeous, aren't they? 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock. Smoffy, we are trying to sort to YouTube out. We are having YouTube issues. It looks like you're wearing a little hat. Yeah, I like it. If I go there, look. <laughs> or else I can have a hammer on my head if I go there. Yes, I have <laughs> That's more me, really. <laughs> <laughs> We've got loads coming up today. Shall we get going? Yes, please. Okay. Let's start. Oh, sterling silver earrings with fresh water culture pearls. These are really, really sweet. Um, you get two very, very, very large wow. button pearls, which are half drilled. And then you get your earring findings. And then you get two slightly smaller pearls. The idea with these is, is to glue your pearl here. Mm. There you go. To glue the other one here. You can wear them as little kind of clip-ons. Um, I wouldn't be opening and closing them too much. I think as well, they'd make a lovely, um, um, you know, maybe the lovely basis, maybe for a ring. You've got a load of sterling silver wire there to use. Gorgeous, gorgeous quality. Are they quality. cuffs? Are they ear cuffs? Yeah, so you can put them either, well, you can put them on the lobe or you can put them a little bit Genius. further up. Very nice, eh? Genius. Very nice indeed. And again, you know, you can use other gemstones in there if, um, uh, should you want to do that. Twelve ninety nine for your gorgeous ear. Yeah. Uh, earrings, so they're your ear cuffs today. Um, absolutely beautiful. Now, there's three different ways you can get involved with jewellery making. You can either call us on our free phone number, 0800 644 655, or you can get involved on our website, jewellerymaker.com, or you can download our app and watch us on the go. 
We realise YouTube is down at the minute, so apologies about that. Yeah, gorgeous. Twelve ninety nine. Well done. Let's do our base metal chain b -b -b bundle. Here it is, silver plated base metal. Ooh. Here it is. They look like sterling silver. They're great quality. They really do, don't they? That's Two curb good. chains. You've got a couple of your kind of Rolo chains. You've got a couple of your kind of belcher chains there as well. There's That's two more of your gorgeous lovely. curbs and uh, a lovely o a, a couple of oval links as well. All 925 sterling silver. They are really, really lovely, aren't they? Gorgeous quality. Look at those. Yeah, I love those. 18.99 <laughs> is not your price point today. I know this is ridiculous. I know it's silver plated base metal, but 9.99, that's a pound per chain. That's absolutely incredible. It really is. Especially if you're making for gifts. I mean, you're always running out of chains, aren't you? Absolutely. And you don't always want to put a 925 solid chain on something. Yeah, definitely. You don't want, especially if you're making for craft <coughs> fairs or children's you know, Christmas fairs, things yeah. like that. You don't want to make your pieces too expensive. Absolutely. I'm just thinking at, at, at the end of term, lots of people have kind of summer fates, don't yeah. they, where you're going to be selling stuff for pocket money prices yes, exactly. or whatever it might be. And uh, yeah, these are the absolute perfect chains to be using at a pound each. How amazing is that? That's a really good deal. Yeah, brilliant. Well done. Nine ninety nine. Get those messages sent through today. We'd love to hear from you today. How are you doing? How are you doing today? Let us know. Um, I do get involved. You're looking forward to the topaz today, the blue topaz and the mystic topaz, the gorgeous kits, the conch. What are you looking forward to? Gorgeous. Um, so $9.99 is your deal today. Well done. That's a pound per 18 inch chain. Let's give you a 30 second clock to close. Yeah, get involved, everybody. 0800 644 655. Different chains do different things to your jewellery, don't they? Definitely. don't they and like sometimes if something's more subtle you don't necessarily want a chunky chain on there right? mm. but it's all down to the, d the designer's eye and what you think looks good and what you're trying to portray yeah um, so I think you need options you definitely need options yeah you see that's exactly it and, th and th let's face it Thursday Thursday's a new Friday don't you think <laughs> no but I think it's been ever since ever since kind of lockdown yeah true hasn't it Thursday, Thursday is not Thursday anymore. It's Friday Eve. Oh, I like that. I like it. It's Friday, Friday Eve. Eve. I like that. See, we're off this weekend, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, which means today is our Friday, which means it's going to be big, big, big. It's going to be big, big, big. Michael's going to Cambridgeshire this weekend. Nice. To play a gig, to play a wedding. Oh, very good. There you go. I've got drama and drumming and all that kind of stuff to be dropping off with tomorrow and various other bits and pieces. It was a birthday party as well on Sunday. That's going to be fun to drop off and pick up from. But apart, apart from that, it's just me and my girls. My husband's away. Uh, I can watch whatever I like on the telly. Yes. Yes! I have control of the remote <laughs> control. Uh, what are you doing this weekend? Anything nice? I am off. Which is, I've been, oh. you know, been quite busy over the last month or so. Well, with that's going nice. So, yeah, and just the end of exams and hanging out with the kids. I say kids, they're 16 and 18 now and, and 25. Yeah, but the exams are over. The exams are over. So me and my daughter will probably go shopping oh. and have lunch. Wait till they get old. You've got all that to look oh, forward I to. Oh, I love, oh, yes. We how love gorgeous. doing that. How lovely. And she'll tell me what jewellery she wants me to make. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I've got to make a prom jewellery. Still haven't done it. Now, look, these, uh, these would be wonderful for prom jewellery. Yep. These, um, every single time we bring these to air, they fly. Oh, are they the threader the earrings? The threader With earrings. The comfortable little... I yeah. love these. Yeah, I'm glad you said the comfortable thing because, because quite often they, it's just the chain. chain. See, this makes... Oh, this is game changer for me. Yeah. You know, these that little horseshoe, mm. it's... It, Last time these were on, a lady texted in, sorry, I can't remember who it was, and she said she goes to sleep in these because you know those, and she forgets they're in, that little horseshoe, it follows the shape of your ear. Yeah. Where if you think of an earring post, it can dig in your neck, it, can't All it? the time, yeah, all the time. These are so comfortable to wear. You basically put this uh, little post here through your ear piercing, pull it down, you can either have it at the front or the back, you can put your gemstone on there. I, I would never tell you what to put on these, but if you don't put the blue topaz, <laughs> Or the mystic topaz. The mystic, yeah. Then we can't be friends anymore. So, uh, so there we. Oh my gosh! Okay. It's all so good, isn't it? And they'd catch the light if they were in your ears. Oh, totally, absolutely beautiful. And I think for anyone, I think they're quite. Um, 
I would not I would not say for one second that these are kind of traditional at all but I think that they would appeal to all different ages but I think particularly for things like proms as well yeah because they're going to be perfect you've got aren't a very they? intricate something or other on the dress and having those with just one gemstone or even something like a crystal yes I think would be beautiful so is your daughter going to her prom then she is she's yeah and she decided what she's going to wear what yeah. kind of color are we going with it's like an emerald green oh and it's like a ball gown she looks she's beautiful. wearing a dress oh how gorgeous i wore a jumpsuit to mine we didn't have them <laughs> we didn't have oh. back in the day in the 1800s when i was born <laughs> We'd never oh. heard of a prom or a yearbook. <laughs> well, I don't think it was a prom. It was like, a, we don't, oh, no, we didn't need a yearbook. Disco, like it? a leavers party. Yeah. yeah, that was it. And uh, I can't remember, it's too long ago. <laughs> we need to get in the car park before to kind of have that drink your miniatures. And yeah. No, I haven't been drinking, so no, we're fine. And uh, yes, it's just, yeah. Oh my word, those were the days. Uh, 12 99 12 99 absolutely fantastic. Well done, Heather, Mary, Marianne, Sharon, Anita. And people try and outdo each other now, don't they? Of kind of what car they're going to be dropped off See, in. See, this is all new um, to me, because my boys just yeah. have a suit and they're converse, and then off, and other, oh, other trainers are available. Yeah. And they just went to prom whereas yeah. you know everyone was like oh no you have to go and, and have to go in a car fitting or and whatever go to the prom yes, dress yes, shop. Yes. and I was like do, do we? You? Do we? But yeah, actually, exactly. I really enjoyed it. Um, I love it when people get dropped off at proms in like tractors and combine harvesters and things like that. I don't know if they're going to want to go in my orange, very ancient beetle, but yes, that I might be. would. <laughs> I so would. Well done. Gorgeous. Twelve ninety nine for those earrings. Absolute, and that's for two pairs, which is wonderful. Okay, tool roll organizer. Genius. Are you an organised person, Debbie, or not really? Uh, I am when it comes to work. Yes. Do you know, I thought no one had thought of this because I, I thought things. of this um, a while ago and, and pitched it to somewhere for, to, to, you know, I've got kits to have my name on it. Yeah. And I thought I'm the only one that ever thought of it. And then JM come up with it. I mean, come on, who doesn't need this? Yeah, absolutely amazing. You've got your elasticated bands here to kind of... Hold it nice and close. This is this is a little bit. Um, They've been uh, bugging my brain. Is, exactly. This is a little bit flax. Look at it. But these are for all of your incredible That's tools. That's amazing. Paint brushes, pencils, whatever it might Ooh, be. Oh, there's a zip. There's a zippy. I mean, Elasticated come on. bands as well. And that's just going to, you know, especially if you want to, um, you're going away. If you're like me, you have to take a craft project, whether you do it or not, because yes. you feel weird if you don't. Yes, yes. This, and you don't have a lot of room. And Absolutely. I just thought, I've never seen one anywhere else. And I like the fact that it's not kind of bright pink. I mean, I like colour, but this is, um, this is totally... Totally unisex. It's absolutely gorgeous. Got this really lovely kind of canvasy material. Uh, your zips, your, your zippy pockets down here, which mm -hmm. is great. Your um, your uh, elasticated bands are here. They're really nice and kind of thick. Uh, you've got your um, uh, you've got your little kind of sliding pockets here as well. It's like a I, I don't know how I describe this material. Almost like a canvas material, I guess. Uh, message coming through. Do you know your app sound? It's completely out of sync with the video. It's quite funny. Oh, Angela, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry. Uh, yeah, we have got tech. We've got some amazing engineers who are on it. There we go. <laughs> okay, so we've got a lot of uh, engineers on it. Or they will be on it within the next hour or so. Uh, so there we go. Uh, right, well done, everyone. How much was that, Neary? $9.99. Amazing yeah, deal. Yeah, I have no, the red one deal. of this. Love it. I use it virtually yeah. every day, says Smoffy. Yeah, exactly. That's what I mean. It's just one of those things that you, once you get it, you can't live without, I'm sure. I'm getting one. And also, if you don't have the luxury of having your own studio or craft room exactly. or whatever, it's nice to keep all your tools together yeah. so then you can put them away nicely afterwards and you can all eat dinner on the table. You know, it, 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 you know it's, just, it's just one of those things. Um, yeah, which colour? Okay, silver-plated base metal clasps. These are amazing. Oh, these are absolutely oh. brilliant. Look, so you've got this one here, which is like this really, look, it's got this lovely kind of waffle back on it. There you go. Really beautiful. Oh, I've not seen one like one, that One, two, before. three, four uh, ring um, uh, connector sliding clasps, she says. Easy to put back together. There you go. Um, these are great for things like your seed bead, um, uh, peyote stitch or anything like that. Or, Do you know what's or... great about this? Mm. You see how far away they are from each other? Yeah. Like usually they're close together, so you can only use yeah. seed beads or small things. Like you're going to be able to use like four strands of pearls or jade yes. or conch. Nice. Um, 
big, big, big hint to anyone who happens to be married to me who's watching. And we've got an anniversary coming up soon. Wouldn't conch look nice around my neck? <laughs> Just saying, sorry, and just to carry on. Um, so you've got enough space. In, you won't be watching, it's working. Uh, the space between oh, this, you can get man. bigger beads. Yes, yeah, see? Genius. Well, now, these ones are literally all together. These are for your seed beads. These yep, ones are seed pearls. teeny tinies. Look at these. I don't even know. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think that's nine or ten. See, that's perfect. Apple Isn't that gorgeous? Yep. You don't have to use them all, obviously. Cleverly um, thought out, this one. Really well thought out. So you've got that one there. And then you've got this one here as well, which is just beautiful. Um, again, which you can put your um, kind of slightly larger beads in as well, which is absolutely perfect. Um, sorry, Neri, I didn't even reference the price. How much was that one? 777. Oh, that's a lucky number. There you go. All the sevens. We can do the rose gold one. Ooh. Rose gold plated base metal. There you go. Oh, six ninety nine. Oh, okay, brilliant. Why not? Yeah, there we go. Vaughan. Six pounds and ninety nine pence. I just love the quality. There's so much you can do with these. I mean, earrings. You yep. could, yeah, you could do your loom work yep. with these. Absolutely, we had lovely Alison yesterday who literally brings all of her loom jewellery in. Um, I think she must be on some kind of commission or something. She literally, she, she is a complete lunatic. <laughs> uh, we, we, we love her. It's very um, relaxing using the loom. Do you know, Alison, I've got, I've got to give her credit. That lady comes up with she incredible designs the wheel. time and time again. She's amazing. Is there anything that she can't do? She no. is absolutely incredible. No. She, she's never in that box. She's always out the box. She's amazing. Halfway down the road. Amazing. She's absolutely amazing, isn't she? She is great. As Gemma Crow calls her Yoda. She is a Yoda, isn't Yoda, she? Yoda, yeah. She is Yoda. <laughs> she is. Uh, well done, Heather, Nancy, Jacqueline. Well done to you. Loads of people coming through today. This is great to see. Well done, everyone. Good morning, good morning, good morning. There you go, everyone. Right, where are we going now? How about a metre of Labradorite? Ooh. Yeah, look at that. Long line... Rosary link necklaces with oh, Labradorite. Yes, please, Debbie. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, lovely, lovely long line necklace here. The potential's huge with this. Absolutely gorgeous. Sometimes you don't want black, you don't want white, no. you don't want a navy blue, you want something a little bit softer, don't you? I've got a long line necklace with Labradorite, but I had to buy like four strands or something at the time to get them. And I put rainbow moonstone in and silver. Oh, lovely. And every time I wear it, I get comments. And yeah. it's just a long line necklace, but I've done like a double strand um, just with silver and, and rainbow moonstone because I think both of those gemstones are really magical because you get that. Ooh, yes. Ooh. Oh, that lovely shiller. Absolutely That's gorgeous. The word. <laughs> Can I show you? Yes, look, like, there's, look. there's your sky uh, moonstone. There it is. And Absolutely it's still neutral, beautiful. like yes. you said. Absolutely. So it's still neutral, but it's not black and it's not white. We literally go with anything. Yeah. Absolutely anything out there. Well done, everyone. It's a go, go, go. Gorgeous. £19.99 for a metre of your Labradorite. Oh, that's going to go so well with the Mystic. Oh, imagine putting those amongst it. Yes, get, yes, um, yes. I yes. get two of those and then put those in. Look at that. Oh, look at all of it. I want that kit. Yes, yeah, so, yeah, so do I. That, oh. That's beautiful. That's absolutely gorgeous. All of that gorgeous Mystic Topaz coming up. I know, right? Amazing, hey? Well done, everyone. 0800 644 655. Loads of people coming through. Great, great again on your loom. Great for kind of cuffs or Ooh, um, stackable that. pieces. But I do love the idea of long line necklaces. I really do. That's just, oh, gorgeous. I love that as well, though. <laughs> yeah. You've got enough to make an, a long line necklace and a stretchy, haven't yes, you? Yes, absolutely. And earrings as well Most if you definitely. Want to do. Yeah. A whole suite of jewellery. And as Debbie quite rightly says, it's still a neutral, so you can work with literally anything, which is just great. Uh, gorgeous. Well done, everyone. Lovely. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's a ring. Oh, it's a lovely ring. Are we doing this now? Oh, it's a butterfly ring. Oh, look. When I saw it on the website, I thought it was a... Um, are we doing, sorry, are we doing this ring next, lovely? We're still on the Labradorite. Sorry, I beg your pardon. Sorry. Nineteen ninety nine for your Labradorite. There it is, everyone. Six mil rounds. It's that perfect size as well, isn't it? It is. It's the. You could do Marlas with that tassel. Yes. Necklaces. There's nothing you can't do with Labradorite. It was my number one favourite gemstone for a long time. Oh, about 166 beads on here as well. Oh, that's amazing. So you only need 108 for Marla, so you've still got enough for stretching and earrings. Absolutely. Selena Kim, Maker Cody, well done to you. 
Oh, there you go. Well done, everyone. OK, 20 odd seconds and then we're going to be taking those details away. We've got loads and loads and loads more still to come. Early bird today is that gorgeous cherry treat, cherry blossom uh, bundle. And we've also got bead stoppers as well. Nine o'clock, it's gorgeous. It's seed beads and strands, which is really lovely. Ten o'clock, we've got the deal of the day, which of course is the sky blue topaz and the uh, mystic topaz. Eleven o'clock, we've got the gorgeous conch. Twelve o'clock, we've got the gorgeous heshi kits. I mean, it's a morning of amazingness, isn't it? It's a morning of joy. Of joy. I'll take my joy. I walked into the studio and I looked and I went, oh, that's a high-end shop window there. And I was like, forgot that I was supposed to be working. I was going, I like that, I like that. What's that? I want that. <laughs> and it was the conch. No wages for me. Thank you. <laughs> that's it. Straight back to jewellery making. Working for free today. <laughs> All of the gorgeous conch coming your oh. way. Can't wait to bring you this. It's just stunning. Now we're going to do the ring. Here we go. Sterling silver butterfly ring. When I saw this on the website, I thought it was a mermaid's tail. It's not. It's a butterfly. It's Aww. clearly a butterfly. <gasps> what a lovely butterfly. This little cup here has got a pin in it. Um, it's a flower-shaped cup, which it, it seems a shame to cover it up, but it does come with the most beautiful little button pearl. Oh, Lord. Oh, I love that. For prom. <laughs> Yeah. For prom, you know, if, you do, if you're not a big, you know, sometimes less is more, isn't it? Absolutely. I couldn't agree more. Said the yeah. woman who wears 10 bangles and 15 rings. No, but they all match. They all look lovely together. I either go big or small. So I either go like, go big or go home, or I go quite dainty. I don't really do in between. It's all or nothing. And I love this. I think this would be beautiful yes. um, to stack. And if you had a thumb ring and then just one of these on, I think it'd be ever so good. Do you know, there's, a, there's an argument for both, isn't there? Yeah. You know, less is more like, you know, Gwyneth Paltrow, her kind. She's always, always very minimalistic. Or you could just be Iris Apfel and just wear everything. <laughs> all the bangles, all the glasses, all the colours, everything. Yeah, I love that. Yeah. Iris Apfel, what an absolute legend she she's is. She's a legend, her isn't glasses. she? glasses. Oh, gosh, she's got... How old is she now? Is she 100 and... No, she's 90-something. 90 90-something. 90 oh, she's just wonderful. Yeah, she is I a, love her. A, a style. And it's how you feel. Like, I was... Put jewellery on can change how I feel. Yes, absolutely. I couldn't agree more. I couldn't agree more. Yeah, it's about the way it makes you feel. And it can lift your mood. Like, if I'm feeling a bit bleh, I was saying this the other day. Like, you know, if you're looking in the mirror and you just think, oh, bleh. And, you know, you put a nice pearl necklace on or nice earrings. It just makes you exactly feel better. It. Well, it makes me feel better anyway. Absolutely. No, no, no. I think you're absolutely right. Sometimes if I'm feeling a bit like that, I put on a really nice item of clothing that I would normally only wear on a night yes. out. And it really makes me go, whoo, oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, or a really or, or, or a really lovely piece of jewellery, as you say. It just really kind of, ooh, yeah. It's your mood, doesn't it? Yeah, it makes you feel like you're all dressed up to go to the tip. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. to go to the supermarket, <laughs> to walk the dog. I'm going to walk that dog. With your wellies. <laughs> With your wellies on, I love it. Right, where are we going now, lovely? The what, You mean the massive one? Oh, wow. I've never seen one this big. 20 mil. You can put any gemstones on that baby and it'll be able to hold them. I think you could put a... Um, I mean, you could put... A, yeah, literally anything. I'm trying to think of something very big. <laughs> a um, an elephant. Oh, no, maybe not quite an elephant. Uh, but yeah, a bit massive 20 mil magnetic clasp. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, have you ever seen people magnet fishing? People, yeah, magnet, huge, great big thing. I couldn't work out what it was. And then they and then they lifted out bikes, they were lifting out girders, all sorts of stuff. It's amazing. Oh, I've yeah. seen that. Huge, great big magnets, uh, kind of on a big on, on a big kind of crane. <laughs> Knives, all sorts of different <laughs> things. Yeah, it's amazing. Quite a bit. A whole bike. Um, yeah, I mean, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Look at this. Look at the size of that magnet. It's absolutely oh, amazing. Sounds... Now it will pinch your fingers if you get oh gosh, if you get if you get your fingers too close. <coughs> Once you've got your gemstones on there, it's gonna become a lot easier to kind of take that off and put that on. Um, with the early bird special, love that. Absolutely love that. With your really large gems, obviously. Yeah, because some I tend to shy away from a magnetic clasp if my piece is heavy. Mm. So you don't have to Oof. worry with this because I prefer um, a magnetic clasp because yeah. it's easier to get on and off. Yeah. Um, but you wouldn't have to worry with this, would you? Because you know it would be able to hold it. Absolutely. Absolutely. This can hold pretty much anything. Um, it's, it, it's just an amazing class. But, you know, if you're using big, big gemstones or very heavy gemstones or 
Um, as Debbie says, if you want to just know in the back of your mind, yeah, that's not going to come off. There's no way this is coming off. This is absolutely amazing. Heather's got three. Mandy, Emma, well done to you. Gorgeous. Jackie, Maker, Maker C, well done to you. Loads of people coming at, um, at through for that. Well oh. done. Three strands of pearls, anyone? This is the kind of thing you could use with your magnetic clasp. Oh, my gosh. Three strands. The shape of them. I know, right? Sorry, that went really loud. The shape of them. Hopefully there's a delay. Look at them. Ooh. Look at those. Oh, I think they, I want these. I need them. Oh, they're so beautiful. They are so organic. This is what a pearl should be. I love organic pearls. Me too. And that's kind of my design style, isn't it? But I would do what you're doing. I twist them. I might put a little bit of um, space in between or a lovely gem. Oh, Carol's about to make my absolute... Well, I'm either about to make your dreams come true or I'm about to send all of this tumbling down again. Just be fair. No, I'm not, no, not going to pick up that one. <gasps> there we go. Oh, you've done it. Oh, gee whiz. Oh, my goodness. Gee whiz. This is, this is the, this one. Oh, no. this, this, this one. This is this, this one, Carol. This one. This? Look, that's, <gasps> that's my anniversary present right there. Right there. Oh, come on. That is absolutely beautiful. £5,000 in the shop. Remind Saturday. me of your husband's name again. Alex. Alex, sort it out. Come on. He'll be working. He'll be come in on. a meeting or Willie. something. Willie. Willie. Meeting. You need to message him. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> him to sort it out. Three remaining. What, what date is your anniversary? 17th of July. Okay, mine's the 23rd. I can't remember if it's John! 19 or 20 years. <laughs> Oh, oh bless you. It's that many years you've forgotten how many it is. That's about to sell out. How much right. were these? I don't know. What? 20, 20 quid. Sorry, Arlie. Sorry, we were too busy drooling all over them. Sorry. Sunstone Spacer. <laughs> <laughs> we're not listening to them. Sorry. I like that a lot. I love that. You've got no chance. I'm sorry. <laughs> How unusual is that? There you go. Absolutely amazing. Oh, my goodness. I love that. Look at this. There's your drill hole. Oh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Do you know, I was watching, I was watching um, Mickey Flanagan live uh, on, on, on Netflix. <laughs> I mean, a lot, a lot of the stuff... A lot of the stuff I can't actually repeat what he was saying, but he said, you know, you know when, when, when there's a, a gaggle of women... Gaggle. And uh, as a gaggle of women, he says, and the wife invites her friends round, and I'm kind of said, and 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 she, and she says to me, "What are you going to do tonight? Obviously, you're going to go out, and you know, you know, <laughs> off you go." And he goes, and I come home, and I come home from the pub, and one of them's crying, and and the wife comes out and says, "No, you can't come in here. Someone's crying." He goes, "I wasn't actually going to come in anyway. I'm just going to go to bed." <laughs> no, you can't come in here. But it's all about the talking, and just everyone talks over each other. Anyway. Well done. Ten pounds. I heard that, Neary. Ten pounds. You waited for a natural break in the conversation. What gemstone there. is that? Sunstone. Yeah. I love sunstone. Oh, look at that. It's a huge piece of sunstone. I would have that asymmetrically, and I can't believe I just said that, and I've been up since half past three. Asymmetrically <laughs> stranded on a shell, uh, on a pearl length. That looks right. Yeah, that, like those, that, that yeah, sounds yeah, yeah. lovely. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, Sorry, absolutely. I'm not making much sense. No, so kind of there. One there, yeah. maybe one a bit lower down, maybe. Jacqueline Babra, uh, Lisa Maker, Maker in the Highlands, Maker in Cambridge here, Catherine Pauline. Uh, well done to you. There's absolutely loads of you coming through. Well done. Eight seconds. We're taking the details away. Absolutely amazing. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at all those beautiful pearls. What, are, there. what are the little sparkly? I, I assume they're kind of crystals they're or really rhinestones. So I'm not entirely sure. They are really sweet, aren't they? And again, what's nice is so often with these kind of sparkly things, it's A, B. Um, what's nice about this is it's a little bit more. It's neutral. It yeah. looks classy, doesn't it? Classy. I like it. Just like us, Debbie. Classy. Very classy. Look classy with a K. Right. Where are we going, sorry? Clear quartz. ba 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 bicones. Ooh. Yeah. Gemstone bicones. Are they quartz? Oh, you could use these in your CB designs. I, uh, I love this stone. Flat spiral, straight away I'd make with this. Oh, gosh, that sounds lovely. That sounds really nice. You know, the flat spiral, you just Google it if you, if you um, don't know what flat spiral is, but if you're a CBD, you will. A flat spiral, and on the outside of, of the bracelet, you usually put some bicones. So to actually have gemstones instead of glass oh. would be stunning. 
And look at these. These are so crisp and even. Yeah. And um, they've been cut so beautifully. There's no kind of... So you could use them easily with your CB yeah. designs, couldn't you? Absolutely. And on that design, they kind of sit on the outside. So they're not kind of all intricately woven in. They're just... You can really see the sparkle. I think they'd be lovely. How nice is that? Elizabeth Maker in Surrey Maker in Northamptonshire. Pauline in Cornwall. Well done to you. Seven ninety nine, an amazing deal for you today. Absolutely gorgeous. It's a go, go, go. Well done, everybody. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. We need everybody to check out this morning. Good morning, jewellery makers. Who's got that Thursday slash Friday feeling? Yeah. Ollie's got a very exciting day tomorrow because he's got absolutely nothing planned. Oh, that's good. I like those days. He's going to go out for a run. He's going to, oh. I'm sure you can fill your day quite quickly or your wife can. <laughs> can he just do this? Can he just do this? And then can you do this? And then, by the way, can you do that? Yeah. Basically. <laughs> yeah, the grass needs cutting. The grass needs cutting. Got to look after the grass. Neary, where are we going? Ooh. The Cotan Man Fat what, sorry? On the bus. Oh. Oh, come on. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I want. Both shift sides fight over this strand. We'll schedule it, we'll schedule it. We'll schedule it, we'll schedule it. But we're gonna schedule it. And today we've scheduled it, but it's gonna sell out. Yeah. This is Cotan Mutton. Oh my gosh. Hello, little strand. It's beautiful. The quality you are getting here, absolutely beautiful. The graduation of colour, mm. the graduation of tone you are getting here. Absolutely beautiful. Look how dark those ones are. At the, the, inc the incredible uh, greens, the gorgeous um, olive greens, then these gorgeous graphite -y tones. Look at that ombre there. Mm. Isn't that just incredible? Now, you can look at this colour all you like and you can appreciate the variety of tone and the graduation and the ombre all you like. But all you need to really know about this is this is the original jade. This is the original jade that was that was. Oh, it's sold out. The original jade. The, and the, yeah, the shape is beautiful. It does feel very it traditional. Is, the shape is gorgeous. That mm. kind of barrel. Um, it does. It looks traditional. It looks like it came. It's an artifact from years yes, ago. Yes, it looks like it? A, uh, uh, it's been used by the Dalai Lama. Yeah. You know, it's Buddhist, Buddhist kind of prayer beads. Are absolutely beautiful. That in Amala is just the absolute highest quality. Okay, early birds coming up now. This is a short. This is, <laughs> Ollie is so excited about this. <laughs> it's a gorgeous. Fast his fingers fast. It's a gorgeous bundle. <laughs> it's all about <laughs> cherry blossom. <laughs> Your early bird special. Press it now. Oh, press it. You know when you get called out and it's just like, whoo, you can just feel your whole face filling up red, 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 red. Oh, we're doing the bead stoppers first. Okay, fine. We're going to do these bead stoppers first. Right. <laughs> What's better than one bead stopper? Um, ten, please. Thank you. Thank <laughs> Otherwise, we're going to be here all day. Uh, ten bead stoppers. Oh, my gosh. These little suckers are absolutely brilliant. Um, whoever invented these deserves some kind of a prize because how many times, obviously it doesn't happen now, uh, Debbie, because you're a complete professional. This would never happen to you now. But how many times when you were first starting making jewelry, have you got your beading thread and you put your gems on, put your beads on, thought, oh, this is lovely. Why isn't this filling up? Why isn't this thread filling up? And it's because they're all coming off the other end. Yesterday. <laughs> and then you're going, drop to one of your... Then the dog's dogs. trying to drop. eat them. The what? dogs are trying to eat what? them. What, boo? Drop, drop. <laughs> then you put it on the bracelet. Yeah. No one knows. <laughs> covered in dog slobber. <laughs> I love it. 
But that's the thing, isn't it? Um, so often, <coughs> uh, uh, when you're making a piece of jewelry, you're very excited, you know, whether it's an elasticated bracelet or using beading thread, silk, whatever. And the beads are going on one end of the thread and then they're coming off the other. These are great for things like seed beading. Quite often with seed beading, you hear the guest designer, whoever's giving you inspiration, saying, put a stopper bead on. Mm -hmm. And putting that stopper bead on is wonderful. It takes a bit of time. Uh, but uh, to get the stopper bead off, sometimes you've got to unpick it. And if you pulled it a bit tight, it can be quite challenging to get it off. Sometimes you have to cut it off or sacrifice the bead to kind of crush it with your pliers. No more, because here are your bead stoppers. It's a really, really strong spring that will loosen up over time. But effectively, what you've got here are two little kind of handles which you pull apart and then you trap your beading thread in here. So, for instance, what am I going to use here? I've got a piece of, I've just got a tassel, but literally, you just literally pull these apart, put your, put your, um, put your spring over the top, and you'll find that your, I mean, multi, multi strands here, but they will just all be nice and clamped in there and they won't come out, So, which means your beads won't come off the bottom, which is absolutely brilliant. And if you're doing a symmetrical design and you say you've got your tiger tail laid out and you've got yeah. your focal bead and you don't necessarily want to crimp one side because you're going to be putting equal beads on both sides. Oh, yeah, okay. And, but you don't want them to fall off while you're working on one side so that you can duplicate it on the other, then you pop these on instead of sort of committing to your clasp until your design's ready i think that's a great idea because otherwise you've then got to undo the whole yep, necklace exactly. and then re-thread it that's a really that's a really really good point um, you get 10 of your base metal bead stoppers they're absolutely brilliant um i would say as well the ones we've done in the past have had little kind of tags on the end here which are a little bit more comfortable to use if you've got any polymer clay or anything like that and you want to put some polymer or anything uh, masking tape or insulation tape whatever it might be um uh, then then please please do the more you use them the looser they will get they'll be quite stiff at first but they will loosen up a little bit um they're absolutely brilliant also can i just say as well um i know a lot of people um, uh, you know, when you're having your craft stores, you're looking for kind of new and innovative ways of maybe putting photographs of your jewellery or whatever it might be. You could literally just get kind of a two poles, kind of almost like a washing line kind of thing. And these would be great to oh, yes, put uh, photographs in, things like that. So I've got the Wall of Fame here, but just imagine for a second that that's a, that's a photograph of me and Debbie. And, uh, you know, you want to... <laughs> I don't know. You want to kind of just pop making your, um, pop your, yes, making jewellery, enjoying our jewellery making process. Literally just pull this apart and, and, you know, you've got it there and you can kind of hang it up. That's on a genius. Little, there you go. Genius. We can stick it into something and there's your price point on there as well. Absolutely fantastic. They're great, aren't they? I know, spot the mum. There you go. Um, give me Tupperware. I can use it for a billion different things. Thank there you, you go. Uh, so, 10 of your base metal bead stoppers, Jane, Dawn, Heather, Regine, uh, Christine, Florence, Mary, in Cardiff, Mary in Greater London, Lynn, well done to you, absolutely fantastic. Oh, there we go, Neary's weekend's massively improved, he's going to be pushing hard for a curry. Ooh. You're going to have a curry, are you? Yeah, if you do have that curry, you're not going to need to do any pushing. Uh, well done, everyone, <laughs> coming through. Seven ninety nine, and we're not done. Oh. We're not done with the price point. There you go, everyone. Lots and lots of people coming through. They are just useful things. It's like having another pair of hands. Isn't I've it? got loads of them, and I was I have them like next to me, and I have them in in this toolbox and in that tray, and la la la. And I I've never got enough. Mm. Also, um, can I just say as well? If you do things like kumahimo and you've got your kumahimo yeah, board you with your weights wait. that you need to hang from the bottom of the cords, this is great to hold tension with. So you put your little uh, weights through there or tie a little weight onto that. Yeah. And yes, I mean, it will come apart ever so slightly, but not massively. And it's not going to get in your way as much. Yeah, agree. Um, so £4.99, there you go. Amazing deal for you today. Well done, Patricia, Wend, Maker, Lorraine. If you want to, you can even make jewellery out of these. I mean, I don't, know, I don't know how it's necessarily going to look, but, you know, why not? It's all base metal. They, they will be quite stiff when you get them, but they will loosen up a little bit, uh, kind of, the more, that you, uh, the more that you use them. But they're absolutely brilliant. Well done. Loads in baskets. Anne in Aberdeenshire, Sue in Essex, Angela, Karen, Patricia, Wend, Lorraine, Lynn, Karen, Anne. Loads and loads and loads of you with these in your baskets. Karen and John, well done to you. Florence, Mary, Jane. I think for people who are into all sorts of different kind of hobbies as well, this is going to be absolutely brilliant, but yeah. just a really useful thing to have. I think if you've never 
if you've used them, then, you know, I'm preaching to the converted. But mm. if you've never used them before, once you get these, you're going to wonder how you ever lived without them. Absolutely. Honestly, I think I use mine when I'm making jewellery almost every single time for one thing or another. Absolutely. Because I think what's going to hold that. And the other thing is, you know, when you get the beautiful ombre strands yeah. of the small bees and you only use half of them or a quarter. Yes, a great idea. You don't want to take them off, do you? And then have to ombre them again. Pop these on the end so that you can keep your ombre strands. You're a legend. Intact. Yes. If you're if you're using only just a few off a strand of something, you don't want to kind of way. ruin that, do you? Yes. String it. That's such a great. That's what a great point. Let's say with the gorgeous pearls that we just bought, you those three strands of pearls. You use, uh, you know, you know, use five off one strand, and you don't want them all to come off. So yeah, use your bead stoppers. Mm. Great, great thought that one. Uh, well done, everyone. Four pounds ninety nine pence. You know, that's this will good. become. That's good price. Yeah, it's a great deal, isn't it? And these will become as useful in your man drawer if you've got a man drawer at home as your blue tack or your or yeah, your exactly. tape or yeah. your or your safety pins, whatever. Uh, just wonderful. Four ninety nine. Well done. We're taking those details away in just literally a few seconds well done please do uh check out well done to you heather penny maker susanna maker maker Anne, wend lorraine lynn do you have any weekend treats that you normally have any kind of weekend dishes food. or food or or drinks or any what, what do you normally have I, 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 this sounds so boring, but I like a really lovely salad. It's all I really want because I don't eat meat. So you really take the time over making it. You know, and... like with um, some, uh, oh, come on, Nuts. little seeds Jeez. in the seeds that are in the fruit, pomegranate seeds, Ooh. and halloumi, and oh. some soy sauce, and oh, it's making me hungry. And I just absolutely love salad, and then maybe a really lovely fruit salad. Like take some time. Oh, over. take the time. And Gorgeous. And a glass of sparkling wine to ruin all the goodness. Oh, but come on. <laughs> come on, life's too short, yeah, isn't it? Absolutely. Not to enjoy the really, really good stuff. Well done, everyone. Four ninety nine. Well done. Heather's got two. Anne's got two. Well, sorry, Sarah Anne's got two. Janet's got two. Well done to you. Gorgeous. Text in, what do you reward yourself with at the weekend? Any kind of dishes or any kind of uh, any kind of uh, foods, any kind of drinks or any kind of activities? What do you what do you reward yourself with at the weekend? Michael, you can't answer this one. It's a family show. <laughs> right, OK. OK. <laughs> Message is coming through. I can just see a little smirk on Michael's face then. No, you can't answer that question. Uh, hi, ladies. Hi. These are great when putting your designs uh, up to the neckline so yeah. they don't drop off. Exactly. Because you hold it and then you drop one side. I oh. Mean, because, you know, you're trying really hard to hold it and you can't help it. Or if you want to display your strands on a bust, maybe at a craft fair saying, I've got this strand, this strand, yeah. this strand, and you just want to clip them at the back. Mm. Great. A million and one, a multitude of different uses. Shall we do our second early bird special? I love this. This is gorgeous. It's all to do with cherry blossoms. It's absolutely beautiful. The recording's gorgeous. Use it. Don't eat it. But it's absolutely <laughs> gorgeous. Here we go. Right, so the most amazing cherry blossom. I had to get some photographs of cherry blossoms. Oh my word! I had to. Oh, oh yeah, 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 I love yeah, yeah, yeah. them. I like standing under these trees when the wind blows and all, oh. the, all the blossoms come down on you. And my kids walk away and go, "Oh, for goodness sake, mother!" Oh, it's beautiful. The Japanese and um, the samurai warriors used to believe that the cherry blossom is 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 the is the flower of perfection because it, like the samurai warrior, it falls at the moment of perfection, oh. and it is the most beautiful, uh, the most beautiful beautiful color palette it can be bright pink like my ornamental cherry tree is bright bright yeah. bright pink or it can be white with a hint of pink it's just it's just the first quite often it's the first it doesn't like a wisteria doesn't it no it is a cherry blossom i think it's that kind of willowiness of the tree on the bottom left oh wisterias are beautiful aren't they oh, they're yeah. gorgeous um uh they are um 
normally, well, not the first sign of spring, but, um, you know, because you've got snowdrops and crocuses, but it's one of the first beautiful colours that you see, kind of pinky colours okay. that you see of the year. I have to say, I love this recording. Ollie, Ollie, and um, Ollie got a uh, column me this morning said, Carrie, you've got to see the recording of this incredible bundle. It's so beautiful. Now, you've got the, you've got the beautiful coated, the two strands of coated agate, which are, it's fairly obvious which ones they are, the bright kind of pinky purpley one, and then the one which is um, slightly more kind of um, silvery gray, this one here. And then you get cherry blossom agate, which I'm going to take that. Uh, I'm going to take these two away. These are so beautiful. It's like morganite, mm. rose quartz, kunzite, moonstone, <gasps> all together. Uh, the way the light pools in these gems is just absolutely beautiful. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous gem, isn't it? Totally natural, by the way. Very calming, uplifting stone. I mean, mm. I don't know about the properties, but that's what I'm getting from looking at it. And that's how it makes me feel. And I just think that you can go so many different directions with this. You can add more pink and really make it cherry blossom. Or you can just add sort of your metal in there, your metal spacer bees, and then mm. use the other colours. So I think it's really versatile. Do you get all these three together or are they separate? All three together, oh, okay. Debbie. I love them. All three together. And they work so beautifully together, don't they? They They're really just gorgeous. do. By all means, if you want to kind of uh, take this one out and maybe replace it with a, I don't know, or oh, I don't know what else we've got. Oh, we haven't got many other gems. Oh, the blue topaz. Mm. If you want to put the blue topaz in there, then you absolutely can do. Oh, yeah. Or oh, the gorgeous mystic. Um, absolutely stunning. Look at that. Oh, there's your mystic coming up. I'm also going to show you the conch with the agate because the conch has got moments of pinks in it but it's also got moments of kind of orangey coral kind of apricot tones in there as well which is absolutely beautiful can you be careful with my anniversary present <laughs> <laughs> i know right <laughs> oh That's, oh yes. yes that is like the translucent version of conch yes oh my gosh they look amazing yeah, together <gasps> oh my gosh look at that oh. we've literally just found its twin We've just found it's twin. That's amazing. Oh, that is basically the translucent version of conch. Mm. They have to go together. They have to, have to, have to go together. <gasps> they literally look, yeah. they, they look like they're made they're perfect. for each other. They're perfect. Look, oh, <gasps> yes. I love the oranges in there, don't you? The apricot yes, tones. Oh my gosh, the peaches with the conch. Amazing. It offsets each other doesn't it because they're sort of translucent and oh yes translucent and opaque yeah most definitely <gasps> it holds its own doesn't it yeah oh yeah branca onyx that's a nice combination yes absolutely here we go 29.99 is not your deal today uh this is for the three strands we've got here so for the cherry blossom agate for your two strands of coated agate as well here we go you're going to love this. £19.99. Utterly, utterly, utterly brilliant. Well done to everyone coming through to get this. We've got London, West Sussex. We've got County Durham. We've got Warwick. We've got Essex. We've got another one in, uh, another bidder, sorry, in Essex. Another one. Another bidder in Essex. Another maker coming through with three in the basket. West Sussex, well done to you as well. Um, What's nice about this um, as well, I, I can imagine these with the Heshies as well. Yeah. Um, they'd look really lovely with some of the bright colours or really massively contrasting colours as well. Also with the nine o'clock kits as well. We've got gorgeous nine o'clock kits coming up um, uh, today. Jacqueline in Merseyside, Maker, well done to you as well. Uh, Maker's got two there, well done to you. Guess what? 19.99, brilliant, amazing, incredible. We're not done. All this is going to disappear, by the way, in just a few minutes. So please, please, please add as much as you can onto your order. Hertfordshire, we've got another maker there as well. Well done to you. Lisa's got two in their basket. Maker's now got four in their basket. We're taking that price point down. Simple jewellery, twisted jewellery, bubble, bubble style, style pieces. Yeah, it'd be lovely. How lovely would that be? Yvonne? Uh, in Shropshire, well done to you, my lovely Northamptonshire. We've got Sean through Heather in Essex, Linda in Greater London. Well done to you. Taking that price point down. Message us as well. What are your lovely, what, what are the lovely things you like to do at the weekend? Is there anything nice you like to eat? Or, or do you always have a roast dinner? Do you always uh, have a lovely glass of wine or something? Maybe on a Friday night? What is it? Let us know because our weekend starts here today. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, let us know how you love to celebrate your weekends in your in your in your in your lives in your in your homes around the country. Let us know. Well done, everybody. Five seconds and the price point's going down. Here we go. Neary's on the ball today. 
Who's on the ball? 14.99. Oh my gosh, that's five pounds a strand. That's a good price. Very good price. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Loving that. 14.99 for all three strands. Amazing. A fiver per strand. Now, I know this sounds like an obvious thing to say, but a tree of life. Oh, yes. For your cherry blossom. There you go. Look at all these in baskets. Oh, my gosh. Check out as soon as you can. Vera, check out, my lovely. You've got too many baskets there in Tyne and Weir. Check out as quickly as you can, everybody. Well done, everyone. There you go. At $14.99. What a trip. $14.99 just for the cherry blossom agate is absolutely amazing, isn't it? But it's not just for that strand. It's for all three strands. It does look a bit like Sakota. Yeah, a bit like the Sakota um, uh, agate as well, doesn't it? Not that I've ever done a showcase of Sakota Agate. I've just seen it. I've just seen it. Uh, but there we go. Uh, well done. $14.99. Absolutely beautiful quality. There you go, everyone. 0800 644 655. Or get involved on our website, jewelrymaker.com. Or download our app and watch us on the go. Have we got our technical issues sorted? I think, I think we, we haven't. Oh, still a couple of technical issues. What a, what a shame. Me and my husband have not cooked a Sunday roast for months. <gasps> We reward ourselves by going out to eat. Ooh, oh, nice. Mandy. I like Lovely. That Do you know what? Nothing beats a good carvery, I think. Oh, Sunday morning, I get it before everyone else and sit in my dressing gown with a cup of tea outside if it's fine, watching the sparrows playing. Diane, that sounds absolutely heavenly. <gasps> Just gorgeous. How lovely. Because my job is very stressful, I like to be lazy and relaxed at the weekend. So I either make jewellery or I do diamond painting. Mandy, what a lovely way to relax. Very, very mindful, isn't it? I mean, really yeah. mindful. I How just gorgeous. think that crafting it is just that, isn't it? Yeah. Absolutely. And Mandy, what a great way to de-stress. You're really looking after yourself by doing that as well. Really enjoy taking that time uh, for yourself, Mandy. Well done, sweetie. Um, OK, so loads and loads and loads of people coming through to get these now. This is really good to see you. Uh, let us know what you love doing at the weekend. How do you reward yourself? Is it with uh, a nice walk or do you like to go and do certain things or do you like to uh, eat certain things? Whatever it is, let us know. <clears throat> I literally spend my Saturdays just racing around Warwickshire. Yeah, I like to kind of, if I can, get out to the woods because Yorkshire's beautiful. We're very lucky. Oh, yes. Just get out to the woods with the dogs and, you know, go on the paths that only the local people know about where it's quiet. And... Do you know what? And, um, and uh, Alison was saying yesterday, she lives within 15 minutes of the mountains, oh, uh, kind of the coast, uh, the woods, uh, the heath. You know, it's just, mm, oh, just beautiful. how lovely. How gorgeous. Get outside. Get outside. Um... So, uh, well done, everybody. All these items are going to, yeah, after the break, they're going to disappear. We've still got technical issues. Really sorry about that. We're going to try and jump on that uh, over the break. Gorgeous, gorgeous kits coming up next with the most beautiful strands and, of course, gorgeous seed beads. We'll see you in a sec. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. 
Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Amazing. <laughs> Jewelry maker kits. Right. See beads in kits. There's just going to go b -b 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 bonkers. Also, on the website, as it stands at the minute, we've got all of the things in this are on pre order. Basically. All of the things. All of the things. All of them. Including last in stock jade, including all these gorgeous kits. Just go. Go. Go to the website, jewelrymaker.com, click on Watch Live, scroll down, look at all of their today's deals. Uh, or buy ahead or whatever it says. Buy ahead, I think it says. Coming up on today's show. And then scroll down and you can see all the incredible items we've uh, put on pre-order. we got things like this. Oh, yes, hello. I know. Hello. And things hello. like that. Ooh, things like you and you. And you. And you and you and ba ba ba. There we go. So loads and loads and loads of incredible gemstones. Look at that mookite. I love mookite. Love, 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 love. Love amethyst. Love everything. I love these. It's, that's spiny oyster turquoise, isn't it? Oh, come on. One of my faves. Fave. <laughs> oh. Those, oh, Ollie, oh my gosh. Yeah. That recording should, should come as some kind of a disclaimer. <laughs> oh, look, though. Oh, hello. <gasps> look at that one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, no, I can't cope. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. There's so much ooing and aahing going on at that, oh, that one. There's, come on. There it is, my anniversary present. And there's my other that anniversary opens, present. That, op that opens, <laughs> I by know, the way. Ollie I know, me. I know, I know, I know, I know. Oh, look, no, look. Oh. oh. I know. Just, It's yes. all on pre-order. Oh. Okay. Jewelrymaker.com. Scroll down. Doesn't look like a viewer's choice. It's not. It's just on pre-order. It's just all on pre-order. That's this sock jade. Cabs, donuts. Yeah, we will be crashing them. Face tree, uh, green jade donut. Black jade. Oh my gosh, so much lovely stuff. <gasps> lavender Ooh, jade. I like the lavender jade. Yeah, red jade. Oh. I know. Bangles. Look at that little bear. 
Amazing. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. These, by the way, these kits are brand new. Never been, never been seen before. Brand new for today's show. Brand new for these incredible kits. Brand, brand, brand new. Here's the cunt. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Oh, these prices are all going to drop. Oh, deal of the day on pre-order. Oh, Neary, what are you doing? All of the deals of the day on pre-order. I know, there's so much. Gosh, she's still going. Oh my word. But this is not viewer's choice. You can get this at any time, but if you want, if you really want something, get it. Oh gosh, and the 12 o'clock kids. Oh my gosh. Neary, just stop it enough for, oh, look at the mystic topaz. Yeah. All on pre-order. Beautiful. It's a go, go, go. Right, should we start with these gorgeous kits? No. Oh, it's this. I've got it. I beg your pardon. Is it this? I beg your pudding. Oh, you obviously don't get this CBs. Now, someone may have put this together that's not so far away because I think it's a staple. It's um, the beading board. Hang on. What, 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 is, what is going on? Because I think you need this. Like, if you're starting out, if you, like, look, this is just perfecto. Fireline, size 10 beading needles, and this absolutely brilliant beadboard. I've never used it before. Hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is this it? is a kit. Yeah. A kit. It's a kit. This is awesome. It's a kit. You have to get this. Because if you don't, somebody else will. Absolutely ridiculous. It's a go, go, go. It's a kit. Um, this, by the way, do you, do, do, do you know what this is for? Isn't it for just putting your beads and so that you can... If you're putting your beads in and also... Yes, sorry. And also kind of uh, <laughs> mapping out your pieces. So this is your bead board that you are going to get. There is... Um, plastic on all of uh, the underside of all of these little pieces here which you need to peel off but basically you take all of these off so here's your you can uh, uh, lay out and plan out your bracelets necklaces it's so cool. also stops your beads from rolling around and it's sparkly and pink which is great here's your little um here's your little uh, uh tray to put your um seed beads in um uh, to put your different gemstones in gorgeous there we go little inserts here which you can use for whatever yeah right um Ruler. Here's your gorgeous ruler, again, with the little kind of apertures to put your beads in, your little gauge, your centimetre ruler, and here's your beading tray to put all your uh, to put all your gemstones in and to, to do your beading in. You can start to re-put these in, in whatever, wh whichever way you like, whichever configuration you like, okay? And you also get Fireline yep. in this lovely smoke grey, and you also get, as you said, um, Debbie, size 10, uh, sorry, 12. Oh, 12, right. Size 12, six size 12 beading needles as well, which is utterly brilliant. These have got coloured eyes on them, so it's easier to see where the holes are. So if you know, like a lot of people started doing, um, when I did my Capriccio bracelet the other day, a, a load of people started doing seed beading, because I know, because they've shown me what they're doing, and they've said I've never done it before. So I thought, right, what do you need when you get sussed out to make your life so much easier that you know you're always going to use and i so i put this together there you go and i asked if we could do this so um, debbie kershaw making i just think yes for this making meaningful meaningful kits really useful items for everybody to get involved with whether you are yeah if you buy all of this individually this should be your price point all of it individually yeah here we go so here's your gauge Really, really helpful, helpful this is. Let me get this up. Here we go. So you can put your uh, three, four, five, all the way up to 12 mil beads in there. So you've got your lovely gauge. That's well, really useful great. because you might think, oh, yes, I can see that that's a four mil or a three mil by eye. Especially if you're doing a seed bead project where the pattern calls for a certain size bead. And then you can double check. So if you don't have calipers, which usually is just kind of a metal smith. Yeah. Tool, you can just pop these. Here um, we go. This, this is, really looks cool. much nicer when you take the plastic <laughs> off there. There you go. 
Absolutely. What we're going to do today, we're going to do everything for the price of the board. So it should be oh, 44 really? 99 Everything else is absolutely free of charge. So you get your fire line and your needles absolutely free of charge. Oh, this is just so cool. These are like little chopping boards, aren't they? These little, um, these little kind of um, cutouts here. They're so cute, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They're... Um, really, really what's useful. What's that question? Is the bead board made from hard plastic or is it flexible? It's hard plastic. Hard plastic. And you can remove all like the Like an acrylic, pieces. isn't it? So, like, if you want to, like, some people buy these on their own, don't they? Yeah. So, if you, you've got something going on that bead board and you want to put this on this bead board, so I've got all mine laid out over there, but if I wanted to pop... So, what I do is I put my sort of seed beads, my project in, and then I can just pick them up and then that can go back to the other board. So, every single... Oh, Inside, oh, yeah, you can move about. So if you've got a project where you want the whole circumference, just take them out. Here's your deal today. You're getting the fire line and the needles absolutely free of charge all the way down. Here we go. You're today thirty four ninety nine. Oh, that's amazing. Amazing. Wasn't that what the bead board cost originally? Yep, yep, yep. So you get the fire line and you get the uh, needles absolutely free of charge. That's absolutely brilliant. Veronica, Simon, uh, Tahima, uh, Anne, Maker, Paula, Catherine, Shan, Maeve, Maker, Nicola. Well done to all of you today. Absolutely brilliant. You know what's well really done. good as well that I found with this is you know when you use a bead board, you tend it, um, a, a felt one or a material one, it tends to get dirty, doesn't it? Yeah. Like with this, you can just wipe it clean. Nice. You can take the the felt out you can wash that if you want to let me to. show you um and i think that's really important because quite often you won't use a bead board yeah. will you because it's got all dirty and you don't really want to you don't know how to clean it so we're already at the price of the board uh, which is amazing uh, but we are uh gonna take it even lower oh wow okay. oh gosh uh so uh yeah there you go so you can take the felt out you I can mean, clean by all everything means, and, and you can clean it by all means if you want to take the adhesive kind of um is that, is that adhesive or not? I don't know. Oh, no, I don't think it is. So, you, so, so get easy enough to it. take that off there. Um, and, then, and then just clean and then clean uh, that. Just wipe it down, put the felt back in. You're good to go. Fantastic. We're going to give you a saving. There you go. $29.99. Absolutely brilliant. What a great, great, great board. How much has it gone to? $29.99 okay, for the lot. that's a super deal. Yeah, that is that's absolutely amazing. Lower than the price point of the actual bundle. This will make your life and the actual board. easier. I, I've messed about with felt in the past and tried to write ABC when I'm doing a seed bead project and kind yes. of then glue bits of felt on top of each other. Yes, and exactly. You, you know, whereas you've actually got this already done with your little windows Yeah. and you can just pop whatever you want yeah absolutely uh, did linda have something to do with this or uh, Sheila? quite possibly some, somebody who knows what beaders need as yes put together yeah yeah they, yeah they? you're absolutely right gorgeous well done taking those details away in a minute time avril monica june uh kathy chandy uh, june tina sean mave thomas elaine catherine veronica virginia uh, well done to all of you there. Absolutely brilliant. Yeah, make sure, do make sure you take the little plastic uh, kind of bits off off the um, thing because they don't look very nice. And it They're just, very it's just... good for stencils, those little plastic oh, bits. Oh, you know, yeah, like, good call. A lot of people are, are crafters, aren't they? Also, if you're wanting to cut out copper sheets or something and you're wanting a mm. perfect rectangle, I always keep things like that because you never know when you're going to need them, do you? Yeah, exactly. That, that's exactly it. So, yeah, these are really, really useful little things as well. They're like tiny little Sylvanian family chopping boards, I think. <laughs> Gorgeous, aren't they? So sweet. Well done, everybody. <laughs> Message us, what do you like to do at the weekend? What do you like to reward yourself uh, with at the weekend? Do you like to see certain people? Do you like to listen to certain radio shows? Or do you like uh, watching certain things? We are way, 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 way over allocated. Loads of people there. Well done. Nearly likes a curry at the weekend. Oh, yes. Why not? Well done, everyone. Gorgeous. About to sell out. If you want it, you need to, to check out because they, we haven't got enough. Yeah, there's loads and loads and loads of you with these in baskets. Please check out as soon as you can. People with multiples in there as well. Go, go, go. All of us today have been on about this kit. It is so good. Ocean's treasure. Mm. Purple spiny oyster turquoise. Oh, my gosh. Lovely photo. Spiny oyster turquoise, um, or purple spiny oyster turquoise, is when you get a fusion of um, turquoise and the spiny oyster shell. Um, and you get that incredible kind of fusion of colours, fusion, almost mosaic work. It's yes. like um, 
It's like gorgeous, kind of Gaudi's gorgeous mosaic work, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. The most amazing colours, the most gorgeous purples and oranges and blues and greens. And then look at the seed beads you're getting. Matte metallic blue iris. These are brand new kits, brand new strands. It's all brand new. Are you sure there's enough time in today's show for everything on pre-order? I know, Collector in We've London. got to get a move on. I know, there's loads. There's absolutely loads on pre-order. Already got people with this in their baskets. That's great to see. Well done. Here we go. So... Five seconds. But and we're going to be giving you the most amazing deal today. Excuse me, don't be laughing at the name of this kit because somebody who's sitting here named this kit. Oh, you abs... Oh. <laughs> Make it in London, well done to you. Absolutely gorgeous. Cheryl in South Yorkshire, well done to you as well. Loads and loads of people coming through. Abs never, oh, never mind the turquoise. Look at the glorious beast. I know! Absolutely gorgeous. Linda, well done to you. Pauline, well done to you. Carol, well done to you. Janet, well done to you. 1999. I know, that's amazing. Oh my gosh, Did absolutely they, amazing. Virginia they remind Janet, well me done. of the, um, the glinting you get on the waves. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, like when the sun hits the waves and it's a bit of a hippie name. <laughs> yeah, it's gorgeous. <laughs> well done, Mary. Well done, Maker. Well done, another Maker in Oxfordshire as well. Well done to you, Julian County Durham, Susan and Kent, Maker. Oh my gosh, there's loads and loads and loads of you coming through to get this. Well done, Julie. Ah, oh, 31 chances remaining. That's such a good price. Wow. We started with 72 of these. Look at the quantity. Absolutely flying. Heather, or Elaine, Pauline, well done to you. Absolutely loads of you coming through to get this. Isn't that gorgeous? Well done. I can't believe all of that for 20 quid. So lovely. I've just added Excuse some um, spaces either side of these gorgeous um, oyster turquoise. So simple. And I just think with, I don't know, strands like this, I like to wear them in, because I like to lay in my necklaces, as you know. And I like, to, and I've seen the designers are doing a lot of this sort of thing in sort of a slightly longer than choker. So sort of how I'm wearing it now and then layering um, just with lovely gemstones. You don't have to be too complicated, do yeah, you? Yeah, you're absolutely like right. This. This is it. Keep it simple. And I think that sometimes with sea beads, as you say, um, Debbie, um, you don't need to use them in, in, in kind of intricate weaves no. or spirals. Just using them as beads. They're and functional. They're lovely. Yeah, they're lovely. See, I'd love that as a bracelet. As a necklace, it's lovely, but as a wraparound yeah. bracelet, that would look really, really nice. It's so beachy as well. So organic. Um, and just so... Um, the purple brings something different to it. It brings obviously a depth to it, but it's just looks gorgeous. Neil and Linda's got two. Well done to you. Beautiful kit. Thank you so much for that, Debbie. Well done. Uh, Mary and Jerry, Linda, Stephanie, Rosita, Tina. Well done to you, Pauline. Well done to you, Elaine. May oh, no, they're the baskets. Oh, gosh, no. Check out. Check out. Check out, Belinda. Check out Linda and Belinda and Stephanie. Check out, my lovelies. Well done, everybody. Absolutely gorgeous. And so, seeing as you've just got one strand and the seed beads and you're paying less, then you can decide what else you want to add from your stash. That's the idea. Sure. Whereas if you put a couple of strands together, people might think, oh, I wouldn't have put that with that. Mm. Yeah. So you can yeah. add your little designer flair to this. Absolutely. Add your own uh, character to it. Bring yourself to the jewellery. Helen has got two. Soraya's got two. Well done to you as well. South Yorkshire's got two. Dawn, Janet, well done to you. Absolutely awesome. Go, 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 go. What a treat for you today. Janet, well done to you. Gorgeous. Right, next. Which one are we doing now? Oh, Mookite. Love <gasps> this Mookite. Oh, this is such a cool stone. Such a cool stone. Yeah, lovely shape. There's rhubarb and custard colours here. If you were born after the 1980s, <laughs> you have no idea what, what that is. <laughs> so gorgeous mookite. Absolutely beautiful. Showing my age now. Oh. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at these beautiful kind of um, Spanish olive colours. Isn't this a lovely shape, this olive kind of smooth, you know, kind of olivey oval shape? How they sit when they're worn, they sit flat. Very, very comfortable necklace. to wear. So very simple piece of jewellery to make because you're just using your white as spacers. And then again, I've added some metal uh, beads either side, but it could be silver or gold. And I just think this is something that I would put on a lot and layer um yeah and i think 
think you've got neutral colours there. I'm just looking at it next to the Keshi, uh, sorry, the, um, sorry, not, not Keshi, the Heshi beads. I would mix the Heshi beads, those gorgeous yes. tan colours in with this as well. That would be really nice. That would be lovely. I'm so lucky. Since retiring, every day is like the weekend. The week is punctuated by bin day. Uh, funny though, I never seem to get much done. You sound like my husband. Oh, oh, bin day. When's bin day? Bin day. I know my, my husband gets back. Oh, is it recycling? I'm like, yes, it is, John. Yes, it is. Oh, good. It always feels good when you kind of get that recycling bin out or the, or the food waste caddy. It's been festering down, yeah, yeah. down, the, down the side alley. Uh, there you go. Gorgeous. Well done to you. Oh, there you go. But you've, you've got these gorgeous frosted seed beads. Mm. You can barely see them in that design there. Um, uh, they've got, uh, they almost disappear, don't they, and become invisible. It almost looks like an illusion necklace that you've made there because of this frosted kind of finish. And you don't want, I don't think, to detract from the amazing colours no. in each and every one of those Mookites. So I absolutely love Mookite. And I'm also, these are really tactile, these beads, aren't they? Because of their shape, they're incredibly smooth. So... I thought, let's just put white with them, and it just, it's just yeah. a match made in heaven, really. Isn't that gorgeous? Uh, Woohoo! YouTube is back. I know, isn't that great? 1999. Well done, everyone. Go what are you doing? Oh, we're going to go lower. 30 oh, okay. second clock. Oh, I tell you what, you know, Binday is bin day one of my favourite days of the week, uh, but, uh, but there's nothing quite like the panic on my husband's face when uh, you can hear the bin lorry <laughs> yes. outside. He's like, I haven't put the bins out. Literally staggering out of bed, putting some pants on, yep. running out in his flip flops. Wait, wait. <laughs> and uh, yeah, the bin men must see people in all yeah, sorts of states <laughs> of undress. So funny. <laughs> My neighbour came running out the other day with a baby on her hip in her dressing gown because she'd obviously, Where? bless her, she's got four kids. I bet she thought, oh no, I can't not have them. Can't not have them collect the bins, exactly. <laughs> you need to download your local council's uh, waste collection app, uh, Ollie, like I do. I get told which bins are when and oh, That's it's good. just, it makes my life so much easier. Pauline and Carolyn had dawned, well done to you as well. £14.99. and pence. Well done, makers there as well. There's absolutely loads of people coming through today. So good to have you all with us. Well done. £14.99. pence. Well done, everybody. Still got three more kits to do. Which one are we going to do now, Nearina? Oh, Elaine, well done to you as well. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at this gorgeous frosted quality of the CB. It adds something so... That's, this is a 23 gram, approximately, tube of 11 OC. Oh, oh. Sorry, 8 OC. So these are 11. Uh, they're 11 OC. 11 OC beads. So even if you're not going to use them with your mukai, there's so many things that you can use them for, um, especially when it comes up to Christmas, doing your snowflakes, doing your icicle designs. Absolutely. That kind of the fact that they're frosted as well gives them such a different quality. Um, they almost look like sea glass. Um, Absolutely beautiful. I can't believe it. £12.99. £12.99. Not supposed to be the price. I know. And do you know what? You know, uh, lovely <laughs> Debbie made these kits. She knows how much uh, she knows how much these uh, kits cost to make. And uh, yeah, we're not making any money at that See, price. See, it has to it has to say nice things in my own. Then he'll wait till I leave. Then he'll say the true things. We love you, Debbie. We love you, Debbie. Here we go. <laughs> right, next kit. The black obsidian. Yeah, this one's lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Look at the state of this black obsidian. On the recording, it looks lovely, shiny and oval. Oh, Look great. at the size be flat. of yeah. those ovals. They are amazing. They are so large, aren't they? They are lovely. Um, I think I might have haloed these with the pink if I had time, but I didn't. So I think that you can actually what go around. What a lovely around. idea. I, I wanted a real pop of colour, but obviously you can use these with some pearls and be really kind of Chanel-esque. Oh, you yes, like. you absolutely can. The, the nice thing is about these kits is that they all kind of interchange beautifully. So if you want to use the white seed beads or the... Or the I gorgeous, think those two uh, together would be stunning. Lovely. Yeah, look at that. Lovely, lovely. Um, it's entirely up to you, but uh, yeah, that pink. Oh, that's a really lovely pink. It's described as... Special dyed bright pink. I would say a tropical pink. That's like a tropical pink. Mm. That's like a, a rum punch pink. If you like, you know, when you get rum punch kind of pink or you get a, it's like a Harry Styles pink. Yeah. Oh <laughs> my gosh. I love Harry Styles. And, uh, and it's, and it's very, it's very, um, I, I have to stop looking at photographs of him. Cause I think, I think he's absolutely gorgeous to look at. And I have to keep reminding myself that he is a lot younger than I am. Uh, but, um, but um, uh, yeah, on the way back from London the other night, we'd been to a gig and uh, we went past Wembley Stadium. Harry Styles had just finished playing. Uh, oh my gosh, the amount of pink feather boas and cowboy oh, really? hats. Oh, really? Oh my gosh. 
Um, here we go, everybody. Price point, price point, price point. Amazing. Do you know what? Amazing. We're going to take this straight, straight down for you today. Amazing. This is a great way to add a pop of colour. If you, you know, you don't wear a lot of colour in your wardrobe and you just want to add a pop of colour, nice kind of tangy, <laughs> zesty, beautiful pop of colour. Yes. You can do it with your jewellery, can't you? Absolutely. The only other colour I'd probably put with this is maybe some orange. Yeah. Put some orange with this. Oh, that would really go with what you're wearing today the as well. The Heshies would go with this. Yes, you know, nice. Because all the colours of those. Absolutely. Yeah, those Heshies, uh, those Heshies would be absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Doesn't that look gorgeous? But you're right. That pop of colour makes all the difference of these. Well done, everybody. And that's a beautiful strand of obsidian. This is basically foss, um, uh, kind of, um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, natural volcanic glass. Such an exciting quality. Gorgeous. Well done. Okay. Two more kits. Which one? Blah, blah, blah. Here we go. So gorgeous blue seed beads. These are 110 blue lined crystal luster. Oh, so they're like a, look at this. So a lovely kind of um, frosted yeah. finish on there. Yeah. To bring out kind of the, the shimmering of the moonstone. Mm, yeah, absolutely. And then a oh. strand of the most amazing sky moonstone. Oh no, the, the, the most beautiful uh, moonstone. Look at this moonstone. I thought it was called Sky Moonstone as well. No, it's Moonlit Sky, because oh. that's what it makes me think of. Oh, Debbie. <laughs> it's all right, I'm not doing kits anymore. You don't have to have any more of these hippie <laughs> names after today. I love it. <laughs> I, love I was it. only helping out. I love it. I think it's a <laughs> They'll go back to normal kit. after today. It's a gorgeous <laughs> kit. And do you know what? It's kind of almost willow patterny as well, isn't it? Well, it just reminded me of a Moonlit Sky. Yeah, and I have to say, when you've got when you've got those two colours together, that nautical kind of combination yeah. of blues and whites. Do you know what? I, where was I? I was at my local kind of retail park the other day. The amount of people wearing blue and white stripes. It's just it, it, it's it's a very it's, classic. It's almost it? like a summer uniform, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Uh, that people go to. It is a classic look, and you know, we, you know, we've all got a white shirt or a white t-shirt, white vest, and we've all got a, you know, you know, jeans or whether it's a denim skirt or whatever it might be. That is a lovely, lovely necklace you've made there. They're so sweet. They look like little forget-me-nots. Little forget-me-nots. Oh, good. Thank you. That's what I wanted it to there look like. Go. Yay! Yay! Mission accomplished. I'm going to show you how to do this. It's super easy. Um, and I've just, again, just added one colour sea bead so that you can decide what you put with it so that we're keeping the kit at, 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 a, at a good price. What? Look at... It's not supposed to be that. No, I know. Look at this incredible <laughs> moonstone. Um, I don't know how we can do this. Well, we can't really. We are going to be losing a lot of money on the... Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Uh, Neary, just do the price. Just do it. Sue, Nancy, Thomas, Maker, Pauline, Elizabeth, uh, Maker. Well done to you. Loads of you. That moonstone is so good. Isn't it lovely? Babarak, well done to you, Christine. Well done to you, Kathy, as well. Loads and loads and loads of you there. And that faceting is absolutely on point, isn't it? Christina in the Channel Islands as well. Well done to you. Uh, loads of people there. He's Here we again. go, everyone. Robert in Gloucestershire as well. Oh, my gosh, this is absolutely gorgeous. Well done. Here we go. Janet, well done to you, Maker in Wiltshire as well. All the way down. Nine ninety nine. It's amazing. That's so affordable. This is, yeah, the seed beads on their own, uh, you know, seed beads on their own should be about, what, seven, eight pounds per tube. The gemstone on its own, this gorgeous strand of moonstone, you know, the very, at the very least, 12 to 14 99 yeah, this That's kit, amazing. For a jewellery maker price, you know, as a kit, should be no less than 19 99 Absolutely 20 pounds. Yeah, absolutely 100%. So, yeah. Okay, just enjoy it. Off you go. See, that's a lovely <laughs> necklace, but can you imagine that as a lovely kind of little kind of um, oh, I have hair loads band left. or something? How lovely. I made that necklace and I'm actually going to demo with the same strand. Oh, yes. And had lovely. absolutely loads left. I've nice. hardly touched the tube. Yep. Yeah, so it's um, gorgeous. Well done. Taking those details away literally in just a few seconds. Okay. Well done. That moonstone is absolutely uh Gorgeous, well done. One final kit, everyone. Uh, Claire in Northumberland, Charlotte in Cumbria, Irene in Swansea, Barbara in Leicestershire, Ray in County Antrim, Linda in South Yorkshire, Justine in Bedfordshire, Carol in West Yorkshire, Elaine in Kent, Maker and Janet in West Yorkshire, and loads more of you. Please get it out of your baskets. Check it out. It's a tenner. I'm a bit in love with the jewellery for the next kit. Like, I made it, and then oh. I thought, I'm so wearing that after the show. Yeah. So I've made a bracelet and necklace and earrings out of that kit. 
What so did little you put sweep? either side of the amethyst? Have you put like little these? little spaces? That looks really nice. So it just shows you go in your go in your findings drawer. I like that. You know, but from back in the day, we've got the findings drawer or bag. Day. We've all got them, haven't we? Yeah. And just root through. And that's what I did. And you just see what spaces because spaces can just make or break a design. Yeah, they really can. And I just think that these amethysts are so beautiful that you don't need to do much. Elevates the look, doesn't it? You can get it? an absolute suite of jewellery and then you can cherry pick which one of these beautiful amethysts you want. Absolutely. Debbie, Who's your kits man? are amazing and so are you. Oh, oh, oh Nikki. No, because you will start me off because I am menopausal. <laughs> <laughs> Nikki, oh, thank you. That's darling. very, very lovely of you to say. You Thanks. are rather amazing, Debbie. We do love you very <laughs> much. Your passion's just incredible. And uh, gorgeous jewellery designs, Debbie. Love uh, love them all, Liz in Tyne and Weir. Thank, thank you, you, my Liz. darling. Maker Elizabeth, Maker Pauline, Regine, Maker Diane. There's loads of you coming through. Um, oh, oh, by the way, it? the seed beads you're getting here are, eight, are six O's. Oh, these are big Oh, ones. gosh, they're six O's. Get this, kid, six O's. Aren't the six O's, aren't the six O's also known as, um, are they, they're not the ones known as pony beads, are they? No, these are like so, you're so hard to get hold of. Like I've got my 11 O drawer, my 15 O drawer, I'm, and then they're full and I've got my six O drawer and there's like four. Yeah, there's like colors. a box, yeah. Um, yeah, one box. These are like hen's teeth. Six O's are, are, the, are the most challenging seed beads for us to get hold of. They are absolutely, they are nowhere. Um, I've, to be honest with you, I've bought you, I think, one six O bundle before. It's tubes of six O's in a kit, I think maybe once, maybe twice, but that literally is it. These are the seed beads we never have. And isn't it wonderful that you're getting this pearlized white um, seed bead quality so they've got this really really beautiful pearlized quality they are gorgeous 9.99 look at that pearl look at that pearlescent 9.99 i know it's a tenner i know that is the, that is too low just for that that's too low just for the seed you bead. could sell the alone, for that let alone the chevron amethyst which is amazing. Oh my gosh, it's absolutely flying. Sorry, that, that screen hasn't updated, Debbie. Well done, everybody. Amazing, amazing, amazing. 9.99. Demo. 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 Shall I show you how to make the little flowers? Yes, please. Gorgeous. Yes, please, lovely. What do we what do we do? What do we need? Right, so what you need is your um, fire line wow, look thread, at which if you've got the beading board with the thread and the needles, that's perfect. Perfect. Um, of course, you can use a tiger tail beading thread with this and just crimp it. That's absolutely fine. I really like the um, draping. Let me come over. There we go. I really like the draping of the, uh, the effect that you get when you use the fire line. So I'm just going to pop on a stopper bead. Yeah. And you would want to leave about a 20 centimetre tail so that you can add your end on. But I'm not going to just for demo purposes. So you pop a stopper bead on and then you just go back up through it. But of course, we did sell those um, bead stoppers, which you I was going to say, yes, use as well. So this will come off at the end. It's just to stop my beads falling off. Um, now, depending if you can go all the way around and join it together so it goes over your head, if you want a choker and you want to add a clasp, you can add um, a wire guardian. That's completely up to you um, by sewing through it, knotting, and then just adding your clasp. Or you can just keep going and just keep them, keep it in a circular necklace. So I won't show that because that's completely up to you how you want to add your clasp. So what I did was I picked up however many of, now these aren't in the kits on purpose so that you can add whatever else you want to add lovely. in colour. So you've got these lovely blue for your forget-me-nots and then you've got your lovely um, moonstone for the centre of your forget-me-nots. Mm -hmm. So let's just add, I think I put about 60 on each side um, because they're going to sit behind your neck and I want you to have some moonstone over. So you put whatever number of beads that you want to have at the back of your neck as the beginning part of your necklace and let's say we've put 60 on or however many mm. and drop them down to your stopper bead now i kept lifting that up and putting it around my neck to see when they would start to show yeah and when they would start to show then i added a flower just because i didn't want to waste the beads from behind my neck yeah, and then i could totally. have a bracelet so once you've got as many beads as you want to you add on one of your lovely oh i love moonstone we don't see moonstone much do no we? no way near enough in my opinion i love it so I'm adding on one of my 
Green stones. And then I'm going to add on, I think it was five, but I can take one off if it wasn't. Now, this, it all comes down to trial and error when it comes to going around these little bees. You want enough to go around and not be too baggy. So if you put it on, you can always undo it and take one off or add one on. So you put five beads or however many will sit nicely around so that you've popped your five beads. And if I put it this way, you'll be able to see going to hold it and then you're going to go up and back down just the moonstone now I would be holding this if I uh, I'll get my fingers out of the way hold on just a sec so I'm going back down the moonstone okay so I've come out the bottom I've gone up in a circle and back down the moonstone and then I'm going to give it a pull and then I'll show you what we have like that Lovely. So I've got one side of my little forget-me-not. And if you think that's a little bit too baggy or you, it's, not, it, it's got a gap, you can un, uh, take your needle back through and then yeah. add one or take one away. And then I'm going to put another five on because it's equal on both sides. One, two, just checking you can see, three, four, and five. So this is what I have on my needle. I'm going to do exactly the same again. I'm going to drop those down like that. And then I'm coming out of the bottom of my moonstone. I'm going to take my needle back around and go through the top of my moonstone. I'm just going to pick it up and then I'll show you. So back down the top of my moonstone. I can't see. There we go. So that, this is what we have. My needle is coming back down. And then we're going to pull. Now, Gorgeous. If you give that a pull and keep your tension, you're going to get a nice little... Oh, look, is it that sweet? Halo. Now, if you don't want to have any gaps, <coughs> excuse me, you can go around the outside with your thread and actually make it close. But I thought it was quite pretty just sitting either side yeah. like that. So then all you've got to do is repeat that. So you want to put on less seed beads in between each and they need to be the same. So one, two, three, four, let's do 10. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. This is what I have on my needle. 10 Lovely. of my accent color. I'm dropping it down. And then all you do is repeat the process again. So I'll just do one more. We take one of our moonstones or whatever bead you're using. You're going to pop it on. So I've got my moonstone on my needle. I'm dropping it down so that it sits next to my accent color. And then I know that I only need yep. five to go around. Yeah. So I'm going to pick up five, one, two, three. These are so pretty. They're Four, beautiful, aren't they? Five. They've got like a little frosted glow that I don't think you can see too much on the camera. And then I'm coming back down my moonstone. So I'm going back down there. Yeah. And then I'm going to give it a pull. There you go. And oh, hold on. Have I got, oh, I've got caught. Just hold on just one second. There you go. Just make sure that your thread's not caught. Give it a little pull, make sure that your tension's good so you can push it all up together. And then I'm just going to add five again. One, two, three, four, five. So five again on my needle. I'm coming out of the bottom of my moonstone and I'm going to go back into the top. I'm trying to do it really cat candidly so you can see what I'm doing. And so I'm taking the needle back down. And then I'm going to give it a pull. And then you can just take a moment to make sure all your beads are sitting where you want them and everybody's in place. Um, just make sure that they're where you want and really give that tension. <coughs> Excuse you me, sorry. And all who sail in you. One, <laughs> two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, so you're still making your beaded length. And then you're just going to repeat that again. So that is basically 
all there is to it for the little forget-me-not necklace. And you just keep going all the way round. Um, and if you want to make a continuous necklace, you would just knot your thread at the end and, and tie it in. Or you can add on your clasp if you'd like to. And it's as simple as that. And you can do that with any gemstone. Obviously, you just need to adjust the amount of seed beads that yeah. go around the outside. So it might just be a little trial and error of popping that on. And then if it's a little bit too baggy or there's a gap, adding or taking away. But it really is simple. And then you can make these oh, little lovely. sort of flower station necklace or bracelet. So cute. My daughter loves making these. I bet. Debbie, thank you so much, lovely. You're welcome. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Listen, uh, Neary is dropping the price point of all the jade, basically. Oh. <laughs> He's on a mission. Do you want to have a look at the website? He's on a mission. Do you want to have a look at the website? Can we, just, can we see the... Oh, look, we've got the gorgeous pumpkins oh, on lovely. screen right now. For £29.99 on, on uh, two split payments of... On two split payments of £14.99. They're launched at £89.99. You're getting these today for under £30. Which is utterly ridiculous. Look at that. They're so cute. Well done, Maker oh, in London. We've got Sue in Bedfordshire as well. Well done to you. Individual split payments of £14.99. pence. That's absolutely amazing. Please do go to our website, jewelrymaker.com. See what we've got uh, on pre-order. Yeah. Hey, Goo for £40. <clears throat> Multicolour jade uh, squares for £15. Jadeite Clover Pendant for £29.99. Tokyo... Oh, no, he's sold out. He's gone. Uh, there you go. So please, please, please do add as much as you can onto your order. Have a look and see what we've got coming up. So we've just bought you all these gorgeous kits and still to come, we've got loads and loads and loads more pieces, <clears throat> which is absolutely gorgeous. So please do add as much as you can onto your order. Oh, that's nice. Green Burmese Jade Fancy Donut. That's nice. Love that. Yeah, they're all going to get dropped in price. Let's go. <laughs> oh, yes. 15 minutes of sheer Ooh, madness. I've not seen those before. How gorgeous is this? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is one piece of jade which has been carved. Oh, how clever is that? So clever. I don't know how they do it. It must be passed down from generations. Yeah, that knowledge, that skill. You know when you get those Christmas crackers with like the uh, with 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 the metal hoops in, and I can never work out how to kind of separate oh, yeah, them and yeah. how to put them back together. I'm sure there's a knack to it. I can't even do that, like a simple child's magic trick. <laughs> Let a, you know, how on earth do you carve? How on earth? How on earth do you carve this out of one piece know, of that's... jade? Seventy nine ninety nine. Last in stock, five chances remaining, 30 second clock. Janice in Greater London, we've got you there already. You know, that is you know, the middle of a brace, sorry, the middle of a necklace or the middle of a gorgeous bracelet. That would be absolutely gorgeous, wouldn't it? I'd like it sort of to, to be quite simple, I think. I'd like it um, on a chain. Yes, lovely. You know, just with chains so that the, the jade is the, is the focal. Because absolutely. It's quite example again of simplicity that's beautiful. And but don't you think the marriage of two things? So you know, a relationship or a wedding yeah. or something like oh, that. Oh yeah. Just so lovely. Here we go, everybody. Loads and loads and loads of people coming through to get this well done. Really lovely to see you all. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm going to show you something. I'm going to show you something from here actually. This might work. It might not work. Here we go. Forty nine ninety nine. Well done to Jenny and lovely Dorset. Well done to you as well, my lovely. I'm just going to do this and... Oh, yes. I don't know. I mean, oh, let's have a look. Let's have a little look. There you go. Just pop them on here. Pop them on. Oh, pop, that looks pop stunning. The, pop That's... that on there. Doesn't that look lovely? <gasps> gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. With the conch we've got coming up in the 11. I know, right? How lovely is that? We are moments away, don't forget, away from our incredible deal of the day, which of course is the blue topaz and of course the mystic topaz as well. Really excited about that. Sorry, where are we going now, love? Jade ring. Yeah, lavender ring. Oh, yes, please. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Here we go. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, that doesn't fit on my ring finger. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. 16 to 17 mil in size. You can wear it as a little midi ring as well. That might be nice. Yeah, they're all the rage, aren't they, the midi ring? They are. Put a little charm on there if you wanted to. Use it as a little connector. Yeah, nice idea. Maybe on a necklace. Maybe on a bracelet. Isn't that gorgeous? Well done. 
<clears throat> five chances from oh no four chances oh no three chances 49.99 i'm gonna leave that one with you well done faceted pairs oh lord oh they're lovely last of stock of your faceted pairs oh they're so lovely here we go all the way down enjoy 70 carats in total all the way down to 39.99 amazing for your, look, I love, I love these ones here. Yeah, so do I. Oh, hang on. Uh, no, we're taking the price lower. Here we go. Fastest fingers first. Fastest finger. I've got the Jade Art ring. I never take it off. Yes, Mandy. Absolutely. You go for it, darling. Six chances left. It's 20 quid. <gasps> 20? Is it? Yeah, nineteen ninety nine. Well done. Four chances remaining. Well done. Collector in Derbyshire, you want two of these? Go, 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 down to the last three chances. Well done, check out my lovelies. Last in stock, Jade, all of this. Uh, gorgeous, well done, everybody. Not st not holding, not sticking around here. Yeah. Ooh, vases, vases. These are, what I like about these is, these are kind of stoppers on the bottom, maybe of a sliding clasp. Yeah. Kind of um, cord bracelet. Yeah. Oh, that would be really lovely. They're so lovely. Vases are a symbol of kind of um, uh, being uh, plentiful and uh, bountiful, if you like. But they do make lovely stoppers. You know, they are drilled all the way through. And if you wanted to put a cord through there and just tie a knot on the bottom, that's going to be a lovely mm. kind of little toggle, kind of dongly thing. Good for uh, a guru have... bead. Yes, lovely as a guru bead. Yeah, bringing those kind of two ends of the necklace or bracelet together. Look at that ombre quality as well. Isn't that gorgeous? The colour is so rich. It really is, isn't it? It's proper, proper, proper red jade. And you've got those lovely kind of orangey flame tops on them. Loads and loads and loads of people with this in baskets. I can't see any of your names, but loads and loads of people there. Well done. Two chances remaining. Way over allocated. Go, go, go. One chance remaining. Check out when you can. Absolutely amazing. Leaving that one with you. Check out your baskets. <laughs> Check out now. Do it now. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, I'm going to get number 20 back out. Come on. Come on. Fa oh, they're not faceted. Coins. No, they're not, they're not, they're not, they're not, they're not, they're not, they're not faceted. Gorgeous coins. Neary made these into faceted coins. They're not faceted. They are, as you can see, beautiful and smooth flat coins. Oh, yeah, look at it with the red. Doesn't that look gorgeous? <gasps> yes, absolutely amazing. 10 mil in size. Really, really lovely sizes on these, aren't they? Absolutely gorgeous. Here we go, everyone, all the way down. $29.99. Oh, there brilliant. you go. Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> you don't often hear the word jade and $29.99 in the same sentence, no, do you? No, hardly ever. You're absolutely right. <gasps> oh, I'll tell you what else you don't normally hear. $24.99. Yes, Belinda. Well done to you, my lovely and lovely Surrey. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at this. Look at the look at the green with the conch, by the way. Ooh. You are looking good. Yeah. 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 Just yes. Yeah. S yeah. Done. Tamina, make a Sean, Jenny, well done to you. Go, go, go. Well done, everyone. Absolutely gorgeous. Last few opportunities. Ah, oh, there we go. Pamela, Liz, and well done to you. Gorgeous. Check out your baskets. Well done, Maker. We've got you all there. Fantastic. Well done. Check out your baskets as soon as you can. This is about to sell out. Well done, everybody. Amazing. Right, where are we going to go now, lovely? We've got one, two, three, four in baskets for the last two there. Oh, Kinga, can I have number 25? But can I have the next box, please, my lovely? So please go to our website, jewelrymaker.com. You can see everything we put on pre-order, all of the last in stock, Jade. We will be dropping the prices on all of it, but it's all brilliant. I can't wait for the conch. And the deal of the day. <gasps> I know. Honestly, we've got and the 12 o'clock kids. We've got such, such, such a great show lined up for you. There's so much in every single hour. There you go. I don't know where that's from. I think it's there. I think it's there. 24. Oh, a little donut. A little mini donut. How cute is that? That's lovely, isn't it? How lovely. Oh, you little puppet. Absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Beautiful little donut shape. If you get two, you could put um, a pearl or a little jade on a head pin, pop it through the middle, 
glue it in place and then you could have um, stud, studs. Stud earrings. Yes, I love that idea, Debbie. What a lovely, what a lovely, lovely idea. <gasps> $9.99 for your gorgeous jade donut. There you go. Oh, So you could have word. jade earrings for £20. About £20, under. Pounds, yeah. Well, Elizabeth's got two. So is a maker in London. Well done to you. Maybe you are going to be making earrings. earrings. Please yeah. do let us know. That is such a lovely idea. Linda, maker in London. Maker in Greater London. Maker in Derbyshire. Well done to you as well. Loads of people coming through. Gorgeous. Moving on, baby. I've just got this one hit. Oh, ah. Yeah. Here we go. Beautiful rondelles of red jade. So oh. cute. So, 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 so cute. Should be what? 50 pounds? Okay. Has it? So it's been at, it's been at what price? 29.99 for these. We're gonna leapfrog that. Oh. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> We're gonna leap over it like a, like a little froggy. 20 quid. Yeah, they've got to be the most affordable red jade we've ever had. Jenny and Dawson, Paula in the Ronda. Well done to you, my lovelies. Absolutely gorgeous maker in Derbyshire. Well done to you. Absolutely amazing. Go, go, go. Nine, eight. Oh, gosh, seven. Ah, seven chances. Paula, Sharon. Well done to you, maker in Greater London. Loads and loads and loads of you there. Helen in Suffolk. Well done to you as well. Four chances remaining. Hits a goal, goal, goal. Well done. Black jade. How lovely are these? Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, baby, baby. Yes, there they are. Black jade. Oh, perfect rounds. Absolutely perfect. Yeah, just with pearls. 20 quid. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> We are going to get in so much trouble for that. London's got three. Greater London, Dorset, South Yorkshire, Maker, Deborah. Well done to you. They are like licorice black. They really are, aren't they? They're, there's something really different about the black jade than other black gemstones. So I can't quite put my finger on it, but you can tell, can't you? Absolutely. London's got four. Maker in Stirlingshire, uh, Greater Manchester, Lincolnshire, Dorset, uh, South Yorkshire and Devon. Well done to you. Two chances remaining. That is absolutely unbelievable, Jeff. Yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well done. Judith in Hull. Two chances left and we've got about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine in baskets. Crazy. Well done. Taking those details away literally in a couple of seconds. Please do check out as soon as you can. Well done. Still got loads. Still got loads coming up. Noreen, check out my lovely Stella, check out. Karen, check out. Oh, there you all are. I can see you're all there, but please, please, please. We've only got two chances left and there's so many. Oh no, Tamina's just taken a pack of these. Well done, one chance remaining. Well done with two seconds to go. It's a go, go. Oh no, Noreen's taking the last one. Well done, love. Well done, love. Okay, next. Yes, yes. That's so beautiful, isn't it? Very good for cord for doing the lark's head knot and then just having the cord. So quite unisex, I and think, this one. Be honest, Debbie, how long is it going to take you to make that necklace? Yeah, that's like a minute. <laughs> Less than a seconds. minute. Yeah. If you could do a lark's head knot, literally, I mean, even I can do that. <laughs> and if I can do that, then anyone can. There you go, sold out. Right, next. Yes. Well, you say that, but I just. We've got Moonstone at the bottom of this hour. Oh! Now, I haven't seen anything like this for Oh a long my time. gosh! <gasps> oh my gosh, that's a journey! Oh, goodness! Oh, wow. Oh my word! Oh! Even under the lights, you see. You, you have a look at those. You, we're literally going to lose Debbie now. She's going to go into some kind of a trance. Jade! Um, drop, three-dimensional, absolutely gorgeous, half-drilled, yes, 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 there we go. 14.99. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
Yes, please. Can you? Can I just have a look at the Mystic Strand to go with? Thank you very much. So I'm just designing my anniversary present. <laughs> oh, oh! Sorry. Oh! Look at that yeah. and that together. Oh, la 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 la. Look, sorry. I just. No, that's amazing. That is absolutely gorgeous. Dragon carving. What number is this, Neri? Yeah, it's in the other one, isn't it? There we go. Oh, look. This is a happy dragon. Look at him. Literally gambling. <laughs> I love watching uh, clips on uh, Instagram of kind of um, uh, puppies and things like oh, that. Oh, so and do I. They're just so cute. They're just gambling everywhere. They don't know how to walk. There's his legs. He's literally just, he's running. He's having a great, great old time. Isn't he just gorgeous? He's a lovely dragon, isn't he? He's so handsome. He's so cute. It's got a lovely, lovely depth to this. It's plain on the back, which I kind of like as well. It's got that really lovely kind of smooth quality there. Yeah, Very it does feel like a lovely coin, yeah. doesn't it? Really comfortable, yeah. Absolutely. Absolute bargain, here we go. Gosh, everything's selling out. Everything's selling out. 79 pounds on split payments of 39 pounds 50. That is one of the lowest price very, very master good. carvings I've ever seen. That is absolutely amazing. Yeah, go, 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 go. Is that going to go on your wall? Oh, yes, absolutely. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous quality. Well done at 79 pounds. An amazing deal for you today. Well done, everyone. Type A, all completely natural. Well done. Six chances left at 79.99. Add it to your order as soon as you can. Well done. That is absolutely phenomenal, isn't it? Just gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful, that is. And I like the dragon. I like, um, he's got a little character. He's playful, one, isn't he? Yeah, he's, he's playful. He's very playful. He's just lovely. Yeah, it, it, look at his little legs. He's just, he's having a wonderful he's time. He's a happy dragon. He's a very happy dragon. He's not a fierce dragon. No. No, he's a very, very happy dragon. Absolutely gorgeous. Three chances remaining. Well done, everyone. Are we going to do this moonstone? Oh my gosh. I had no idea this was in the hour. I mean, oh. the, the shiller coming off of that is incredible. Star by, I've no idea on the price on these either. Uh, it's going to be absolutely amazing. Uh, loads of people with that in the baskets for the dragon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten people in baskets for the last, what, three or four of that dragon carving. Oh, quick. Check out as quickly as you can. Don't go anywhere. Moonstone. Moonstone. Star by. We were only saying, what, 20 minutes ago, half an hour ago? We just don't see... Um, Haven't seen Moonstone, Moonstone. for a long time. Used to see it all the time in every all show. All the time! Like back in the day, didn't Back you? in the day? No, no, not anymore. Ring, 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 ring. It's, they're rings. I mean, if you, if you don't do metal work, then you can bead embroider these. Imagine these bead embroidered in the centre, but that's a ring every day for me. Look at it, when you move your hand, look! That's under the studio lights. I mean, imagine when you get that outside. This is the worst they are ever going <laughs> to Yeah, have. yeah. The very worst. Oh, my goodness. That is amazing. This here. Look at the back of it. Look at the back of that. Look at the back of this one. Shoosh. Look at the back of that. It's right, it floats right across the whole circumference. It's not just a little area, is it? It's like right across. Oh. All of these have been hand-picked. You can see that, can't you? Yeah, totally. Look at that. It's like it's just lit up from inside. It's just beautiful. Rings, as you say. I mean, we have not had moonstone for what seems like and an age like at least a year maybe even two to three years 75 available we're down to 52 already hillary janice justine sean sue maker maker makes got four in the basket justine maker and kent maker kate oh my gosh there's loads of you there it's so good moonstone what you're basically seeing uh, with this shiller what what you're basically seeing is um 
Light reflecting off the inner layers inside the gemstone, a bit like with your labradorite, uh, or well, exactly like with your labradorite. And the, uh, the the return of light that you get is this lovely ghostly blue colour. It should it should look like the moon on a cloudless night. Mm. Um, it's so wonderful. For centuries, uh, it's been associated with fertility, with the phases of the moon, with celestial beings. It's meant to be really a, a really powerful gemstone to have near you on a full moon. It's meant to be a wonderful gemstone to use in meditation. It's a gemstone associated with luck and wealth as well. I think in India, um, you see lots of people wearing uh, moonstone signet rings. I, I just, it's it, for me, it's a glorious stone. Connected, I think, probably with the crown chakra, yeah. I would have thought, because mm -hmm. it's got that beautiful white ethereal quality, so that kind of gateway to the higher spiritual realm or just meditation, taking five minutes, sitting in the car. I did that yesterday. Sat in the car for five minutes, just closed my eyes, and it was just... It's very important. So lovely. It's very important to do that, even if you just stand there or sit there and just... Like we always sigh out at the beginning of yoga, we sigh out the day. Yes. And I just think, I don't know, things like this, they're magical. So if, if you sat and had a look at this just for 10 minutes, you're That's taking your attention. Absolutely. Yeah. So that is a form of meditation. It That's, us, us by looking at these, it's, it's us by just looking at these colours and studying them. That is mindfulness. Mm. We're at 30 pounds. This is absolutely incredible. We have not had we have not had moonstone like this for years no, on jewelry no, maker. No, no. Sixty second clock. We're taking the price low. I can't believe we're actually going to go low with it. Thirty pounds each. Yeah. that's incredible. No, for what? both fifteen pounds each. You get them both. What? You get them both, and we're going again. I know. I know. Good quality moonstone, top quality moonstone, which is what this is, costs, can cost an absolute fortune. Oh, I thought that was each. No. That's amazing. No, no, no. Oh, my it's goodness. For them, both, for them both. Oh, Debbie. Oh, so beautiful. Amazing. I mean, if you put you put that on your finger, I, I've got a ring like this that I made. Look. Oh. It just needs to be bezel set with a basic band. Just let... I would maybe saw out um, the Was base it? plate so that the light can come through it and really show off that absolutely amazing shiller. Ollie's just told me that um, that uh, on the Antiques Roadshow, uh, Sunday just gone, oh, yeah. a, one of the main pieces they were looking at was a huge Victorian gem set necklace, a multi-gem necklace and the main and the main gemstone in it, um, surrounded by rubies, was moonstone. I mean, wow, a gem connected with... What's the price gone on? Nineteen pounds <laughs> ninety nine. Now, if that's not affordable, what? I don't know what is. I j that's absolutely incredible. Twenty quid. That is amazing. How? Oh, that is crazy. That is absolutely crazy. I. That's, that is far yeah. too low. Oh my gosh. If you got the moonstone strand in the 9am kits with the blue seed beads, you could stick this down to some beading foundation and you could seed bead around it. So if you don't do any metal smithing yeah. and then you could use your moonstone strand and have this as your focal pendant. Oh my gosh. You could also make a ring by bead embroidering this as well. So you don't have to be able to bezel set it. There's lots of different ways that you can use it. Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. One minute to close. I cannot believe that. That is honestly, I feel like we've waited for years for this. And what's so cool is we're going to go into the deal of the day now, which is just, you know, is with the, with the, yeah, with the, which is the mystic topaz, which is the blue topaz, sky blue topaz. It's amazing. Suzanne's got two. Well, don't you maker and Kent's got two. Noreen's got two. Well, don't you loads and loads and loads of people coming through. This is absolute. Oh, so good. And yeah, the worst it's going to look is this. And these are all hand-picked by uh, Wayno, our, our head gemstone buyer. You can see that, though, can't you? Yeah, because totally, totally Often you would that. get one that had great shiller, another one none or a little bit, but both of these are equally as good as each yeah. other. Look at the back. Look at the back of these. Choose to set that however you like, but oh, look at the look. back of these. The magic. Yeah, gallery wire would be really nice. And do you know what? Because they're kind of fairly prescriptive sizes, if you've got two of these bundles, you could literally glue two of these together with your gallery wire kind of going yeah, around. Yeah, you could. A rolling pendant. Can you imagine Ooh, that? That would be lovely. That would be really, really nice. Absolutely gorgeous. I would love that. So literally get them 
glue them together. Just imagine they're both ovals. Glue them together. Put your gallery wire around there. That's going to be a pendant which rolls and moves. Yeah, that would be beautiful. Ooh. And then another pack for rings. So you need to get three if you, packs. If you've got, you know, if they cost this. Prepare yourselves for the deal of the day. This is incredible. It's blue topaz. It's mystic topaz. It's absolutely off the scale. And then, as if the show couldn't get any better, we've then got conch. And then, as if things couldn't get any better, we've got Heshi bead kit. It's all still to come. Honestly, amazing. Do not go anywhere. We'll see you in a sec. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewellery Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. We are so excited about this no. deal of the day. Honestly, this is just like. <laughs> How beautiful. Um, when, I, when I found that we had blue topaz as a deal of the day the other day, and I thought, oh, gosh, you know, that's interesting. We haven't had blue topaz. 
escaping. Don't escape. Going back to the sea with the conch. No, just stay there. And I thought, <laughs> well, we haven't had blue topaz for such a long time. I hope it's nice. Oh, my gosh. Um, I needn't have worried because this is absolutely... This that. is a really annoying way to hold this. I know. I realise that. Oh, Michael's like nodding his head. Yes, it is annoying. But just look. <laughs> just look at that. Just look at the look. Yeah, I mean, just, I, yeah. just look at the lights. <laughs> I mean, yeah. It's like droplets of. I'd be willing to sell my dog for this. <laughs> <laughs> no, I do love Watson. I do love you, Watson. I do love you. No, and I would never sell my dog. I would literally. <laughs> Give him away. No, I'm joking. I love him. Uh, but no, that is just so lovely. You're like, what have I got that I could sell so I could get this? I mean, seriously. Yeah. And then, and then Ollie was literally, Ollie, how long have you worked with gemstones? Oh, don't lie. About 15 years. <laughs> 14, 15 years. Oh, a decade. No, it's a lot longer than that. Um, about 15 years is so long. Yeah, I've been um, a jewellery designer for 10 years for about six years. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> yes, I've worked on jewellery maker for five years. No, Carol, you've been here all the time. Um, but it is one of the, but it is one of those, it is one of those, you know a gemstone is good when I've got Debbie, literally, if she could do handstands and cartwheels, she would be doing them right now. Not going to happen. And also... <laughs> Ollie went nuts over this. Have you seen the mystic? And then I saw it and I'm going to do it again. Sorry, Michael. Just look at that. It is absolutely stunning. It really is lovely. So subtle. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, put it on your hand because that's what I did earlier and it just, oh, look at it. Look. Oh, Hello. sorry. I my gosh. That is, look at it. Oh. I want all of these. It's beautiful. Magical, aren't they? And, you know, if you like it in this picture, wait till you see it in real life because there's loads of, like, colours coming off of it, like greens and golds and twinkles. Yeah, yeah. twinkles, like a little star. This gem is amazing. It's considered by, you know, there are lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of things written about basically colored gemstones and they take their, they take their inspiration when they're describing certain characteristics of gemstones. They normally take their, uh, um, um, uh, uh, bodies like the GIA take their inspiration uh, from things like blue topaz, whether it's sky blue, London blue or Swiss blue in the middle. Um, I've got a few slides to show you. They're kind of a little bit kind of, it, it kind of gives us a better understanding of, of why this particular gemstone, as in sky blue topaz, sky blue topaz is so, is so remarkable. Um, so bear with me. I know that looks like a I don't know what even that, I don't even know what that looks like. But basically, this is a diagram which shows you uh, the, the, the kind of the three main things which give you colour in a gemstone. Those are tone, saturation and hue. OK, so tone, saturation and hue. Tone is the rod which runs from north to south there. Um, saturation is how saturated the colour is and the hue is the colour. But I will go into a bit more detail because it is a little bit because that 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 is quite confusing. And um, thanks, love. Tone. Okay, so tone. Amethyst is the purple variety of quartz, which is clear if it has no tone. If it has slight tone, it's rose quartz. If it gets a little stronger, we call it rose de France. With another ten percent or more, it becomes a lovely amethyst. Another ten percent tone. You're now looking at a desirable Uruguayan or Zambian amethyst, and a little more, it's Moroccan amethyst. If it goes darker than ninety percent, it gets too dark, and you get areas of extinction. Okay, um, so. That's what we're talking about. We're talking about the tone goes from white to black, okay. basically. So from light to dark. So how light or dark a colour is. Uh, so, for instance, uh, black is 100% tone. White is 0% tone. Yeah? yeah. 
Now, the exciting thing about, about um, sky blue uh, topaz is it sits at about 20 to 40% tone. So it's right in the middle of that blue, of that blue kind of spectrum. Okay, next slide. Hue. Hue is the colour. It uh, refers to the colour of a gemstone, red, orange, yellow, and all the other colours we learned at school are, are at a scientific and gemological level actually known as hues. I think there are 28 hues there or thereabouts, but you can see all those colours going from pinks through to reds and oranges and yellows. It's basically the rainbow, so hue is the colour. So what we're looking at here is the lightest variety of blue topaz. Sky blue, Swiss blue is in the middle and um, London blue is um, right at the other end. So it's the darkest, most saturated um, uh, tone of blue. You've then got saturation. Now, this is a little bit more challenging for me to for me to explain, but hopefully, hopefully it'll hopefully it'll kind of make sense. Saturation is simply described as the amount of color in a gemstone. So if you think about a glass of a glass of orange squash, one is a is a is a glass of orange squash. The other one is a glass of water with like two drops of orange squash in. One is more saturated than the other. It's basically how bright it is. So it's a difference between a a high vis um, a yellow uh, uh, vest and a a cowslip colour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's how vibrant, how 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 bright that tone is. So 20% saturation is very, very light. 100% saturation is very, very bright and vivid. Um, so if you look at the blue there, for instance, um, you know, we, we sometimes talk about that particular shade of cobalt, like a, like a, a lapis lazuli yes, blue, yeah. that is so saturated, it almost absorbs light. Yes. It kind of almost soaks, it almost draws light in, like yes. a black hole almost. That's, that's extreme saturation. Not right at the other end of the scale, but kind of like I would say two, uh, you know, you know, another kind of couple of steps in. You've got sky blue topaz on that kind of slightly more bluey greeny um, uh, level. And you're looking here at a kind of a 40 percent saturation. Now. Sorry, the next slide, lovely. The. Um, those are the three main colours of, of, of topaz. You've got London blue, which some people think the um, that the um, the 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 the. the, the no, not saturation. The uh, tone of that blue is too much. It's too, it's too dark. There's room for areas of extinction. Whereas sky blue is, is, right, is right there on the left-hand side. Some people believe as well that Swiss blue topaz, the saturation is too much, um, that, 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 it's too, that it's too vivid. Whereas sky blue topaz, uh, oh, um, sorry, I'll show you that in a second. Sky blue topaz, um, has what's called the four C's in it. And most, you know, blue topazes do, but sky blue topaz more than any others. The four C's are colour, clarity, cut and carrot weight. Colour is all about, you know, the colour that the gemstone is. Well, it's that gorgeous sky blue. You can see how here they've used sky blue topaz as, a, as, a, um, as an example, because it's just, it's one of those dictionary definition gemstones. It's the definition of the four C's. Clarity is how clear the gemstone is and how uh, transparent it is. Um, a gemstone can have loads of inclusions, but still have clarity. It just means you can see them. If a gemstone, a gemstone like that moonstone we just bought to you, that, that, that has, that's translucent. It's got lots of inclusions in, but it's kind of more translucent than transparent. The cut. Now, this is really important. When you get a, a, a sky blue topaz that's cut correctly, it releases that colour so beautifully. And it shows off the fact that it's completely inclusion free, which all of our topaz is. And then the carrot weight. Carrot weight is slightly less important with what we've got today. But basically, when you've got a massive carrot weight, um, it, it normally makes the price point go way, 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 way up. Um, now, the next slide I'm going to show you. Oh, no, I don't know whether I've got it or not. No, I haven't. Um, and it's and it's something which I learned when I did my GIA training all those years ago. Um, and there is something where you have the perfect balance of tone, saturation and hue when they all cross over absolutely beautifully. And it's called the perfect gamut point. When you've got that perfect balance of blue, when you've got that perfect saturation of blue, when you've got that perfect tone of blue as well. So it's not too light, it's not too dark, it's not too vivid, it's not too pale. And it's that blue in the middle of the blue palette. And sky blue topaz hits that point. It's one of the most pleasing colours 
you can see in any stone. Um, more pleasing than a cobalt blue for me, more pleasing than an ultra, ultra delicate sky blue, uh, kind of aquamarine almost. And for so many people, like blue is the, most, is the most popular color in the world. And I think it's down to a couple of different reasons. Um, I think one of the main reasons is the sky is blue. The sky is blue. And as soon as the sky is blue, it lifts your mood. It changes your mindset. It makes <coughs> it you does. look up more. It makes you look out more. It makes you more engaged. So it's an amazingly effective color. It has an effect on all of us. But this incredible gemstone, like I say, is more than just a gemstone. It, it, it reaches that perfect, it's called the perfect gamut point of tone, saturation and hue. It's right in the middle. Very few other gemstones have that level of quality. I'm trying to think of a green gemstone that does. Uh, is Peridot, I think Peridot is a little bit too saturated. It's mm. a little bit too vivid. Um, uh, uh, what about in pink gemstones? I can't think of a single pink gemstone, which for me has got that perfect balance of tone, saturation and hue. Whereas Sky Blue Topaz has, does it again and again and again. You've also got a colour which is not right in the middle of the colour spectrum because right in the middle you've got greens and we can see more shades of green than any other colour in the world and that's because of foliage and, 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 and flora and fauna that we see. So we're more used to seeing greens but also it's down to the human eye as well and uh, kind of our, our, our spectrum of colours that we can see. But this level of blue is very, very close to, to having kind of green tones in it as well. Um, for me... Debbie, I don't know about you, it is the most pleasing colour I think that there is. It illustrates the four C's. It yeah. illustrates tone saturation and hue per perfectly. It illustrates everything that we know. And by the way, this is a gem of real value. Let me show you this slide very, very quickly. Now, look at the date of this article. This was in L. Uh, this was on L uh, uh, magazine's website, dated yesterday. So you cannot get more up to date than yesterday. Uh, well, you can get today, I suppose. Sixty-one pieces of bridal jewelry you'll be obsessed with um, uh, uh, in 2023. We've turned uh, to uh, Missouri, Cartier, Missoma. Now, Cartier known for their precious metal. I'm not familiar with Missouri particularly. Missoma are absolutely known for their pearls. Look at this incredible pair of earrings here. Uh, these are made by Louise Sinclair. Nine carat white gold rub over cushioned sky blue topaz earrings, £610. They are absolutely gorgeous. And this is your something blue. Now, I would never tell you what to do with these today. I would never say you've got to use it with these. But anybody who is getting married within the next 12 months, anybody who is looking for that gem which is going to uplift, anyone who's looking for that gemstone, that one gem which is really going to stand out, you imagine a, a beautiful white pearl necklace that you've made with one of these in the centre. It, it, it's literally going to draw people in. Now, this has been set, and this is going to become more of a, norm, a, a normal thing, which is really exciting. These have got um, hematite spaces in between them, which is really lovely. And that's going to become more of a normal thing. I really like that. So I gemstone do. spaces in between your um, uh, um, sky blue topaz. These are the most wonderful six to seven mil faceted rounds. Have I got the right? I have got the right strand here. Yeah. The six to seven millimeter faceted rounds you're going to be getting here. There is not a single inclusion. There is not a single imperfection. There is not a single sign of a lapidrist, you know, uh, uh, kind of um, slipping or kind of not getting, not getting the, um, uh, not, not getting that cut just right. You've got that absolutely incredible quality here, that absolutely incredible attention to detail. It is master cutters who will cut this incredible gemstone. Um, one of the things I, I just I, I just wanted to pick up on as well, just about the cut. When we talk about the full seas, the cut of sky blue topaz can greatly regulate the overall colour and clarity of the gemstone. Uh, we're in debt to the cutters who are responsible in 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 uh, uh, for adorable sky blue topaz rings. Absolutely. Cutting this gemstone is not easy. It's eight on the most scale, so it's really it's a really, really tough gemstone. But because there's nowhere to hide, because the clarity is so amazingly bright and inner brilliance is so, so, so truthful, you don't cut this gemstone correctly and it will become blatantly obvious. These are cut by master, master lapidrists. Now, we're at £279. I'll be honest with you, we bought you Sky Blue Topaz before for about the £150 mark, £129 mark. We've done it for £99 as well, which is absolutely brilliant. What we're doing today is we're going to make this one of the most achievable 
accessible strands of sky blue topaz we have ever, ever done. It's absolutely incredible, isn't it? Now, Debbie, I don't know about you, but for me, I am looking at this and I'm thinking gold, silver, rose gold, it goes with all of them. Yeah, it does. I'm thinking wedding jewellery, I'm thinking everyday jewellery, I'm thinking this could be the gemstone that changes everything for you as a jewellery maker. It's a gemstone which you see a lot of used as accent stones with other gemstones because of its incredible brilliance, because of its incredible kind of reliability. And here it is in that gorgeous classic sky blue quality. I mean, there is nothing I don't love about this. It's luxurious. Yes. And I don't think it would be as luxurious if it hadn't been faceted the way it has. It like looks so say. expensive, doesn't it? Um, just because, if, as you say, you look at it and it's like perfect it's perfectly faceted yes so that the lights just coming out from all directions and I think even if you're not a blue person if blue's not your color I think this type of topaz suits anyone oh like any absolutely skin tone. and just any imagine age that well. with pearls in between or you could go for a really opaque type gemstone you, as you said you could put one in the center of a pearl bracelet absolutely or anything but I just think that there's a luxury to this. Strength. Yes, absolutely is. We are at £79.99. At that price point, it would be good, actually, at £79.99 if it was on split pay, wouldn't it? It'd be really good if it was on split pay. There's a reason why it's not on split pay. It's because we are not done with the price. And when I say we are going to go lower with the price, we are going to go significantly lower. Well done, everyone who's checked out already. Please just pop this in your baskets. We are going to be giving you the absolute opportunity of a lifetime to get the finest sky blue topaz faceted rounds I think we have ever had. Enjoy 20 seconds. The price point is going all the way down. You've got the gemstone of the perfect gamut point. You've got a gemstone with the perfect balance of tone, saturation and hue. That perfect balance of the four C's, the colour, the clarity, the cut and the carrot weight. It's yours today. The finest grade material we can get. $49.99 for your sky blue topaz. Faceted rounds. Margaret, Elisabetta, well done to you. Sean, well done. Maria, Teresa, well done. Maker, well done to you. In London, Northamptonshire, Inverclyde, Margaret, well done to you. 49 99 It's absolutely superb, isn't it? It's just incredible. It's the quality, the colour, the cut, the carrot weight, everything. It's become very um, popular in engagement rings. A lot of people have this in their engagement rings. So I, I think if you're doing totally. wedding jewellery, it'd be lovely to give gift this as um, a bracelet like oh, you said as you're something blue yes if they hang from the ears they're going to catch the lights i think they're going to work in any piece of jewelry you want to put them in really absolutely absolutely now we've got a load of people coming through to get this this is a gemstone of such high caliber and i don't know whether you remember us bringing sky blue topaz to wear before for 150 pounds 99 pounds 129 pounds we're at 49.99 and we're not done we're going to go even lower get involved when you can neary's just found an, an oh gosh i don't know whether i want to show that actually a 10 at 10 over 10 and a half carats in an oval shaped sky blue that's not sky blue that's how much a grand That's not the best blue tape. That's not the best. Oh, that's not sky blue. Ooh. There's not much colour in those. I mean, very, very faint, isn't it? Does it have the tone, saturation and hue? Well, the tone is like probably about 2%. The saturation is probably about 2%. And uh, the hue, well, it's a pastel blue, but it's, 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 what's this? I mean, this is absolutely textbook, textbook quality you are going to be getting here. Amazing. Remember, we're not done. More makers coming through. Two more makers there. Well done to you, literally, in the last couple of seconds. Well done, everybody. Enjoy. $29.99. Nora, <laughs> Susan, <laughs> Highlands, Surrey, Inverclyde, Greater London, Ooh. Channel Islands, Northamptonshire, London. Oh, my gosh. 
What a deal. Virginia in Hampshire, well done to you as well. Susan in the Highlands, well done to you as well. 29.99 is absolute. Virginia, if you want to, check out now. Phyllis has taken two to the Shetland Isles, well done to you. Hampshire's got two as well. This is absolutely tremendous. I mean, there, there's so many designs I'm thinking of right here, whether it's uh, those lovely thread earrings with one of these just on the bottom of that you know, chain. Yeah, definitely. I was thinking of one hanging for an earring. Yeah. So that's only two from your strand. Yeah, precisely. And then you could make a pendant because, yeah. again, you only need one on um, a head pin. Mm -hmm. Make a nice sterling silver or Lovely. gold plated head pin, depending on what metal you're going with. And then you've got the rest that you can either put with other gemstones or rosary link, which makes them go a little bit further. Rosary linking, I love that idea. But do you know something? This has got this has got something for absolutely everybody. Do you know what? I'd love to see this with Jade as well. I'd love to see this with Jade, see what it looks like. Alison's got four of these, well done to you. Margaret in Inverclyde, well done to you. Maker, Maker and Wiltshire, Tina and Kent, June in West Midlands, well done to you. 30 second clock, we're going again. Ah. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh wow. Huh. Yeah, I know, I know that. Ollie, Ollie is literally saying to Tom, you should not be taking this low, you should not be taking this low, you should not be, I know, I know, I know. Oh my gosh, it is absolutely amazing. It's, it's probably the first time we've had a blue topaz on the show this year. Carolyn Carmarthenshire, well done to you. Maker in Nottinghamshire, well done to you. Sean in Northamptonshire as well, well done to you. Oh, she's coming through for another one, well done to you. Oh, so many people coming through. Here we go, 20 chances left, 24.99. Debbie in Middlesex, Julie in Nottinghamshire, Maker in Sussex, oh my gosh, it's gone nuts. Amanda in Cornwall, well done to you. Sussex has got two, well done to you. Yeah, a pound of carrot. Wow, this is... This is well, what a deal. I mean, this is properly, yeah. you know, this is a, a gemstone that we don't see very much. Yeah. It looks so luxurious and expensive. Totally. Twenty four ninety nine. If you'd have said $69.99, I'd have thought, oh, wow, that's a good deal. Yeah, absolutely. Look, Nottinghamshire has just taken two. June, Maker, Deborah, well done to you, Amanda. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Absolutely amazing. Sussex has just got two. Well done to you. It's gone completely and utterly nuts. I'm not surprised. One more strand of blue topaz. Then we've got the mystic. Oh, yeah. I know. Oh, yeah. I know, I know, I know. Stella, well done to you. Anne, Jackie in Middlesbrough, well done to you as well. Deborah in Derbyshire, well done to you. Nottinghamshire's just taken two. Soraya and Kent, well done to you as well. Oh, yeah, this is amazing. That is the most un-24.99 looking <laughs> thing gemstone. Yeah, exactly. Isn't it? That is the best description. It is. The most un-24.99 strand. I mean. This incredible gemstone, you know, don't forget, some of, the, some of the most valuable gemstones in the world are topazes. You know, whether they're imperial topaz, whether they're natural, whether they're, you know, whatever they are. Some of the most valuable gemstones in the world are na are, are incredible uh, topazes. Absolutely amazing. Three chances left. Well done. Maker in Cheshire, Stella. Oh, there's so many in baskets. Loads and loads and loads of multi-buyers. And I think the multi-buyers are, are, are there because we haven't bought you a, well, unless I'm very much mistaken, we haven't bought you a blue topaz deal of the day this year. I'm not sure I bought you another strand of blue topaz this year, actually. One more strand of blue topaz. Okay, graphics in, here we go. <whistles> oh, woo, graduated, love that. Love that, have you got my clicker please, lovely. Um, so let's just very, very quickly, oh, I know, look at that, it's so beautiful. So the perfect balance of tone, saturation and hue, tone being how light or dark this is. So is it black, is it white? It's right in the middle. Let's talk about the hue. The hue is what colour it is. Is it red, purple, blue, green, yellow? What is it? It's definitely blue. And then let's talk about the saturation. How vivid is it? You've got 100% saturation, which is like uh, cobalt blue lapis lazuli. And then you've got very, 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 very pastel. Um, uh, like your, uh, oh, I don't know, like your, uh, well, like that sky, sky blue topaz we've just seen on first dibs. Literally nothing. Um, so there we go. So you've got here that that incredible perfect gamut point, the perfect balance of tone, saturation and hue right here for you today. Well done. Here we go. Sean, Maria, Teresa, June, well done to you. 49.99. Amazing. Incredible. No, it's not. We're not stopping there. We're going to go <laughs> lower. I love this. Absolutely gorgeous. Because it's graduated as well, these smaller ones here, perfect for um, maybe doing a bit of um, channel setting. Ooh, yes, that might you be a certainly nice way to could. Yeah, you could. And you can take, or you could take the large one in the centre and use it for a ring. To be honest, I think I would make a necklace out of this. Oh, why? Well, because it's graduated. Because it's graduated. Yeah. And I would pop another gemstone in between. Yeah. Another graduated strand. Or have spaces as little pearls or little. Yeah, so you know. you've got the hematite which you can choose to use with this or not. Uh, but I think, yeah, with pearls would be absolutely gorgeous. Please don't forget as well, it's one of the two birthstones of um, November as well. 
Citrine and Topaz, two birthstones of November. Gorgeous. Well done. Yeah, it looks beautiful with citrine. Absolutely beautiful with citrine. It's gorgeous, isn't it? No other gem in the world uh, um, uh, kind of gives you that perfect gamut point like this. It's gorgeous. Here we go, everyone. Oh, don't say that. Really? No, 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 no. Don't go too low. Oh, gosh. I knew he was going to do that. £19.99, <laughs> 20 pounds. Oh, my gosh. Go, 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 go. Amazing. That is utterly, utterly brilliant. So That's you're looking beautiful. at five carats less. Yeah, but they're graduated. So for those really delicate little pieces, for the pieces with the sterling silver wire, for the pieces where you just want to channel set, the two, look at these baby ones here. Look how much colour they've got, even though they're the smallest ones on the strap. They are just absolutely delightful, aren't they? Gorgeous, aren't they? Well done, everybody. Go, go, go. Can well I, done. Um, just apologise to them, please? Why? You're not worth 19.99. I know. You're worth a lot more. I know. That. We all know. Just apologising to I'm, them. <laughs> Each stone, yeah, maybe 20 quid, but that's absolutely no, I mean, ridiculous. joking aside, what an amazing wow. price. Look at this, look at this. Oh, my gosh, I, I just want it in a necklace, I look agree. That, that is like the finest. And do you know what's so cool as well? It's like the finest Santa Maria aquamarine, isn't it? But, you know, yes. you're not going to get that for 20 quid, are you? No way. No way, Jose. Let's do a 60 second clock to close. There you go. Well done. Nora's got two. Virginia's got two. Sean's got two. Alison's got two. It does look expensive. Look at that. It does gorgeous look very, very luster, expensive. luster, luster. It looks very, very um, chic. Yes. So Definitely. again, high-end jeweler's window, gallery, that kind of... Oh, my gosh, yeah. I love making jewellery that I can't afford to buy. Yes. Oh, I know I always say it, but... No, but we use that we use that, that phrase a lot that you came up with, Debbie. Well, it's true. It's it why I started making The it. whole point. You know, and it's strands like this are you expect to see, yeah. you know, three figures or more. Making jewellery you can't afford to buy. Can we see it? I know everyone's going to be asking that. Sorry, Michael, you're going to hit me. <laughs> are we looking at the conch? Could you get one of the conch strands, please, love? Just get a box over. Boxy, boxy. Boxy, boxy. Yeah. Yeah. Couldn't decide. There's so many lovely, lovely pieces. Oh. If I got this and opened that box, quite honestly, and saw these inside, it would make me so happy. They are just out of this world. Look at those together. Yeah, they're amazing. They're amazing. Absolutely gorgeous. It's like air, isn't it? Uh, it's just gorgeous. It's just amazing. Beautiful. You are so beautiful. And like Debbie said, yes, you're not worth 20 quid. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. Amazing. Right. Okay. Oh, gosh. This is going to go nuts. My favourite. Deal of the day sting again. Mystic. <laughs> Okay, um, this is, ah, where do you even start with this? We did Mystic Topaz years ago. Um, actually, I don't know whether they still do it over on Gems TV, but, I, uh, but it was one of our, always used to be one of our biggest sellers, Mystic Topaz rings, yeah. Mystic Topaz yeah. bracelets. There was a big collection called the Two Colon Collection where you literally get your Topaz and you Mystic coat it with a titanium-based coating. And it, it didn't look natural at all, um, but it kind of didn't matter. It was Topaz and it was absolutely beautiful. It really looks amazing. The gemstone really, you know, did shine through. Um, so we used to do that. Then we did Mystic Topaz on Jewelry Maker and it worked really well. Then we didn't have it for ages. Then we bought it back and I have to say, I wasn't, I was I don't, I don't think we did it as well as we did it first time round. And then we uh, didn't have it for ages and now we got it back. Yes. Beautiful. Yes, please. This is amazing. What I've not I love. seen anything like this. I mean, there's no other gemstone, treated or not treated, that looks like this. I mean, I don't know. It's just so different, so and, magical. And with this particular... I'm going to take this one out of the way. We are going to do this one, but we're going to do the fastest one first. But with this, it is really subtle. It is subtle. It's what we were saying earlier about having a neutral gemstone, but it not being white and it not being black that you can wear with anything. And because of the colours coming off of this, whatever you wear with it, it's going to pull out the colour of inside, inside the gemstone. The kind of silvery kind of almost gossamer 
dragonfly wing quality that you get here is sublime. And as, and as Debbie quite rightly has said, it, it's, it's magic. It, it's actual magic, isn't it? You've got, a, you've got a really high quality white topaz, which has been coated, but not overly coated. You're not losing a sense of the gem. You're not losing the gem. You're actually, oh my gosh, that looks <laughs> so good. You're enhancing it, aren't you? Look at it. I think so. I think so. Sorry, love. Look. It looks a hundred times better than that in real life. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I mean, it looks amazing, but it, it's doubly amazing. <laughs> That is, oh, yeah, yeah. You see all the colours coming off? Yeah. Greens and, oh, it's gorgeous. Pinks, purples, blues. It doesn't look fake. No, it's such a subtle, subtle, subtle look. I love it. Oh, it's very, 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 very popular. Graphics are live. My gosh, loads of people coming through to get this. Now, you've all got the same opportunity. We are very, very limited with the quantity here. We don't have that many. Mystic Topaz is so magically stunning. So glad you've got it again. It's my birth. Ah, yes, Mandy. Yeah, Topaz, uh, one of the two birthstones of December. No, oh, sorry, November. There you go. There you go. Look at that. Mystic Topaz should come with a health warning. You'll be looking at it more than your surroundings. <laughs> I know. Yes, absolutely. Don't Mystic Topaz and drive. <laughs> no, yes. Can you imagine that? And your know, hands are on the steering and wheel. Like, oh, oh, that's nice. Yes, exactly. It, it's just, it's so beautiful. We love it. $49.99. Oh, yes. Amazing. Well done, everyone coming through to get this. Loads and loads and loads of you there. Those colours are amazing. It's like a peacock pearl almost, isn't it? It is. Very much like that. Lo oh, we're not done. Okay. <laughs> loads of people on the phone lines there. Oh, yeah. Well done, everyone. Absolutely gorgeous. It is like a peacock pearl, isn't it? It's got that gorgeous kind of blues, kind of bottle greens yeah. and purples and pinks. It's just, oh, it's absolutely gorgeous. Well done, everybody. 40 seconds. And we're going to be giving you the deal of deals. Well done, everybody. Oh, yeah, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at those colours leaping off the gemstone. Amazing. Right, let's see those names near you know. So we've got loads of people who've already checked out. Lots and lots and lots in baskets, though. Uh, so well done to everyone who's already checked Oh, everyone who's already checked out. Uh, but loads in baskets. Are you ready? We're going to go and take the price point down. Alison's just snaffled two of these. Well done to you. Seriously, you know, this is, you know, I really feel like we've got Mystic Topaz right this time. Yeah, we definitely have. And it just, it does look natural. It looks like you can see every single little facet. And when they twinkle, yeah. all the little colours seem to come out of the little tiny facets. They do, don't they? Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. Here's your deal today. Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? $29.99 <laughs> matching that gorgeous sky blue topaz. Well done. Mandy, Samantha, Susan, Cynthia, Catherine, Susan, Julie, Maker, Teresa, Janice, Mandy. Loads in baskets. Oh, my gosh. Well done, everyone. Please, please, please check out everybody. How many of this strand did we commission? I can't remember, Neary. 51. It's not enough. Oh, that's not going to be enough. That's going to be no way near enough. There's loads of people there. Well done. Absolutely brill. That's your deal. Absolutely amazing. 29.99. And like I say, we bought you um, Mystic Topaz before in, in, in you know various different strands. And it's been it's been really lovely. We then got it back in. I, just, I wasn't as keen on it. You could really see, I think, the treatment on it. It was too synth. It looked too synthetic for me. What I love about this is the subtlety of this. It's just, it's, yeah. it's just absolutely gorgeous. Like it's just been kissed. Uh, it's just been beautiful to bring this to you today. Well done, everyone. East Sussex, Mandy's through. Cynthia, well done to you. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Forty-five seconds. I made a mistake. 
I did say that with the sky blue topaz that we were, we're matching the price point. We took it to twenty nine ninety nine. We didn't, did we? We took it to twenty four ninety nine, didn't oh, yeah, we? We did, yeah. But this is mystic coated. We see this even 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 more seldomly than 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 sky blue. And it's graduated. Yeah, good call. We're gonna uh, we're gonna. Not a surprise. Ah, oh, yeah, nice one, Ollie. I like that. Good excuse. I got the weekend off. <laughs> Stop it. Let's do it. <laughs> Here we go, everyone. All the way down. It's just no excuse for it, is there? Twenty four ninety nine. Ha <laughs> ha ha! I know it's crazy. It's absolutely bonkers. Well done, Mary, Janice, Louisa, Samantha. Make her, make her, make. Her. Oh, Virginia. Well done to you, my darling. Absolute legend. Well done to you, Maria Teresa. Well done to you as well. Loads of you there. Please check out. Look at all these in baskets. It's gone absolutely nuts. Gorgeous. Now, are you thinking Rosie Blinking as well? Yeah, I do. I do love it. I just, I feel like. Because it's so sparkly, you could put other gemstones in then one of these and then some other gemstones in one of these and they would stand out. Absolutely. So I feel like you could, they could go a long way. Mm, yeah, definitely. 55 seconds and we're going to take the details away. Ollie's just suggested a beaded bead with these. Can you imagine that? Oh, yeah. My gosh. That would be lovely. Who were we talking to yesterday? Oh, was a lovely Alison on the show yesterday and she was saying about... Um, Putting something around a Christmas tree. We, know, we said she, she, she apologised for mentioning Christmas, but <laughs> I don't really care. I love Christmas. So do I. Um, and putting uh, a, a gemstone, whatever it was, with fairy lights. You could do exactly the same with these. You imagine that? Ooh. Put them with your little LED fairy lights. Make the Christmas decks out of them. That's going to look absolutely. That's going to look the business. It would look absolutely amazing with a light yeah. behind, wouldn't it? Magic. Well done, Jackie and uh, Jackie and Middlesbrough has just come through. Baskets, Sharon, Tina, Stella, Maker, Mary, Maker, Janice, Louisa, Samantha, Susan, Julie, and about 30 more of you <laughs> with these in baskets. It's ridiculous. Can you put that on the other screen, please, lovely? Hi, hi all. This is from lovely. Oh, Julie Dudley. Hello, sweetie. Could you please wish my son Alex a very happy 23rd birthday? Uh, we won't. Ah. Oh. The first, the first I won't see him for. Oh, couldn't even send his gifts as he's working away. No. Oh, oh, happy Julie. birthday, Alex. Happy birthday, Alex. 23 today. So he was born in 2000. How cool is that? There you go. Um, happy birthday to you, Alex. And uh, lots of love to you as well, Julie. You and your lovely family. Gorgeous. Right, OK. Oh, gosh. As, as if things couldn't get <laughs> even more better. Even better, as my children would say. All I'm going to say, two words. Bubble jewellery. One word. Mine. <laughs> Mine. 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 <laughs> Mine. <laughs> Mine. Uh, Mine. I love. What is it? I'm going to sneeze again, Ollie. Bless you. In <laughs> oh, so sorry. Happened twice yesterday, twice today. So now it's over and done with. No more sneezing. <laughs> sorry, it's not, it's a very, it's a big event when I sneeze. I'm sorry. Uh, right. Um, bubble rings, bubble necklaces, bubble bracelets. Yeah, because you're going to get the light as they move. Look at that. Yeah, that's beautiful. You, you know, you'd be forgiven for thinking with the faceted one. Ah, uh, uh, no, the reason why you're getting all that lovely colour and sparkle is the faceting and blah, 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 blah. This is not faceted. Ah, no. uh, the reason why you got all that faceting is so you can hide all the inclusions inside the gemstone. This does not have inclusions. This looks like an actual bubble. Like an actual bubble. Doesn't it? Oh, my gosh. It is so good looking. Honestly, um, what you're seeing here... What Michael showing? This is no. This is nothing about Michael and his uh, poor camera work. Uh, this is <laughs> no. I'm joking. I'm amazing. Straight down one price. Um, what you are looking at? This is the absolute worst it will look. Yeah. Get this home. Add it to your order. One price. If you want it, get it. Um, there's no dilly dallying. No messing around. 
If you want it, get it. Go, go, go. Do it. Do it. Don't even think about it. Just get it. Go, go, go. Don't just do it. Go, go. Don't dilly dally on the Don't way. Don't dilly dally on the way. It's 20 quid. Yes, have a bit of that. Well done, everybody. <laughs> Sold. Paul, I know, but that's it, is it? Sold. Right, yeah, I'll have two of those. Yep, lovely. Pauline in West Yorkshire's got two. Sign me up, baby. Absolutely one of those, gorgeous. I don't even need to know what I'm going to do with There's it. There's no convincing. No, no, no. I'm not having to convince anyone no, today no. to come through and get these. It's just literally, yep, done. <laughs> there we go. Absolutely amazing. By the way, I don't want to, and I don't want the other Mystic Topaz to think I was poo-pooing it, uh, but look at the other Mystic Topaz that we did. They're lovely, lovely pieces. They're gorgeous pieces. I personally wouldn't have done little tiny rondelles with them. Personally, they're lovely. I want these. There you go. 19.99. Well done, everyone. Uh, my screen is not caught up, but congratulations to absolutely everyone coming through to get these. They are just crazy. And when you put them together, they look um, beautiful. Look, 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 look at them together. It's that lovely mix of uh, faceting and smoothness. Smooth. Oh, you are an absolute, look at that, you legendary legend. Legend in your own lunchtime, that is. That's beautiful. It's got that kind of platinum, grey, silver lusciousness, hasn't it? Very unusual, very different. Oh, yes, Ollie, that's, that's it. Like a gilded Venetian mirror. Ooh. You know those mirrors which look like mm -hmm. they're kind of almost acid treated and they've mm -hmm. got that lovely kind of patina coming off yeah. them? Yeah. Ooh, like they're from Versailles or somewhere super posh like that. OMG, three, please. Thank you. I need to sit down now, says <laughs> yeah. Mandy. I know, right, Mandy? She's just bought three. Darling, and I tell you what, Pauline bought two before you and Jackie in, Middle, uh, in, in Middlesbrough, maker in London, put them together, have a bit of that. That is just, that, that's going to keep you happy all summer, that is. All summer long. Now, what else am I going to need? How about some coins? Oh, my gosh. I'm not sure I can take much more. <laughs> 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 oh, these are adorable. Oh, I like these. Oh, I... Mm. Mm -hmm. They're mamadial. Mamadial. They're mamadial, aren't they? Can you see how mamadial they these are? These remind me of mood rings from the 1990s. <laughs> where your whole day was dictated to with what colour the, the stone in the ring was. And it was all to do with the, your body temperature, wasn't it? Or, 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 or oh, the fortune-telling right. fish. That's right. The fortune-telling fish. Do you remember that? Mine always used to just curl up and roll so off my hand. I. Oh, just it just basically means you're dead, doesn't it? Basically, <laughs> your heart is made of stone. <laughs> Here we go. So, Mr. Color coated, um, Mr. Coated topaz coins. Eleven. Uh, sorry, seven to eleven mil. <gasps> now, how am I going to use that coin shape, Debbie? Am I going to make these into rings no. or studs, no. or what am I going to do? Oh. What I'm going to do, <laughs> what I'm personally going to do is leave them like this. I'm going to get some seed pearls and I'm going to sew the strand of seed pearls in and around these mystic topaz because it's giving me mamadial vibes. And then I'm going to maybe have a shell, um, not, a, you know, a shell shaped pendant or something and have it on the front. So the whole thing's like really mermaidial feel i have made a sterling oh. silver mermaid so i might hang that off of it but i want to sew those little tiny you could do it with seed beads in amongst these in the yes. wires to give it that kind of um very organic feel i love all these ideas i love that you could replicate i mean i thought you were actually describing the forget-me-not uh, design actually where, with the seed pearls going that. around you absolutely could do with your seed beads maybe or with your if you've got really 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 diddy little seed pearls that what have you got beautiful. on there on the very end have we played those no right those well these bad boys look at those together oh my gosh yes! oh that's jewellery maker. That's wedding jewellery for me now. That's wedding jewellery. I love that. I love that. Yeah, love that. $17.99. Oh, gosh. $17.99. Oh, my word. Well done, everyone. Go, 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 go. Phenomenal deal for you today. The most amazing colours, the most amazing spring greens, purples, pinks. 
kind of yellows, uh, bronzes, silvers, uh, kind of graphite platinum silvers. Anne in Hampshire, maker in Greater London, Teresa in Devon, well done to you as well, my lovely. £17.99 pence, maker in the West Midlands, Sharon, well done to you, my lovely. And Lanarkshire as well. These are big, big, big faces you've got here. Absolutely gorgeous. Virginia, well done to you as well. Hi, minute. And then we're going to take those details away. Look at all those flashes. That's so cool, isn't it? I really like the shape. Yes, me too. Lots of possibilities here for these. You could use them as centerpiece of a brooch, maybe. You could have a tassel coming from the bottom. You know, there's lots of things you can do with it. Also, shape. let's say you've got like an old black cardigan that you want to upcycle a little bit. You could put something on the shoulder. You yeah. could sew some of these, you know, to replace maybe some of the buttons as well. You it's going to give you that wonderful stark contrast to the black jumperness, if you know what <laughs> I mean. Uh, but why not a lovely hat pin or something like that, or a lovely um, fascinator or a brooch? Beautiful, well done. Oh my gosh, Debbie, I can barely wait. We have got the most amazing section coming up next. Oh yeah. If if all if, if there is any of this left, by the way, at the end of the show, I do feel like Debbie's going to just loot the studio. Uh, <laughs> Just loving it. We've got the most amazing, amazing, uh, amazing uh, uh, Queen Conch section coming up after the break. But before we do that, we're going to squeeze in white topaz faceted rouse. Oh yes. my gosh. Yes, yes, yes. Everyone needs this strand, everyone. Oh. Bridal, yes. Prom. Yes. Anniversary. Yes. Christmas. Yes. Christmas. Yes yes. 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 Just because. Yes. Too right. Absolutely. Do you see how I slipped anniversary in there? Yes, of course you did. Yeah, of course I did. On, Not very subtle. We need to do this. Go lovely with the cons. Oh my gosh, it would go amazing. <laughs> yeah. Amazing with the cons. Look at all of that. Oh. Yeah, thank my you. My gosh. Thank you very much. Like diamonds. Oh, Sean. Love you. Well done. Oh, that is just, that is dichroic, isn't it? It's got that incredible fire. What is fire? When white light enters a prism, an object of some description, and uh, it splits, uh, the white light is split into its component colours, which are red, I can't remember, red, blue, green, yellow, basically, all the colours. There they are, there they are. Um, but you get all of the other colours as well. And um, that light comes back out at you in a rainbow of colour. That's called fire. It's also called dispersion. Um, and it's lovely. And it's a tenner. So I just literally saw that price. $9.99. Maker in Hampshire, Karen in Lancashire, Elizabeth in Greater London. North Hampshire's got two. Well done to you. I mean, that is... Um, I'm never going to be able to bring you diamonds like this. You can, you can, you can jog on if you think that's going to happen. <laughs> that's never going to happen. Ever, 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 ever. I don't think anyone will be able to do that. It's the closest thing, you know, this and clear quartz, you know, to your uh, uh, colourless, white, decoloured, uh, uh, in internally flawless diamonds, basically. And it's a tenner. Yeah, that's amazing. Samantha, well done to you. Sean, well done to you. Sue, well done to you. There's loads of you there. Well done. Check out your basket. It's, it's 9 99 This is going to be used in any jewellery that you just want that extra little elevated look or maybe on a one on the end of an extender chain on a bracelet or a necklace just one thin elastic yeah oh rings good. rings stretchy rings oh, love that idea stretchy rings are massive at the moment and you can layer them so this sort of strand you could put with your precious metal rings yeah defo oh look at that love it so get the thinner elastic get the clear elastic and make little rings to match whatever else you're making. Imagine how many rings you get out of that long oh, strand. Oh, ring That's ding what ding. I do with Absolutely. them. Absolutely. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful quality. Oh, yes. See how pretty and trendy that is and elegant. Yep. There you go. Pretty and trendy. Gorgeous. Well done, everyone. 30 seconds of we're taking those details away. Oh, I love that. I mean, you could do that with memory wire as well, couldn't oh, you? Oh, yeah, for sure. Nice. Nice. Well done, everybody. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so we're going to be bringing you the conch next. Um, this is a, I have to say, this is a real, real, real um, pleasure to be able to bring you this incredible section. We've had to get this sign off by two members of the management team because um, there is literally none of this available. We had to get permission from Dave to bring it to air as well because there is literally none of this which is big this is so precious and it's guarded 
guarded by our team here at Jewelry Maker and the wider Gemporia group. Um, we've got brand new earrings, which are gonna fly. I'm getting a pair. Well, I say I'm gonna get a pair. I'm going to get, I really, I am hoping I can get a pair. I know you're hoping to, seriously hoping to get a pair as well. Honestly, this is a, this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. We've got as much as we can get. It's all limited in stock. The earrings have got slightly more of the price is amazing. Don't go anywhere. Queen Cot's coming up next. If you don't know what this is, have a look at this little documentary. We'll be back in about two or three minutes. Around 10 years ago, there was a real excitement uh, in, in the world of fine jewellery, especially here in the Caribbean, as the world's first um, Queen Conch farm was set up, where a place to kind of culture uh, and fully mature the Queen Conch, which can take between 10 and 12 years, some say 14 years, to get the true gem grade material. Um, this is this stone, the Queen Conch shell, not to be confused with the Queen Conch shell of which it produces, has always been a feature of high jewellery. You'll only find sporadic examples. It is a, an incredible shell that was used almost exclusively by the carvers, the cameo relief carvers of Idar Oberstein uh, throughout the last hundred years. And uh, a few years ago, I saw a piece at auction uh, that went for 700,000 US dollars created by Tiffany & Co, George Frederick Kunz, Henry Hope, and uh, the financier, um, Mr. Uh, JP Morgan, were huge advocates of this incredible shell. And when I heard about this project, my debut uh, collection of jewelry I wanted to feature uh, and bring back, revive the Queen Conch shell. Unfortunately, as you can tell, uh, a series of hurricanes uh, from 2015 to 2017 completely destroyed uh, the Queen Conch farm. As you can see, the wild of the Caribbean is reclaiming the visitor center, which you know thousands of people visited each year. Um, and as such, it hasn't got back running. This is a, a problem we find in the world of you know South Sea pearls and Tahitian pearls. Yeah, if a typhoon takes it out, the investment needed, the capital needed, to then go and collect. Um, or, or harvest those incredible bivalve oysters is expensive. Well, when it comes to the queen conch, it's a different matter altogether. Finding a fully mature queen conch today is the equivalent of finding a completely natural pearl in the Gulf of Persia, maybe 100, 200 years ago, before the days of Mickey Moto. In fact, it's the rarest stone I've ever been involved in. It's a one in two million chance finding the fully mature queen conch. Now you can find juveniles, uh, you know, when they're using it for delicacies, four or five years old, and they're completely disregarded by the fishermen because they have no value. To, to extract the, the full potential of the value of a queen conch, it needs to be a minimum of 10 years old. That's when the shell thickens and can be carved by the world's best carvers. And that's when you get that beautiful coral color throughout the body of the shell in which some incredible intricate pieces can be created. As such, this is a one-time collection that I'm hoping to bring to you guys and I don't think we'll be, al be able to ever do it again because I've spent now a week in the Caribbean um, and as my cameraman who's filming this can attest, we found Conk, we found Queen Conk, but we've only found one gem grade shell and what a specimen it was you know it's about this large i'll show you some images of it um, and it has this beautiful blush color throughout and it's so thick it's like porcelain this was the great hope of the caribbean this queen conch farm but unfortunately mother nature had other ideas and as such we've seen a five to ten thousand percent price increase in the value of the fully mature queen conch I literally feel like I'm walking on clouds with this. Oh, it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. Just all seeing it all together there in those amazing boxes, which really showcase how stunning it is. Yeah, it's the kind of thing that you'd expect to see in a very, very high-end jewellers. And just the... Oh, it's, mm, just... Mm. Sorry, that's not very articulate. But there is mm. not a single, what I would describe as weak link here. No. These are all absolutely <sighs> estate showstopper legacy. Oh. I love those. My God, what's well, a good job. I'm getting them. 
I bet there won't be any. I would. Have you seen the recording of these? They're honestly, it's like, oh my. <laughs> <laughs> I, okay, I definitely sell my dog for this. <laughs> this is a great representation of those different colours that go through it that you don't necessarily see. You know, you don't notice do you, when you're looking on the television. You can see it here in real life. But look. Oh. This is such a rarity. And let's, let's, be, let's be honest. Um, from watching that little documentary with Dave, and, you know, he went all the way over um, to uh, basically kind of Turks and Caicos, that kind of, that kind of area, the Gulf of Mexico, to try and search, get a better understanding of this incredible gem, get a, get a better understanding of why this can't be cultured, why this can't be grown in the same way that pearls or, uh, you know, your Akoya pearls or your um, Tahitian pearls or you know, some of the rarest pearls in the world, Tahitian, South Sea and Akoya pearls, they can all be cultured. Why can't this be cultured? Why can't this be cultured in the same way to try and get a better understanding of, of why this is so challenging to get hold of? What is it that the, what is it that the, that, that the fishermen are facing? And when he visited, you know, and Dave's been to pearl farms before and, you know, seen the, 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 the industry, the pearl industry and kind of how, how pearls are cultured. And you've got something here which can't be cultured. It can't be cultured in the same way at all. The weather system over where the, the farms once were are battled, every, battered every single year by hurricanes, by unbelievably strong winds. You cannot culture this in the same way as you can your pearls, purely because of that reason. It's incredibly exposed. Lots of low, low lying islands there. There's nothing for the wind. And you can see, I mean, Dave's standing, uh, Dave standing there. It looks, it looks really lovely. It looks really lovely and beachy. But you look at the surrounding area and, and, it's, and there's hurricane damage everywhere still. And we're talking about a hurricane that happened, you know, not even, um, you know, a hurricane that happened, you know, you know, a good few months, years ago. And it's prevented. Oh, look at this. Oh, my gosh. I mean, it's so beautiful. And you can see where the conch shells were once, uh, were once kind of uh, cultured in these little kind of uh, the, these little nurseries. And um, most of them just can't be used. You just can't use them. All completely wiped out by hurricanes. All wiped out by um, uh, rough seas. So what we've got for you here is unspeakably rare. And when we went over there, we were under strict, uh, we, we, there was, there was no, um, wow, look at that, isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? There was, um, there was uh, you know, we were, we were made aware very, very quickly um, that the deals we were, had access to, this, this really is it, this, this, this really, really is it. Um, uh, you know, queen conches are becoming rarer. Um, there are certain, there's certain limitations as to the queen conches which can be harvested. They're harvested for their meat. It's a delicacy, it's delicious apparently. And the shells and the, and the pearls which are made from the same calcite um, uh, material, the same kind of calcification um, uh, material, um, are incredibly, incredibly sought after. But it can only be a certain queen conch at a certain age, uh, which is a certain level of maturity that can be harvested. And these, are, these tend to be the queen conches with over 20 or 30 kind of horns on them. Um, you are looking here at probably some of the only queen conch we will ever have and these pieces, by the way, we, I believe we've shared some of these pieces with Gemporia. These, though, these earrings are brand new. Brand new. They'd never been bought to air before on their own. Never been bought to air on their own before. I'm going to put these up to the ear. They're going to go amazing with what you're wearing. I just... They'll go amazing with You anything. imagine that on your wedding day. Imagine that. Oh my gosh, I love them. I actually, I, I, oh. Yes, beautiful. My gosh. So elegant. The pinks are so striking, but as you said, you've mentioned this a couple of times, Debbie, the, the oranges, the coral colors, the apricot tones are 
stunning. Now we do have, and we have bought this to wear before, a gorgeous oh, matching, pendant. matching pendant to go with this. What I love about the way this has been carved, don't you think it's almost like an animal print carving? which you've got here, which is absolutely, if I just move that there, there we go. Almost an animal print carving, which you've got there. And it's and it's not kind of like a willy nilly, oh, I'll just put a carving there no. and I'll put an aperture there. It's completely symmetrical. It's absolutely beautiful. It's like really fine lace work, isn't it? Reminds it reminds me a bit of coral. Oh, totally, totally. You can't you can't harvest coral anymore. No, um, live coral, quite anyway. rightly. Um, absolutely. So you're not gonna be able to get anything like that. But oh. when you look at this, it comes out of the sea and I think I expected it to be one flat colour. No. But when you see it in real life, I came straight to it when I came in this morning and I was very surprised by the, the subtlety to the different, it's almost ombre. Absolutely, that, absolutely ombre, absolutely ombre. Yeah. And also, um, just to remind you and to make this, and to, the reason, one of the main reasons why we visited why we literally flew to the other side of the world and we were all insanely jealous of Dave when he went over there. And then he was really, really ill when he was there. He oh, had really no. bad um, uh, 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 kind of glandular fever kind oh, of, no. he was really, really poorly. Um, so actually he, he, he didn't, I mean, he had a wonderful time, but it wasn't, it wasn't kind of like all, all, all that it, 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 it looked like on there. Um, but one of the main reasons why we'd made that trip over there was it's so important to us here at the Gemporia Group to make sure that all of our gems are ethically sourced. We obviously can't harvest um, conch. Uh, sorry, I beg your pardon. We obviously can't harvest um, uh, uh, coral. You can't go to a, a live coral reef. It's a living organism. Yeah. You can't. You can't go to a living organism and start plucking bits no, off it. Not that, that's, you, you know, no. no, no, absolutely no way. Um, so, how can we bring you something like this? Um, well, the only way we can bring it to you uh, is is to go there, go direct to source, and make sure that it is ethically sourced. If we were buying it off some random spreadsheet, uh, then yeah, we, we've really got no control over where it's coming from, yeah. I suppose. Um, but this is all one hundred percent ethically sourced. Normally, people would send their buying trip. We send our gem experts there. We send you know we send our actual team members. Yeah, I think that says a lot. Huge amount because they're checking that it. We're giving you what we say we're giving you. And that's, and that's the only way that we have got to where we've got to now. And that's, you know, with, our, with all of our pearls, we visit our pearl farmers. Yeah. We, we visit the pearl farms. Um, uh, and, we, and, we, and we meet with them. We tell them exactly what we want and what our standards are. And it's only by doing that that we have access to the best pearls in the world. Um, if, we were just buying off, if we were just buying off an Excel spreadsheet, we could be sent any old rubbish. But we don't. And we, and we do. And we, this is what puts us apart from everybody else is we put that footwork in because we realize how important it is to a make sure that we are educating ourselves but most importantly that everything that we get is honest is transparent and is ethically sourced now price point wise it is one of those things that i think a lot of people out there just don't you know you don't really care you want it it's so magnetic it talks to you but we've got to bring you a price point okay um, we're at one thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine pounds. Now that might seem like—I mean, I, I mean, I don't know—is that a good price? I don't know. I've got a piece on. Um, sorry, lovely. I've got a piece on. Here we go. This is oh, off um, uh, uh, a, a British website uh, from a British jeweller, and it's an eighteen mil. It's I mean, it's, I mean, it's a nice size. It's what I mean, yeah. eighteen mils. What that isn't it? It's yeah. just over a centimeter, yeah. um, and it's um, pink conch. Gorgeous. Tuberose shape, beautiful, Dahlia necklace, gorgeous. 200 quid. These earrings, carved. And you've got that gorgeous sterling silver setting. And you've got white zircons set, 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 set into the sterling silver. Bezel, six grams of 925 sterling silver. We're at 500 pounds. I think that's a brilliant deal. Maker in London, Surrey, Swansea's got two, Andrea in Nottinghamshire, Sharon in Dorset, Fiona in Hampshire. Now, Neary, remind me, how many, of these, how many pairs of these did we make? Ooh. 50. Now, I do have, I do have this pendant coming up. This pendant isn't new. We actually bought this to air, I believe it was Sunday. Um, we, we have got some of these left in stock. If you want to get the matching set, the matching suite. <laughs> yes. 
We're going to give everyone the same chance. These are, these have never been bought to wear on their own. Love it. Absolutely beautiful. 20 seconds, we are going to be doing something pretty dramatic with the price point. Okay. You've got your individual split payments, yeah, with the green jade, all of a sudden it looks cherry blossom, all of a sudden it looks very zen, all of a sudden it looks very kind of almost Japanese. Yes. Gorgeous, hey? Here we go. How about we, oh, I don't know, half the price. 249. Nowhere near our price. Oh. Now is the time for you to get involved on the phone lines. Now is the time for you to put this in your baskets. Now is the time for you to go, okay, they only made 50 of these. I need to start acting on this now. Yeah, this could be your only chance to get these earrings. These could sell out in one fell swoop. Look at those split payments there, Debbie. 83 pounds. Wow. Pretty impressive, hey? You know, when you talk about something being precious, mm. to me, things like this are really precious mm -hmm. because they're rare. They come from mother nature exclusively. That, lovely. You can see how... You can see that setting, see the quality. The you can quality, see the sterling how silver. How the gems are set. I mean, we're not even talking about even that. Even on the earring yet. finding, even on, the, even on this part of the earring finding, you've got white zircon set in there. That is the time and the effort and the reverence we have. I mean, that, that is absolutely amazing. Swansea's got two pairs. Oh, my God. And look at that slight ombre of colour there as well. Yeah. I Here mean, look. Oh, look. gosh. Here we go. This is going to go absolutely mad. This is going to go absolutely nuts. Here we go. Enjoy. Best of luck, everyone. It's crazy. It's stupid. One, two, nine. <laughs> yes. Get in there. Well done. Individual split payments of £43. Absolutely amazing. And look at this. 1.8. Uh, so you're 18 millimetres. That's 1.8 centimetres. Let me get my ruler. This is a really beautiful Regla. sort of legacy pair of earrings. So if you're buying something for... Somebody's done. I know I'm going to keep going on about exams because that's what's going on in no, my house. No, I think you're absolutely You know, right. if someone's having a 16th, 18th birthday, I've also had those in this year. Um, if someone's just worked really hard on their degree or their exams, or and mm. you want to give them something to keep. Yeah. And I know that might sound a bit old fashioned or something to keep, but this is the sort of thing that you would keep throughout your life because it's got a story behind it. Amazing. And just tell them all about it absolutely so they've got this amazing story and i really do think that stuff like this is the something to keep absolutely i think i think that's a gorgeous i think that's a beautiful sentiment debbie i really do 18 mil by the way is here so 18 millimeters is around about is it that about half of the earrings it is, it is about the whole uh thing? it's there so that's 1.8 mil okay, okay so that okay so these are 20 by 38 mil mm. And the ear, and and the pen, and, and you get two and the pendant we've just shown you is eighteen mil and it's two hundred quid. We're at one hundred and twenty nine for them both. Individual split payments of forty three pounds. Sharon in Dorset, Lorna in Tyne and Weir, Frieda in Cornwall, Virginia in Hampshire, Marion in Manchester, Stella in Devon, Tracy in North Yorkshire, Suzanne in Sussex, Andrea in Notts, Sharon in Dorset, and Fiona in Hampshire. Check out your baskets as soon as you can. There's loads and loads and loads of you with these in your baskets. Absolutely ridiculous. We've got the matching pendant coming up as well, which is really super exciting. Uh, can't wait to bring you that. All set into nine two five sterling silver with your white zircon as well. So not Cabixaconia. Absolutely 100% white zircon. Debbie, put your order in now. We don't mind. Both Susie and Alison do. Please do the same, says Chris in uh, Devon. <laughs> well, I must admit, for the first time, I think, in the whole of my career, I have my phone accessible over there. There you go. Usually it's away. Is there any way you can... Oh, whoa! Julie? Who do you think you are, Julie? <clears throat> Good plan, Julie. <laughs> Is there any Good way plan. you can get them to £99? Pretty, please. They're beautiful. I know they're beautiful. Neary. Neary. Neary is feeling. How many people do we need to put them in the baskets to get it to 99 then? Another 10. About another 10 people. Woohoo! 99 Neary, pounds, amazing! Neary Nu Nu Nana is feeling very generous today. Good call, Julie. <laughs> He's saying if we can see another 10 people with this in their baskets. He's got a weekend of cricket right. ahead of him. Oh, yes. Absolutely lovely. Okay, so 
If we can see 10 more people with this in their baskets, he's going to take these down to 99.99. Come on, oh, everyone. Come on, gosh. everyone. <laughs> Enjoy loads and loads and loads of you there. Well done. Absolutely fantastic. Now, these are available on split payments. They are interest free. You don't pay any more if you go for split payments. You don't pay any more. Kate in Dorset, well oh. done to you. Maria, <laughs> Teresa, Maker, Marion, Stella, Tracy. There she is. I loads and loads ten. and loads. Of you. I can see 10. <laughs> there we go. Well done. Absolutely fantastic. Well done, everybody. Add it to your order as quickly as you can. Was it Tracy who asked for us to go lower? Julie. Julie! Julie, where Julie, are Julie. you, Julie? Where is Julie? Where is Julie? Enjoy. Oh, hello. Hello. Five seconds. Price point going down. Go on, Neary. Go on. Neary, 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 Neary. Sterling silver, white zircon, and your queen conch. 99. 99, yes, Sold. oh no, just 99 pounds, not even 99, 99, 99. Sold. Sold. Sold, absolutely gone. There you go, well done. Maker in Nottinghamshire, maker, oh, Channel Islands, London, Manchester, Devon, North Yorkshire, well done to you, absolutely gorgeous. Loads and loads and loads of you coming through to get these today, well done, they are absolutely tremendous, aren't they? Kane, Cambridgeshire, all the glitters in Lancashire, Anna in Derbyshire, well done to you, Nottinghamshire's through. Well done to you, lots and lots and lots of people there. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, isn't that wonderful? If anyone sees an Alex in West Yorkshire, let me know. <laughs> Marion in Northern Tyne and Weir, well done to you. Come on, Alex. He won't be watching. Will he not? Has he got nah. meetings? Yeah. Oh, Alex. It's okay, my phone's over there, don't worry. She's probably going to scuttle off. Scuttle off. Al Al Alison did some scuttling yesterday. Did she do that? Scuttling off <laughs> and buying things. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Judith and Surrey, well done to you. Absolutely no shame whatsoever. Well done to you. London, well done to you. Oh, no, you've got three in your basket. Check out. Yeah, there's a lot of you with these in baskets. Absolutely droves of you. We've got 10 pairs remaining. We've got Surrey, Tyne and Weir, Lancashire, Cambridgeshire, Channel Islands, Amaker, Greater London, Greater Manchester, Surrey, Sussex, Nottinghamshire, Devon, Greater Manchester, and a load more makers with this in their baskets. Please, 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 please check out your baskets as soon as you can. They are remarkably beautiful earrings. Sharon and Caffilly, you could get these, my lovely. I need you to check out. Judith and Surrey, check out. Absolutely amazing. Nine pairs left. Only the first time these have ever been bought to air on their own. Well done. That is absolutely correct. I can't believe the amount of people who've got this in, uh, with these in baskets. Oh, yeah, you're going to lose pounds. out if you don't check out. And I think you'll regret it because when you get them home, if you love them, what you're seeing here, wait till you get them home. And I you know. Open, and you open that oh, parcel and there they are. There <laughs> they are. And yours will have that kind of ombre. Yours will look so beautiful. Yours are completely unique. Oh, they're gorgeous. They're just so beautiful, aren't they? Should we do the pendant? Yes, please. <laughs> okay, this comes to you in the box. Beautiful. That's what I call a gifting experience. Yes. So you open it and the whole experience... Oh, hang on, hang on. The ribbon. Oh, the ribbon. Yeah, the ribbon. <gasps> oh, it's got a... Look at the... Of course it does. Queen conch. It's got a crown on the front. Of course it does. My friend Holly always says, ne always remember to wear your invisible crown. Yes. It's on. <laughs> oh, that's adorable. Oh, and then you oh, open it. <laughs> Honestly, this looks so good. Then you open it, boom, and there it is. Oh, it's stunning. What a thing of, be I'm getting it out, I'm getting it out. Yeah. This is absolutely, <gasps> where are my tweezers? This is absolutely Can you ridiculous. imagine if you've got the earrings and then you wear this as well? I mean, oh yes. Debbie, that, so is, that is so... Lo look at the colour. Look yeah. at the ombre. That really shows you there, doesn't it? Like the ombre. Totally, yeah. Ombre-ness. Don't just you made love ombre-ness? <laughs> Don't you love that um, patination yes. you're getting as well? The, the carved quality is so beautiful here. How clever is that? Really is, isn't it? Mm. Is it like an animal print maybe or, or watermark almost? It looks or? like a butterfly. I can see a butterfly. Can you? Yeah. Yeah, it is a little bit butterfly-ish, isn't it? So pretty. Oh, will you look at that? Absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Let's do a one minute clock straight down. And just look at that. You've got gemmed, a white zircon on the front of the bale. 
and on the back. There's a good amount of sterling silver there as well, isn't there? Isn't that gorgeous? Well done, here comes Kinga. Striding over with a chain and a bus. She's so good. Kinga, you're amazing. We have, we really have got the best team here, haven't we? Just we certainly have. Amazing gang. Okay, oh gosh. Here we go. I know, I know. I know. Sorry, I've got, I've got, I've got Ollie saying, how, 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 how much is, how much is, I know, I know we shouldn't have done that with the earrings, I know. Oh gosh, we are going to be so, so much trouble. Yeah, of course we're going to get in trouble. I think once they see it on the bust, because that makes all the difference. Look, 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 look. Yes. Look. Oh my word. Look. You know, we've had to have this signed off by Georgia, our head buyer, and by Wayno, our head gemstone buyer, and by Dave, one of our gem experts. I know. Yeah, I know. 99 pounds, absolutely phenomenal. Well done. Oh gosh, it's available on four split payments. Oh no. Oh gosh, 25 quid split payment. Oh, oh no. gosh, I can't look at that. How oh many gosh, are no. There? Oh no. Ha. Ah. Okay, it's available on four split payments of 24.75. Oh, gee whiz. Oh. Oh. Oh, isn't that just adorables? Absolutely oh, I adorable. I love it. Matching that pricey YC. Well done to Swansea. Well done to Dorset. Well done to more makers there. That is absolutely. You've got to get the sweet. Yeah, I th it's something that you're not going to see anywhere else. That you're not going to see anyone else wearing unless you come across another JM viewer. But I know. You know, it very, very, very rare, very unusual. I think the only places you're going to come across people wearing this is if you go to Monte Carlo or maybe the uh, <laughs> the Amalfi Coast or or a really expensive cruise. Oh yes. One of those cruises where there's only like a dozen people on the boat and they take you around the world and it's just wow. Oh, yes. Yes, please. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. Okay, we've got a star by. Look at everyone coming through. This is amazing. Star by. Um, okay, this Debbie might actually lose her mind when, <laughs> when we do this. She's been going on and on and on I'm about sorry. this all. Okay, star by carved flower pendant. Let's go. Debbie, excited. Debbie, literally with two seconds ago. I love this. I love this. How much is this? Sorry. Um, I know. I did I that. Know. It's God's honest. All right, Debbie. Um, honestly. And then I looked like I needed to go to the toilet. That wasn't the face I was going for. <laughs> I don't. I'm fine. <laughs> um, this, this. This is a Hawaiian garland. Oh, I love this so this much. This is a Hawaiian garland. You know, those beautiful ladies in the grass skirts, and they just look stunning, don't they? And the gentlemen in the... Right. Um, and the eh? Oh no, that's sumo wrestlers. That's Ignore me. Oh, oh. It's like a tropical rainforest garland. Uh, look at this kind of almost passion flower you've got here. This hibiscus flower. It looks like oh. where it's from. Yes, totally, totally. I need this. I need it. I need it. How many miles is this from Hawaii? I mean, I mean, you, it, you do. Um, you do um, very often forget how far Hawaii is from, from, from the US, don't you? You think, oh, it's just around the corner because it's on you know, the same yeah, map. Yeah, yeah. It's actually you know, another seven hour flight or whatever. Uh, but I'd be, interested to, I'd be interested to know kind of how far away it is because it is, it's got that kind of Hawaiian feel it to really it. It really does. It's kind of tropical. The closest I've got to Hawaii is Hawaiian Tropic Sun Cream. <laughs> Me too. You know Hawaiian Tropic Sun. <laughs> yeah. It's like the it's like the label of the Hawaiian Tropic Sun yeah. Cream, isn't it? With the hibiscus flower in, with all the gorgeous roses, and you think, oh yes, if I if I if I if I use this sun cream, I'm going to smell like I've been to Hawaii or whatever. It's, I'm those, such a consumer. What I really are those am. things that they put around your neck? Is it called a lay? I think it's called. Yes, that's exactly. Right. exactly. I was going to say a garland, but it is a lay. It's like a lay that you get to keep forever and never die. Precisely. That's what I like about it. It really appeals to me, this, because I love flowers. <gasps> oh my gosh, how wonderful. I need this. Yeah, so do I. It, 
the carving, what There's I like, about, what I love about Sorry. this as well, don't you love the way that it's been carved and it kind of spills over? It's not, it's got no border. Yeah, that's what I mean. It's totally the opposite to organic. the Organic. Look. Yeah. Sorry, they're going to get so sick of me saying, look, they're sitting there at home going, Deb, we're looking. Or it's like when you see photographs in like a spa brochure of meditation with floating flowers and yes. lotus flowers and yes. floating candles and think that. Very is, organic. Oh, they it? are. They are. Look at. Look at that. It reminds me of our Jade Master carvings. Yes. Oh, absolutely. Oh, lovely. I can't hear you, Neary. Go on, Neary, no. That's all right, darling. Don't worry. They still haven't told me how much it is. They're not going to tell me. Oh, it is a pinch bell. Yes. Yeah, good call. 999. 999. Okay. There's space there. Yeah, you can. Oh, Ollie, that's a. Did you hear what Ollie said? I did. You could most certainly create a lariat because you've got the space there. Oh, Ollie, you need to be a guest designer. Ollie is is He's making this game. design in his head. All right, sell then. at Sotheby's for with about green, twenty grand. With the jade, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. I'm going to put it with the jade. I'm going to put it with the queen conch. I'm going to put it with the branca. I'm going to put it with the cotard. I'm going to put it with the. I'm going to put it with the South Sea pearl. I'm going to put it with this. Okay, Ollie, that would be a lovely kit, but it would cost 20 grand. <laughs> <laughs> How many of these have we got? And why not throw in a tube of E6000 Glim as well, Ollie? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Maker in Cornwall, West Midlands, Hampshire, Dorset, Swansea, Kent. I don't care how much this is. I don't care. I don't care. So popular. Oh, I love it. Seven oh, left. No. Oh, Debbie, you're not going to. Oh, no, that is genuine disappointment in that little face there. Oh, gosh. It's just slightly uncomfortable now. Oh, Debbie's not very happy. Oh gosh, I can just tell. You know, you can tell. Me. Oh no, it's fine. I'm really happy for everyone. Hawaii is four days on a cruise ship from San Diego. Four days. Or well, 7,210 miles from England. Oh gosh, don't, don't, that's how to depress me, Carol. I reckon I could swim it. <laughs> On a good day. On a good day. Carved up. <laughs> With a fair wind, yeah, larded up. <laughs> Why not? Tell you what, I don't need any of that. Uh, five chances remaining. We're at two, four, two, four, nine. That is a master carving. Sorry, Michael, I'm moving this all over the top. I just love it. It's such a beautiful piece. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done, everybody. Go, 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 go. 0800 six, triple four, six, double five. <sighs> it's so beautiful. Four opportunities. We've got Maker, Maker in Cornwall, Mary in West Midlands, Hazel in Hampshire. Oh, bit of alliteration. Uh, and uh, Sharon in Dorset and Marion in Greater Manchester. Marion in Manchester. Check out triply over allocated there. Bonkers, bonkers, bonkers. Well done. I just love, those flowers are so beautiful. Look at your face. You are transfixed, aren't you? I'm proper sulky. <laughs> she so is, isn't she? I'm proper sulky. It's like an 18th or a 21st birthday present. Yeah, it absolutely is. Reminds me of a cameo, actually. And I know it's yes. nothing like a cameo, but you know the backdrop of a cameo because it's got that lovely kind of, in, not enamel, but kind of almost like a, an ivory kind of finish, a very, very kind of solid finish. Um, oh, sorry, no, sorry, the top of a cameo has got that kind of solid finish mm -hmm. to it. And you normally have a translucent background. It reminds me of the front of a cameo. It's beautiful. Marion, well done to you. Oh, gosh, no, you haven't checked out. Check out my lovelies. Five, five seconds and we're taking the details away. Two opportunities remaining. That is it. And you get the box. Yeah, you get the box as well. Oh, yeah, we'll even give you the box. You get the whole experience. The whole experience. I want to spray it with some kind of lovely tropical scent or something. So when you open it, it's like... <sighs> <laughs> Lovely. Should we do another pendant? Shall we? I don't know if my heart can Stuff take it. Stuff it. Oh, oh look at oh, that. For... That's very Art Deco. Oh, yes. Completely different feel. Very... Red carpet Oscars, deep plunging V-neckline. Oh, my God. You know, on Julia Roberts, and then she's got this on. You, it, oh, you, Julia It wouldn't Roberts. be out of place, would it? No. <laughs> this, is got, this is regimented, isn't it? Whereas the last one was very organic. Mm. It's amazing how different it looks, but look, so one thing doesn't change, that ombre. Oh, look at that recording. Mm. That is just... That shows it, what we can see here. That shows it. 
Nice job. Look at that. Nice job, guys. Yeah, just the bead at the top is absolutely sensational. The bead at the top, by the way, is the kind of bead that other people will use in their jewellery, you know, as the centrepiece, as the main piece, and it will be, you know, four or five figures. This one is the complete opposite of the last one. Yes, totally. But it's nice, clean lines, very, very elegant. Look at that. Look at that ombre. Pink, yes. pink, pink. Oh. Darling. That is lovely. Really, really stunning. Sun-kissed, slightly kind of, you know how driftwood gets that lovely sun-bleached mm. look? It's, like, it's almost that, like a faded look, but it's, I wonder what the other side's like. Oh, you see, this is just, so, this is just such a glorious, look, look at the way it's been finished as well. That's, yeah. the, that's the outside of the shell, which is a more solid colour. Does it spin? Oh, I don't know. It's a good question, Ollie. I don't think it does, no. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. And what's so lovely is, one, the recording, and this one here, two different things. You know, yours will be ever yeah. so slightly different. They could never be the same, could they? No. Because it's no. Mother Nature. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, my gosh. If you're in the market, could you use these as earrings? <laughs> yes. Oh, my gosh. Julia Roberts could. <laughs> She could, she could literally wear a bin bag and look amazing, couldn't she? Just amazing. Oh, I what's her name? Scarlett Johansson. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. She has got no business being so beautiful, has she? No, they, I just think that this will make anyone feel beautiful, something like this. Absolutely. When you're having that day where you wake up and you look in the mirror and think, oh, Well, really? that's what we were saying earlier on. You're having yeah. a day and you feel, mm. I'm 20 but, in my head. Put your queen's lunch <laughs> on. You feel like a million dollars. Yes, yeah, beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, yeah, here we go, everyone, all the way down. Oh, look, very, very popular. Dorset, Hampshire, Surrey, East Sussex, Fife and Hampshire. Oh, 249. That's, so good. that's so good. That really is. And it looks like that kind of caliber of the last piece was very organic, wasn't it? Whereas this piece looks very kind of Christie's, Bonham's, yeah. you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. Sotheby's. It really does, doesn't it? Looks like something that's, that's sold at auction before. And it is that kind of little nod to that Hegu kind of quality as well, isn't it? You've got those gorgeous, um, what do you call, um, uh, white topaz, no, sorry, not white topaz, white zircons set into that stone. See, I love zircons. Well. I much mm, prefer having zircons in than um, a cubic zirconia. Oh, or, definitely. Because or even a diamond. Yeah, the zircons are so sparkly and fiery. They're so bright. They're so bright. Yeah, the oldest, the, um, pretty much the oldest gemstone in the world, older than the hills. Eileen, well done to you, my lovely. Uh, do check out, my love, 249, individual split payments of 83 pounds. That's just absolutely, look at that. It, look, it looks a little bit like a vinyl as well, doesn't it? Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. It's so beautiful. I think it's why the zircon works so well with it, because they're completely different textures. Almost a marker site, isn't yeah, it, with yeah. that setting? Beautiful. Really, really lovely. Well done, everybody. I've got, still got loads more to get through, so please just add on to your order as, as and when. Yeah, we do have strands coming up as well. I know we bought you lots of ready-made pieces, but we do have some strands coming up as well, which is really exciting. So please uh, do make sure you add those onto your order. Okay, next, let's do ring kit. Oh, no, we didn't get to do this the other day. Should we make it into a thingy? Stand by, stand by, stand by. Okay. Ah, oh, there you go. Whoop, doop, doop, doop. Okay. Is, it, it is this ring, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I need to see this, Carol. I need to see it. I need to see it. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's cleaning it. She's a proper jeweler. I want to see it. I want to see it. Yeah, you're right. We we can't bring coral to air. Um, oh, absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous.
the most beautiful, simple setting for this. Absolutely gorgeous. You've got your, you've got your um, prong settings here. You've got your white zircon set into the shank of the ring. And then you're also oh, given the most beautiful queen conch. Isn't that beautiful? How is that going to be to set? How am I going to set it, Debbie? Just easy with pliers for this. Um, you're gem setting pliers with the long uh, jaws, or you, sorry, I'm mesmerised, um, or you could just use a pusher to set that. But yeah. It, it's just so elegant, isn't it? So pretty. There's a ring that we found on first dibs, conch pearl diamond platinum ring. Now, I know there's diamonds, yep. And I know there's platinum. Uh, yep, we know that, yep. And it's queen conch, yep. Okay, lovely. Right, where's the value? Is it in the platinum? Well, platinum's a really rare, precious metal. So, ah, arguably, I will always go for sterling silver over a platinum. Always, 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 always. It's much brighter, it's much whiter. Platinum looks grey by comparison. Okay, is the value in the diamonds? Well, ah, diamonds are great. Diamonds are brilliant. Diamonds are also kind of part of the biggest marketing campaign in the world ever for any gemstone. Yeah. Um, diamonds are not as rare as you think they are. So where's the value in that 4,633 pounds? It's in the conch. Purely I in don't, the conch. I don't like that very much, um, just from a design point of view. It doesn't work for me, it's I, too bulky. But I don't like the diamonds on the side, no, like, like that, the big diamonds. No, I don't like it either. Somebody does. That's okay, that's fine. See, look how that works, because you, your eye is drawn to Balanced. the centre cent stone, which is, and that isn't, that's no. just a one big bleh. Yeah. Whereas our piece... So I won't be spending £5,000 on that. Okay, well, okay, well, what about £1,999? Okay, well, oh gosh, that's a little bit more than I wanted to spend. I'd like to, yeah, can we get it lower? Can we take, oh, look at that colour. Can we take it lower? Let's take it under a thousand pounds. Oh yeah, come on. Let's take. Let's take at least a thousand pounds off. Nine nine nine. We're nowhere near done. Nowhere near done. Let's give you a minute clock. We've got sizes. Oh, can I have the sizes, please, lovely? The um, the customer names, and then we can look at the sizes. We got N to O, P to Q, R to S, L to M. N O L M L M N O P Q R S and we might even have T to U. Yeah, we we'll have, have a little look. Yeah, I can it. see we've got T to U as well. So that's gosh, that size is L to M. That size is six all the way up to size ten. But if you want a bigger one, in my experience, they sell out first because yeah. we don't have as many of them. Mm. So if you're needing a bigger size, then get in there quickly absolutely get in there my quickly. mum used to struggle with that she needed the bigger size and every she had to get in because they would sell out first watch this price drop watch this price drop what price drop 9992 no 99 oh gosh Ah, and it's still on split pay. Oh, that's sick. Ah, 49.99. Go, 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 go. Amazing. Well done. What do you mean? Yes, my name's Carol. Not done. L to M, five left. N to O, 25 left. That's the one we've got the biggest quantity of. Yep. P to Q, 15 left. R to S, five left. T to U, one left. If you want T to U, get it now. We are dropping the price again. What, from 99? Hmm? Well, I think you should leave it at 99. <laughs> no. have, I'm going to have to apologise to it again. Julie in Nottinghamshire, Lisa, Sharon, Jennifer, Jennifer, uh, Fiona, well done. Uh, check out, please. T to U, we've got one left. R to S and L to M, we've got five left each. Go, 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 go. They are absolutely gorgeous. Well done, everyone. 18 seconds, the price point is going to go down. I've, honestly, I've got no idea how low we're going. No idea. Christina, Fiona, Maker, Marion, Julie, Lisa, Sharon, 
Oh gosh, there you go. It just need you just need to set this either with a pair of pliers or a pusher. Very, very simple to be able to set that though. No worries whatsoever. Marie, well done to you. What? Check out my lovelies. Oh. 79. 79. 79 pounds. Oh yeah. Split payments of 39 pounds really, really and 50 pence. Absolutely remarkable there you go everyone it's a go 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 well done okay p to q becoming more limited now t to u r to s and l to m really 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 limited check out please check out there's millions of you there oh my gosh well done 79 pounds absolutely gorgeous a queen conch ring for 79 pounds not 4633 pounds I know. For £79 in sterling silver. Yep, I know. Incredible. Well done. PTQ, very, very popular. So we've got sizes 6 all the way up to size 10 in uh, ring sizes. We're going to have to do a minute to close just purely because we've got loads to get through still. Oh, gosh. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, gosh. We've got like seven things left to play. I don't know whether we're going to have a chance to get through them all, but we'll get through as much as we can. Well done, everybody. One left still in a TTU if you want to add it onto your order. Loads of you there still. Absolutely wonderful. And it's such a lovely, uncomplicated, simple ring that you're getting here. And because your stone's not set, if you can't get the size that you need, then you can take it to a jeweller yeah. to be resized because the stone's not in yet. So even yeah. if you don't set the stones yourself, um, you can take that to a jeweller and, and they will be able to just set that in two minutes. It's really not difficult. Yeah, exactly. Maker in London, Marie in South Yorkshire, Ella in Gloucestershire, Marion in Greater Manchester, Julie in Nottinghamshire, Lisa in County Durham, Sharon in Dorset, Jennifer in Surrey, Jennifer in Staffordshire, and about 20 more of you have got this in your baskets. Please, please, please check your baskets out. That is going to sell out today. Well done. Oh. oh. What a load of treats. I know. Just beautiful. Next. Oh, gosh. Oh, yes. I love this one. one. This is my favourite. This is absolutely beautiful. What, what is it you love? I think I know what you're going to say. I just love the shape. And I love that you can properly see those um, ombre tones in this one. Banding, the, that's the, it, the banding. The shape. It looks much better than that in real life. Okay, so the shape of these is amazing. So you've got your large rounds, okay, with the bandings, your smaller rounds. But it is this. Yes, look. It's this rice bead shape, oh, which for me yes. is just, oh. Oh, I love this. Oh, and um, you got this as well. Has this got the... So this is a beautiful oh. connector. You've got two, you've got little loops there and a little loop here. This is designed to be set into the necklace. It will sit kind of like that. Yeah, as it's recorded, oh, it will beautiful. sit like that in your necklace. That's white zircon in there, by the way, and all sterling silver. Isn't that just delightful? Gorgeous. Three strands of your conch. Now, how are you, how on earth are you going to set this? Oh, look. Look at these. Yeah, it's all very well bringing you ready-made pieces of conch jewellery and, you know, uh, things which need to be set, etc., etc. But making it workable like this in strands is just amazing. Look at the, look at the lines and the patinations going through these. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? I just think that... It's something that, it's that you will get out and just look at and yeah. just decide what you're going to do with it. But for me, I would buy it to make something for myself. Because, again, it's that piece of jewellery that you're going to make that's totally unusual, that nobody else has got, that you pass down. Yeah. You know, it's that special, that special piece that... Absolutely. Oh, I just think it's... I'm stunning. just literally just rolling it. Can you see how it moves, how it changes? Isn't it just gorgeous? The lines, the patinations, the stripes. Magical. Look at it. Look at it move. Look at it change. It's absolutely. Look at this one. Look at this one here. This one there. Oh, no. Sorry. 50 50. Split perfectly. 
Can you see it? Just oh, there. Oh, yes. They're all amazing, aren't they? That one there is beautiful That's what as well, I love that about one. it. That, I was very surprised. I thought it was just like a pale pink, but it no, isn't No, 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 no. The lines, I mean, they, they're almost planetary, aren't they? Look at that. Look at that. Oh, wow. It's so beautiful. Oh, look at that piece of jewelry. These layers of this gorgeous kind of calcification. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, Linda's uh, beautiful. In fact, I think it's Claire who made that necklace, but um, Linda had this kit as well, and she made some a, a lovely kind of floral piece, which is beautiful. That's Claire's necklace that she made a few weeks ago. That's stunning. Isn't that just gorgeous? Stunning. A triple strand necklace. I mean, what on earth? It's just incredible. Yeah, maybe this kit, absolutely beautiful. The quality you're getting here, amazing. That, that gorgeous connector as well is just sublime. It's just all, it's just, it all ties together so beautifully and it's so much more interesting as you say Debbie than just a pale pink gem I'm not a pale pink girl no neither am I I'm neither not am I. really a pale pink girl at all um, so I'm surprised that this appeals to me so much but I think it's because it is so rare it's so yeah. mother nature yeah it comes from the sea the story behind it and i didn't expect it as i've said so many times before to have so many different colors yeah to it. the ombre that you get within these is just absolutely beautiful we're at 999 we're not done okay it's nowhere near your price how many of these do we have neary okay okay right so 50 odd seconds we're going to be taking the price point all the way down for you <laughs> okay, um, the rounds I love. Would you separate the rounds and the and the rice beater? We do you use them together, Debbie. What do you reckon? Like I often say with it, with a kit like this, you need to snip them all off. Yeah. Snip them off. Don't don't be put off by looking at the strands because it, it puts you off. Get your bead mat, snip them, mix them, and then see what comes to your mind. Because I'm thinking that I would mix them. I think mixing these would be. Uh, it would add that air of uh, organic uh, yeah. kind of uh, that kind of organic quality that is just going to look absolutely look at that it's going to look absolutely beautiful. Sometimes you can't see past the strands. Yes, absolutely. You get a bit kind of blinded by yeah. all the kind of gems. Look and at the size of the drill hole as well. Look at the size of the drill hole. Can you see that there? Sorry, the size of the drill hole. Really impressive. That's very impressive. Because yeah. You could get multiple strands through there, which means that you've got. Absolutely. Far more design. Yep, absolutely. You know, possibilities. 499. Oh, wow. 499. Incredible. And you've got the gorgeous connector as well. Uh, solid sterling silver. And of course, the box. Well done, more Agony Lothian. Oh, look at that gorgeous pair of earrings. Oh, they are really, 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 really. Are, are those the ones that um, Linda made? I think they are. Yeah, the ones Linda made for Sunday. Oh, here's a necklace that Linda oh, made. Isn't wow. that beautiful? Very, very Linda, that. It's That's absolutely beautiful, beautiful, isn't it? Isn't it gorgeous? Look at the rice. And she's used them together. She's used the rice uh, uh, shapes with the rounds as well. Isn't that just gorgeous? Well done. Beautiful. And, and the colours, the oranges, the pinks, the whites, the creams. It's all just absolutely mesmerizing but you know if you really wanted to eke this out just one that one there in a, in the middle of a wish style bracelet just beautiful well that design that we saw there of linda's she's not used many of them no nope. you know very so very you, i think i'd go economical with them big or go home but because i'd want to see them all together but yeah. you don't have to do that you can be you can make them really go a long way. You really can do, because you get so many, you get such an indulgent amount. Okay, we're at 499, individual split payments of 124.75, three chances left, 20 seconds, and we're taking the details away. We're going to leave you to fight that out amongst yourselves. Well done. Absolutely fantastic. I love I love them all. Look at them all. T oh, twisted together. They just look the business, don't they? they? Really do. <gasps> the actual business. Well done. Oh, yeah. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well done. Beautiful. Well done, everyone. 0800 644 Marion, all the glitters. Uh, Morag. Sharon, well done to you, my lovely. Checking your baskets out. Really great to see you all there. So over allocated. Oh, my gosh. Well done. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Please, please, please check out your baskets. Well done. Those split payments are amazing. This split payment. Do you remember the time before split payments? I'm so pleased we can bring split payments and it's just to like, now. You know, very few of us, I think, have like £500, or actually it seems like so much to find all at once. Yes. But if you've got that option, and, and then if you have the interest, you think, well, that's going to add on. Um, because it's interest-free, 
for me personally, it makes it more affordable because, yes. you know, you don't have to sign sure. this, this amount at once, do for you? For sure. And it's interest free. You're not spending any more. You know, when you look at kind of, you know, you buy something on, on yeah. finance or whatever and you yeah. look at the interest. Oh, my gosh. Crazy. It's just unbelievable. The amount of interest. I mean, it's farcical. It's, it's daylight robbery. Whereas here, it's interest free split payments that you've got, which is just wicked. You're not paying any more. You're not, you're not being penalised against. Which one are we going to do now? Oh, yes. Brilliant. OK, awesome. Ooh. This is classic. I love that. Is it a clasp? I believe it is. Oh, that's beautiful. You're beautiful. That's that cool. is so elegant. You get a strand of round. Um, beautiful round <sighs> queen conch. I want to put oh, those with pearls. Yeah. Isn't that lovely? Yes, with pearls. I think that's a lovely idea, Debbie. Here we go. Look at that beautiful queen conch um, sterling silver clasp. You literally just compress that. There you go. Pull it out. There you go. Absolutely gorgeous. Isn't that just beautiful? Oh, it's stunning. Um, love this clasp. It's a very, very classic look, isn't it? It really is. It's a sort of like... Um vintage look that yes. you see in auctions for vintage jewellery. I think if you've got a wow. strand of jade that you've been saving, you can oh. most certainly put it with this. Yeah, I think with your green jade, uh, jadeite, uh, that is going to look absolutely beautiful. Um, also, just give a second, let's just take a second to appreciate the round gems and you've got a round clasp. That Don't underestimate how much that will do for the jewellery. Yeah, great. If you, if you, if, if this clasp was, oh, I don't know if it wasn't this clasp, but it was a big fat rectangle, uh, it would look lovely, but it's kind of, it doesn't really, for me, it wouldn't really work. It's this this works, it, it's very classic. It would be a completely different look. Whereas this um, absolutely works, doesn't it? It's just gorgeous. Okay, so here we go, 499. Last few chances, it's not your price. We're gonna take a big, big chunk of money. I know, this is amazing. Gorgeous. Three chances remaining. Your gorgeous strand of queen conch and, of course, that gorgeous clasp as well. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? And look at the back of the clasp as well. It's got a really lovely kind of clover yeah. design on the back That's as well, cool. hasn't it? It's just so, so, so pretty. Look at the amount of silver you're getting as well. It's just, it's so generous. The finish piece of jewellery is just going to be absolutely oh, it's gonna be stunning. I, I, but I love your idea. Yes, I love the pearl idea, but I think I prefer your jade idea actually because you've got that rarity there yes and that uh, haven't they got the similar tone yes. as in it, it's not like 100 percent. it's not really really dark and it's not really really light it, they've got a similar tone haven't yeah, they, they do and they just and a similar them. saturation it's kind of like uh, bright but pastel isn't it so there you go two gems that are going to go uh, amazingly together i would love to see that and by the way if you do do a jade and conch <laughs> necklace or sweet or whatever it is please go and get it valued and also send it into the wall of fame i can't I, I would love to see that well done absolutely beautiful well done and, oh i've just had another thought larimar oh, yes larimar yes please larimar larimar <laughs> what about some of this bad boy blue topaz oh my gosh yes yes oh now, I wouldn't have thought put that with that, but it looks amazing. Amazing. That's amazing, amazing, yeah, amazing. Look at that. Because again, opaque, and then you've got the very shiny topaz. Yeah, total That's contrast. Beautiful. <laughs> right, okay, next. Shall we do Neary? Pendant in a box, pendant in a box. Here we go. Is this the one that opens? Oh, this. Oh, now this is ridiculous. I know. Oh, please. As if no one could see if I didn't I say it out loud. This is so lovely. Oh! Ah, <laughs> oh, that's so lovely. Oliver was saying that he really enjoyed showing this to Debbie today because it was like, ah, look at my He was like, do. watch Woo. this. I know. So just do my. Oh. <laughs> Ollie says he felt like Harry Potter when he was showing me this. And he went, guess what this is? Alakazam! <laughs> yeah, when he opens the dragon's egg and it's got the mer, the mer people in it. It I know does. it does open like it. Right, so here we go. Um, just imagine the joy you're going to get going, look at my gorgeous conch shell pendant. Sterling silver. 
No, it's not a euphemism. There we go. Uh, beautiful sterling silver setting. Gorgeous. Oh, Debbie. Do it, do just it, do it. Just imagine Ollie saying, look at what I can do with my conch. Here we go. He's opening it up. <gasps> look. Oh, my gosh. I know I need to get out more, but that made my day. <laughs> I know, right? No, I, I totally get that. I totally get that. <laughs> I mean... How could that not make your day? I've not... It looks like a Fabergé egg. Totally, totally. Yeah, there's stones in here. Yeah, you've got your white, white zircon. Look at, the, look at this gorgeous work that's been applied. Yeah, it's very ornate. I'd have that on a long silver chain. Maybe yeah. interspersed with a um, bit of chain, one conch, bit of chain, one conch bead, and then this. Oh, hang on. All right, love. Hang on. Oh, okay. I wouldn't have to make it, apparently. It's all good. Uh, yeah. <gasps> oh, my God, I need that. Mm, it's either Branca oh, or Jade. I can't remember. One of that's, the that's it there. That's, that's the jewelry. Oh, I love that, Carol. I can't cope. There you go. Right, so. I need that. Um, this is so beautiful. Um, it is like a... Can I have a look at that? Sorry, excuse me. Of course you can, darling. It is like a Fabergé. Do you know what that silver work reminds me of? Um, I've still got it today. Beautiful book of fairy tales that my mum... I think I was given it as a christening gift, actually. It's kind of all the Brothers Grimm um, tales. So you've got Cinderella yes. and you've got all of them. And do you know when you open the page... And there's a beautiful illustrations and then, and then you open the page it's the first letter isn't it it's that beautiful ornate so for sleeping beauty the once upon a time the o would be the first letter and there would be thorns and roses all kind of woven it's just it's got that feel that kind of slightly overgrown feel Definitely. to it i just you know, love it memorable jewelry so like i remember my nana by her pearls and her um cameo brooches oh wow and my mum has a beautiful locket and my granddaughter always takes my necklaces and tries to put them in her mouth. But they, as they get older, they play with your jewellery, don't they? And it becomes a memory. Mm. So I can see something like the this. The smell of it, the way it looks, Becoming feels. a memory. Totally. And do you know what, Debbie? That could be 150 years old, 50 years old. Mm. It, could be, it could be from the Victorian era. Mm. So unusual it's, that you're not going to see it anywhere else. No, and it's got that timeless, timeless elegance to it. I really love this. Ele just timeless. It could be made by Carl Fabergé himself. Um, it's for got the, the for stones the Romanov in family. as well, hasn't it? The it's got what, sorry? It's got the stones in. It's got white zircon in, yeah. I, I just, it, it's absolutely exquisite. I'm going to weigh the sterling silver, actually, as well, because I reckon that is going to be pretty amazing. Here we go. Let's give you uh, a price point on this today. It's amazing. £149. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yay! It's it's absolutely brilliant. Here we go. Uh, gram weight. 4.73 yeah. grams of sterling silver. But the mechanics of that as well, to make yes! a, a very special set of skills to make that. 4.73 grams of sterling silver. Right, sorry, 4.78 grams of sterling silver there. That is amazing. Well done. And literally just in the locket, like that. Just in the little locket there. And then you just literally close it. And it's entirely up to you. Whether, however, if you want to put another gemstone in there, you can. I think it would be sacrilege, if I'm being honest. I think you have to keep the queen conch in there. But the fact you can take it out is it's amazing. It's just a talking point. Like, you can tell them about the gemstone, then you can mm. open it and let them look at it. <laughs> I know, precisely. I love talking about jewellery. I love talking about other people's jewellery. Yeah. Like I'll meet someone and go, I like your necklace and I brace it, and I like to talk about it. Yeah, And I nice. think to have this and then go, oh, then do you know that Queen Co what this is? And then open it and show, show them is lovely. It's creating that memory, isn't it? Yeah. Awesome, well done. Okay, time for... <clears throat> oh, wow. Okay. Oh, gosh. Pearl and conch kit. Oh my god! These the pearls are an incredible colour. Yeah, they really are. Are they natural? Naturally coloured. Yeah. Oh. Mm. My gosh. Naturally coloured, genuine freshwater cultured pearls. All of the colours. Delicious. Colors. Delicious. All of the colours. Yeah, absolutely delicious. Pinks, purples, creams, whites. Okay, sterling silver uh, clasp with a 
Ratnakiri Zircon. That is, the, oh, that's one of the biggest Ratnakiri Zircons I've ever seen in my life. Ratnakiri Zircon, amazing, all the way from Cambodia, one of the rarest gems on planet Earth. It looks this like is, a diamond. Yeah, it, yeah, basically, it looks like a diamond. It's doubly refractive. Uh, which, unlike a diamond, means you get light going into the gemstone. It's split, but it's actually split twice and then reflected or refracted back at you. So there's, it looks like there's, um, well, no, there is even more light coming out of this gemstone than out of a diamond. And it's significantly rarer. And it's 4.5, uh, 4.3, 4 point something billion years. No, 4.5 billion years old, as old as the planet. This was formed just after the formation of the moon. Wow. Yep, just after the moon was There's made. There's a story. There's your gem. Stick that in your necklace. I know. <laughs> and then you got the Queen Conch. <laughs> Queen Conch connector. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. I mean, that could be a ring, couldn't it? That's a beautiful <gasps> kit. Isn't that just just electrifyingly beautiful? Absolutely gorgeous. There you go. And, of course, you get the beautiful uh, box as well. Gorgeous. 499. No, it's not. We've got a load of other stuff on the website. Uh, please, please, please do not miss out on any of this. Add it to your order as quickly as you can. Well done. And it's available on split payments. This don't forget, 149. Yes, for your please. Two, yes, please. For your two strands of genuine freshwater culture pearls, naturally coloured, for your Ratnikiri Zircon Sterling Silver Clasp and your genuine Queen Conch Sterling Silver Connector, all yours today for £149. Absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal. Imagine the jewellery you're going to make with this. This is going to be life-changing jewellery. Heirloom jewellery. Incredible. Well done, Fiona. Well done, maker in London, maker in Swansea. Great to see you all. Well done, Virginia in Hampshire, Jane in Greater Manchester, and in Nottinghamshire. Well done, my lovely. Absolutely loads of you coming through. This is great to see. Well done. That is that is an amazing price for everything yeah, you can see absolutely. there. Absolutely. I mean, those pearls are completely natural. They're absolutely beautiful. Yeah. And then you get the conch and as well, well and you get the big zerk on which looks like a diamond. I know. They're amazing. Just for the, I mean, just for the pearls, one four nine is amazing. Then you got the queen conch and the ratnikiri zerk on. All of this is worth so much more. You know it. I know it. It's brill. Well done, Sharon and Dorset. Well done to you as well, my lovely. Check out. If I could just be so bold as to throw something else in here with this, I'm going to put mm. the uh, blue zerk, uh, blue um, not blue zerk on. Uh, sky blue topaz in there as well. Stuff it, why not? Show it all in. What incredible things we have to offer people. I know, right? I mean, I really genuinely am blown away by the by, by the shows that I've done lately and the things that have been offered on the shows it's that I've done. Next lately. level. It's next level. That's next level. Yeah. This is the kind of thing which should only ever be available on a birthday show or on a Christmas day or whatever. Mm. You'd never. What think day you is it? It's make... a Thursday in the, in the coming in the towards the, the, the end of June. Yeah, you, you just to it's think. Like, what you can make with these? You, you know, you can actually make your own jewelry. Friday with something Eve. Like this. It's Friday, Friday Eve. Friday Eve. Yeah. I mean that. I mean that. It's just. It's just a day. Crazy. Oh, beautiful. Right. That was do, such fun. Do not move a muscle. We've got to go to a room. We've got a couple more things that we didn't play, just purely because we've run out of time. They are available on the website, including uh, um, Debbie's um, anniversary gift. <laughs> I'm glad it's on the Alex, website. Alex, get it. That's what uh, right. links are for. Do <laughs> not get... Uh, do not uh, uh, go anywhere. We've got the most... See, see this is it. We've got these coming up after. But you could not get more different... I need to move my nuts off the table as well. Don't go anywhere. We'll see you in a sec. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker.
Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. People can't hear. Well, I think they can't hear. They might be able to. Don't. Let's hope they can't. <laughs> I, because I, I, I just I use some blue language. Right. I'll move my pliers out of the way. Oh. This is what I love about jewelry maker. Give it up for jewelry maker, everyone. <laughs> Our hobby maker friends giving us a clap there. That's lovely. One craft. Uh, because we um, we can bring you the Queen Conch. We can bring you all of those lovely things. We can bring you all sorts, loads of different stuff. And then this hour is just like, it's just, it's fun. It's just, I, those earrings there, I love, I, I love them. They are, yeah, that's exactly the word for it. They're adorable. It's just fun. It doesn't cost a lot to make. I think that you can go on holiday and inject some colour without having to, to spend lots on, yep. on different, you know, to match your outfits. Your teenagers are going to wear them. You're going to wear them. This is fun jewellery. Having yep. said that, when I did a bit of research, these Heshi bead bracelets are massive. They're huge. They're you everywhere. Go on, you go on, um, I mean, they're great websites to go on just to have a look, but they are really expensive. Oh. You go on Outnet, Netta Porter, oh, Mr. Yeah. Porter, and you look at the, I mean, it's all, it's all designer stuff. You're absolutely right. We're talking hundreds of pounds for a Heshi bead bracelet. I mean, it's just, it, it's, it's ludicrous, really. It's absolutely ludicrous. Love that. Love that. This, pretty much my, oh gosh, I keep on thinking. Okay. Pretty much my favorite color combination, orange, pink. Maybe a bit of red in there as well, but mm, orange and pink, my absolute favourite colour combination. I love it. You can really colour match with these. So a lot of people say to me, I always use the same colour schemes. Oh, you can. Oh, look at that with the I tan. want this. I really <laughs> want it now. 
I want this now. <laughs> I want it now. Oh, that really suits you. I love it. So imagine that, you know, you might have gold bangles you could stack with that. Yes, totally. You know, it's... Uh, what I did was some really fun designs oh, and then I did a, a few more sort of more grown-up designs. See, I think this blue one is very, very grown-up. That's a really grown-up refined piece. Pop it with that and it just looks funky. And you could Festival. have bangles with that. Got Glastonbury well. this weekend, you know. Yeah. Um, I shall be watching it from my sofa. Um, and uh, just being able to bring you these colours. Yeah, the colours. But it's not all bright, acidic. Rah! Look at this. <laughs> Look at this beautiful, delicate pastel uh, palette you're getting here. Isn't that sweet? I saw a lot of um, pearls in with it when I, when yeah. I was researching. Yeah, interesting. Um, and I thought, yeah, that's a this way nice. to make it a bit more grown up. That's yeah. probably how I'd wear it, something like that. That brown's lovely. Oh, is that, got a, is that a D? It's a D because you have actually got letters. So I made one Ooh. on request, which is on my wrist. Um, it says is, Clemmy, and that's my granddaughter's name. And that is going straight on my daughter-in-law's <laughs> wrist after the show. She asked me to make it. But you get so many in this box. This is like a, um, this is, this is obscene. <laughs> right. Oh, right. Okay. Uh, which one are we doing first? Pastels. Pastels. So, um, it's the one with the little mushrooms. I think I think it is. Um, these are. This is. Oh no! I think the mushrooms are in the other one, darling. Oh, I don't know actually. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. I've got the right one. So, um, I'll get a couple out. Yeah, there they are. Oh yes. <laughs> Brown, you've got lovely kind of light greens. Oh, that's nice. But that with bright orange would look amazing. Creams, in fact, I'm not gonna have time to get all these out, am I? White, what's so nice is, when you look for your neutrals, you've got here, one, two. At first glance, it goes, oh gosh, there's no neutrals. One, two, three, four, I would say neutrals. Yeah. Maybe even five neutrals. Then you've got these um, gorgeous, they look like um, canes. Yeah. Uh, they're made from a similar material that polymer clay is made from. It's, it's, it's like a vinyl kind of uh, quality. Uh, yeah, like Millie Fury, absolutely like your lovely cane work. Look at those, aren't they lovely? Now that, this here, alongside these really delicate ones here, will look really sweet and just not bright or acidic at all. This one here is absolutely gorgeous. I love those colors there. Yeah, they're I really think. bright and lovely. Um, I, my kids would that, yeah. love these. They're seven and, no, they're eight and nine. And they'd be saying, oh, Hattie, Hattie especially. Oh, look, they're so adorable. <laughs> oh, use that voice. They're so adorable, yeah. And, oh, stop using that voice. Speak in your normal voice. Um, they're so cute and adorable, mummy. Look at the, I love that. What do you mean approximate size? Look how many we've got. Come on. Um, I don't know. That's a ruler. It's about the size of a pea. I've, I've no, I don't know. Go on, you can look at the approximate size. Here we go. So we've got loads of yin yangs. Hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And then Debbie's been going on about these lovely little mushrooms. These, these are really sweet. Well, there's a whole thing going on. It's called fairy core, apparently. I mean, fairy I mean, what? Fairy core, and it, I mean, core. Yeah, and it's all about like mushrooms and toadstools and that kind of look. Oh. Uh, um, the little heshies are. Look at the mushrooms. Seven millimeters. <gasps> Lovely. Oh, look at these. Now these letter beads. I've not seen these before in colours. They're lovely in colours, aren't they? They're really nice in colours. I've only ever seen these in white, like this one here. Yeah, got... these are um, quite elegant. They're really nice. Really, really. They do they come in all sorts of different colours. You've got teals, greens, and then, <laughs> oh my gosh, as if this couldn't get any cuter, bears. Yeah, little animals. Little bears. Little look. Um, what, what's that called? It's called lady a lady ladybug. There we go. I, I'm not sure what kind of animal that is. That's a very interesting animal. Is that a rabbit? Is that someone wearing That's a rabbit a hat? Creature. A little creature. A little creature, creature. There's a little Hoodie creature. cat. Oh my gosh, there's a gorgeous cat. There is. Look at the cat. Hello. Oh, gorgeous cat. A bit of a funny looking bear with really white teeth, but that's okay. <laughs> 
They're gorgeous. Do you know my um my one of my daughter's friends is really into the Sanrio uh, uh, stuff, like the Hello Kitty stuff oh, and yeah. the um, all that kind of stuff. And oh, look at this lovely brown bear. I love this. All that kind of Japanesey kind of um, yes, uh, kind of uh, animation stuff. Oh gosh, I love all of these. Oh gosh, what is that? It's a chick. It's a chick. It's a chick. Oh my gosh, look at the chick. It's Ed the Duck. Oh, hang on. Oh, he's, he's fallen over. You get the oh gosh. Oh dear. Uh, you get the idea though. Um, so all, all of the they're they're just lovely. I love them. Now, um, yes, 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 yes. Summer holidays. Making jewellery with your kids, mine are, mine are eight and nine. Uh, you've got a 16 year old. Uh, it's not a bear, it's a Pikachu. Oh, is it? Is it? Is it a Pikachu? And that doesn't like a Pikachu that I've seen. So is this from Pokemon then? Do you know, the Pikachu's like this, kind of like this. I, yeah, I, I don't a know. Bit. I mean, is it a bear? Is it a Pikachu? Oh, it's got the black ear. I suppose it could be a Pikachu. It's, um, it is what it is. I don't know what that one is. That's a very funny looking animal. I think it's somebody, you know, like somebody wearing a hat with Do rabbit you ears Miffy? on. A bit like Miffy. It looks like Miffy. Miffy, yes, with the little cross mouth. Yes, Miffy. Oh, so Miffy. Miffy was a little rabbit. He was a little it's rabbit. It's Miffy, isn't it? It, it, looks, it looks like a Miffy. It's now Miffy. <laughs> Looks like a Miffy. If you don't know what Miffy is, that could have sounded very dodgy. It's, it's a not little a... rabbit. Yes. A Miffy. No, but a Miffy. Yeah. Anyway, um, cats, rabbits, all sorts. Oh, gosh, is that a hippo? I think it's a hippo. No, I don't know what that is. Oh, gosh, I don't know what it is. Is that a hippo? Oh, a, yes, a hippo. it is a hippo. It's a hippopotamus in our house. Beautiful. Hippopotamus. Right, okay, that chick's still falling over. That just, just, just ignore the chick. Okay, minute clock. All these gorgeous colours. You've got flowers, you've got the gorgeous Heshies, you've got all of them. Make your uh, flower flower girl jewellery, make your wedding jewellery, make really lovely refined jewellery, personalised jewellery. Personalised jewellery is so lovely. Um, I'll be honest with you as well, um, not necessarily the animals, but all these other beads as well. My, um, my husband, um, I've got a load of these Heshi bead bracelets at home, which I don't know, I think I... I didn't seal them. I think I think, <laughs> I think the guest designer gave them to me. And we went to, to like a Cafe Mambo thing at Warwick Castle. And my husband said, what are those? What are those bracelets? I said, oh, I got them from Mike. He said, oh, no, I, I want to, I want to, I want to, um, I want to um, wear it. So he wore it. So he's got loads of these lovely bracelets. He's got some lava rock bracelets. Yeah. He's got the, uh, the Heshi They're fun, bracelets. aren't they? They're for absolutely everyone. Um, whether you're a stressed out 50 year old or whether you're, or whether you're five, it doesn't really matter. Or 105. Look at that, they're so lovely. Those are little flowers. And also the ring, um, the stretchy ring. Oh, that's ring. really sweet. Stretchy rings are really in. And you can just put that's really nice. like one initial on there. You can put your children's Aye. names and wear three on, on your arm, you know, in a that's bracelet. That's really nice, yes. Um, because you've got the letters as well. 19.99, there you go. Is oh, it? yeah, brilliant. That's absolutely incredible. That's you are getting, I mean, I don't know how many, how many are you getting? Oh, thousands. If I. Oh, I don't know. Alphabet-wise, we've got loads. Well, I think we've got pretty much them all, haven't we? Yeah, you've got the whole alphabet and some. And um, some. And they're all different colours, these ones, with the gold lettering, which I've not seen before. No, I haven't either. Um, There's O. <clears throat> OK. Let's see if I can spell... Well done, loads of people. I know, I won't spell anything rude, don't worry. Taking every joy... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looking for a if yeah. If you're going on holiday Joe. You want to entertain the kids, give them a box of this and some stretch. Did you get, when I was on last, we did all the stretch cord in the different colours, the elastic. Yes. If you got that, give them a reel of elastic and a box of these and a tray and you won't hear a peep. You won't hear a peep for hours and hours and hours. They are just going to love it, aren't they? Gorgeous. Well done. Okay. Oh, gosh, 45 seconds. We're going to go lower. We're going lower. Are we? Why are we doing? I think oh. that's a really good price. I think for end of term gifts, for gifts to give to teachers, for gifts to give to your um, friends, if you're going to be moving up maybe to secondary school. Very festival. Very festivally, absolutely gorgeous. Why not enjoy all of it? They're just so lovely, and they all fit beautifully into this little box. By the way, once you once you finish using all these beads, that's a really useful little box to be able to use, isn't mm. it? Really useful little box. Gorgeous. Well done, everybody. Yeah, these boxes on their own when you go to places like, oh, I don't know, Hobbycraft and places like, why did you want to go there? Uh, but places <laughs> like that, you know, they're going to be costing you a, a, a pretty penny, aren't they? 
Whereas here today, the whole thing, with all of your alphabet beads, with all of your lovely Heshi flowers, with all of your lovely Heshi um, uh, discs, here's your price. $14.99. That is brilliant. That is absolutely brilliant. Well done, everyone. My son said to me, how did you used to entertain us when we didn't have um, smartphones and things and I said craft I used to craft. give you I used to give you a bag full of plasticine and yep. loom bands and I used to give you coloring oh, and you used bands. to actually use my brain and yep. just put them in front of a screen absolutely and I think the sooner that you get young people into you know, I'm quite passionate about this, as you can tell. But, you know, the sooner you get young people into creating, yes. there are so many benefits. But these aren't only for young people, which absolutely. I think I've shown in the jewellery. They're for absolutely everyone, whether you're making pieces for charity, whether you go into a care home, uh, you know, a couple of afternoons a week and you want to make jewellery, which is nice and easy and just lovely and easy to bring out your... Easy to show your personality with as Yeah, well, definitely. They? They're really fun. Really easy to bring out your personality. What do you mean how many alpha? I don't know. Okay, I'll count. You're Neary keeps going on and on and on about these alphabet ones. Easiest way to get these out, by the way, is with a little teaspoon or something like that. I mean, you can try and tip them out, but then all of them will come out. So, oh, gosh. <laughs> Are you serious, Neary? Are you seriously <laughs> wanting to know how many we've got here? Hang on. Oh, no. Don't do this. Here we go. I'm going to use my lip balm now scoot. to I've get these out. Oh, gosh. Here we go. 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 Is this Still not, not the price? No, oh, it's no not the price. No, we're going to go down again. Oh, gosh, I dropped one. Going to go down again. Why not? We had 200 of these. Okay. Uh, the alphabet beads, which you're getting less of than at probably any of the other beads here. It's lovely, isn't it? Well, this red here. Yeah, it's a really nice, red. isn't it? Ruby it's a really, red. really lovely red, like a watermelon kind of red almost. Okay, here we go. Neary, this is for you. Here we go. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-six, thirty-eight, forty, forty-two, forty-four, forty-six, forty-eight, fifty, fifty-two, fifty-four. Fifty-four! There you go. Absolutely gorgeous. There you go. 54 of your alphabet charms. Many, many, many more of these. I'll tell you what, Debbie, whilst you're there. You dropped one, remember? Oh, 55. Is it two, two alphabet? What? 12 99 Oh, my gosh. That's oh. absolutely amazing. That is a steal. I'd that get is both a steal. Because you can put the pastel in with the brighter colours. I did that on some of them. That's yeah. superb value for money. Yeah, that is absolutely brilliant, isn't it? Well done. That. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. The other one is already on pre-order. It's already going on pre-order. Here we go. Let's get some, um, let's uh, spell some words here. <laughs> no four-letter words here, though, please. Okay, I need a C. Here we go. I need an A. I'm putting it here. Oh, hang on. C. I think I might have got it upside down. doesn't matter. No, it's good. Oh, gosh, is there an A? I'm literally it blind, be, blind. Yeah. A. a. Uh, oh, it's upside down, too. I found that um, <laughs> that they had more of the, like, the A's and the E's and the things that you would... Yeah. R. Yes, they are. They are definitely clay. O. Oh, gosh. L. Come on, where's the L? I suppose I can use an I. Use an L. There you go. Use an L. Carol. There you go. See, that's really pretty, isn't it? I love it. Gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> can I go home? Because you've just done the demo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, no, but no. like little words of encouragement <laughs> like strive or or joy faith. or faith or peace. Or you I mean, got this. I'll be honest with you. Don't go for onomatopoeia. Don't go for anti-disestablishmentarianism. Uh, don't go for that because you're probably not going to be able to spell that with all of these. <laughs> but if you want to spell mum, mum, uh, yeah. mm. if you want to spell mum, oh, you'd have a secret. <laughs> <laughs> You could put funny ones on yes, there, you like could. bring wine or something, or uh, Harry Styles or something, or, uh, or, or, no, I can't say, there's lots of words I'm thinking of that I can't use. Lots of things. 
Bad, 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 bad. Yeah, yes. Yeah, nicknames. There you go. Nicknames. So Pippa, Pippa, Pip Squeak, Squish, we call her Squish. Squish, there we go. Squishy, there we go. I don't and call... And Hattie is Biz. I don't uh, call and... any of my animals by their proper names or go any on. of my children. So who have you got? Daisy is Lloydie. Okay. Neo, my doggy, is Nini. Anushka, Nushi, is Nunu. Oh. Ziggy is Zig. And Snoopy, this is the best one, Snoopy is Booby. Booby, great. Because Daisy used to call Isn't him Booby when Isn't that what John McCreary used to call his wife? Booby. There we go. Yes, he did, didn't he? Yeah, he used to call her Booby. Right. So any of those you could put on a bracelet. <laughs> Bombhead. There we go. <laughs> yes. Well, yeah, that could be for my children. There we go. Bottom head. There we go. Right. <laughs> OK, well done, everybody. OK, um, next one, next one, next one. OK, this one's lovely. Okay. Oh, no, really? That sounds amazing. There's flowers in the next one. Oh, like oh yes, there are. Oh, how lovely. Oh, you've got some lovely. Yes. White with gold. White with gold letters uh, here. Is the letters? What kind of English is that? Are the white and gold is the letters. There you go. So white with gold. Here we go. Aren't they lovely? That, that's lovely. My daughter made these for all her friends, but I... There you go. I had to buy the letters from somewhere and they cost me much more than this and I only got a bag. Oh my gosh, there's a panda! There is a panda, there there's is. There's a panda! Look, there's here. Miffy again, he's upside down. I know Miffy's upside down. There's your panda. Oh my gosh, the panda's really cute. I don't know, Hello. Kung Fu Panda. Comfy Panda, that's what we call him. There he is. Did you say there were some ninja cats? Oh my gosh, there's a pig. There's a piggy. There's a piggy. Oh, okay. Okay, come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh gosh, come here. Oh gosh. Uh, if you're in a hurry, don't try and get these out because they are really <laughs> challenging. Oh, what's that? That's I used a bean colour. scoop, I just scooped out. Well, a teaspoon another, will little work. Little mousey, yeah, a teaspoon will work, a bead scoop, anything like that. Come here, piggy. Come in, little piggy. Little pig, little pig, let me in. There Here we is. go. Piggy! There you go. Aww. Oink, oink. Doctor, doctor, I feel like a pig. How long have you felt like that for? About a week. There we go. So, have we got any? Never trust a man who keeps pigs. Here we go. So, Aww. loads of lovely animals. Show the flowers and the hearts. Oh, the flowers and the hearts. The flowers and the hearts. Here's the gorgeous... Now, these are like your lovely hibiscus kind of flowers, aren't they? Yeah, just one of the flowers and a wish bracelet. That's so sweet. Look, this one here, look. There you You've go. got um, quite a sizable hole, but because it's clay, I'm sure you could ream it a bit bigger if you needed. Yeah, it. okay. And then you could pop cord through in like macrame or whatever. <clears throat> nice. Gorgeous. And then the colour of the, the Heshies, you're, if I close that and then sand them up, the colours you're going to be getting here, really, there's some lovely neons in there. Neon yellow, neon orange, neon pinks. Neon blue blues and uh, your oranges and your and, and your greens. Uh, then you've got kind of darker tones. They're very Christmassy, Christmas colours. So Isn't these are very lovely? good for your craft fairs. So mm. if you're doing your craft fairs, you know, with your school craft fairs or whether all the kids come. Like if you look at that necklace, that's a bit more that's grown nice. up. That's yes, injecting lovely. some fun into pearls. Yeah. Um, but if you wanted to do just the stretchy bracelets, you could sell one of those for five pounds on your stall. Absolutely gorgeous. Which I think would be a good price. Yeah, definitely. And look, just one earring. Mm. So I, I beg your pardon. Um, one flower used on each one of these earrings. So lovely. They look so... They, they look Very really, summery. Really summery. They look quite expensive, quite kind of designer-inspired, I'd say, as well. OK, come on, everyone. <laughs> let's get down. Let's get down to business. Here we go. Price point. Here we go. Twelve ninety nine. I don't want to put that panda away. I think he's absolutely delightful. You can just sit there for the rest of the show. There you go. <laughs> you've got all those lovely flowers as well. You've got beautiful hearts as well. And you've got the gorgeous uh, floral kind of Millie Fury beads as well. Absolutely amazing. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now, what do you want to demo for us, lovely Debbie? Well, I mean, you could do absolutely anything with these. And I think the classic thing to do with them is a stretchy bracelet. Yeah. Um, you know, because you're basically just putting them on and then you are 
um, just tying a knot. But if you have a look at maybe these, what I found was it was a great way of going into my findings drawers, finding all the odds and little pieces of findings right from back in the day from JM or what, wherever, um, that I've got twos and threes and fours of. And you can actually use them alongside the Heshi beads and just make a completely different look. So I think this kind of thing is very, this is the sort of thing I saw online that was very about 15 designer. pounds that mm. people are wearing in their <clears throat> stacks in the summer with very their designer. precious metal, yeah. you know, Misoma type jewelry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or you can go like, you know, the name jewelry. Um, which so again that be can a, be very designer as which well. Which can be very designer. Me. Ah, oh, mm. gorgeous with Clemmy. Is she Clementine? Or yeah, Clemmy? she's Clementine. Ah, oh, it's such a beautiful name. Clemmy, hello, it's Nana. Just she watches me and she can't work out how she can get in the telly. <laughs> That's gorgeous. It's lovely. Yeah, and be able to make bespoke pieces. You know, you, you know, sometimes you walk into the post office and there's like a name, uh, doors to go on. So I beg your pardon, uh, names to go on doors or mugs with yeah, they kids' never, names on. They it. never it's an unusual have... name. They, they, they never have Hattie. They never have Pippa. They're, no. ne they're never going to have Clemmy. So you know, there you go. So nice to be able to make really lovely personal. You can make pieces. your own. So what I thought I'd show you is more of how we can use crimp beads um, and add some chains. So if you don't want the whole thing to be Heshi beads, you don't have to. So obviously you can make the stretchy ring, you can make the earrings. Let's just do an earring um, just because it's so quick. So I've just got our um, JM hoops. You can have it, Carol. It's yours. Um, JM <laughs> Carol's face. But I need to decide. But the thing is, I need to decide what I want to go. Carol said, I want this. And I said, you can have it. And she had a little <gasps> moment. She had a little moment. I love you. So if you have a look, you'll see that you've got quite a substantial little uh, hole there. But you can also ream that because it's clay. So if you need it to be larger. And then all you need to do is pop it onto your finding and press it down. And it's gone on there. So, you know, all of these sort of hoop earrings are very in then. That just takes two minutes. So that's a great one for actually just... And then, you know, if you want to use the hoops for something else and summer's over, you can take this bead off again and use it again. Can't decide which I like best. So got both. Such pretty kits. Yeah, you've got to get them both. They're only 12 99 They actually go very well together because if you're wanting sort of a, a block colour and then there were more neutrals in the pastel... So I think the pastel is a great one to go alongside it. If you have a look at them together, Carol's got them. Mm -hmm. You'll see that if you want to add neutrals in, there's more in the pastel kit, which is the one at the top, so that you can get those. You've got of... kind of the neon and the pastel version of almost all the colours there. So yeah. I mean, you, you can put them together and create your own ombre pieces. Absolutely. As you said. Yeah, lovely. Yeah. It's beautiful. Beautiful. That's so true. I went with gold because you've got gold on the letter beads. Nice. But obviously, if you don't use the letter beads, you can go for any colour you like. So I've got some of our um, beading. I, I call it tiger tail. Everyone goes, what do you mean? But, you know. Beading thread. Beading thread. Basically. Hold on. I've got the wrong end. There we are. So if you get some uh, tiger tail, you need to get enough. I'm aiming to add a chain to this. So I don't need a big bit, but I have also need enough to crimp. So if you get a length of your tiger tail... And then I'm just going to crimp one end by popping a crimp bead on there. This is great if you haven't made jewelry before and you're wanting to start with some <coughs> fun Sorry. projects. Bless you. Now that's number three now. Three. Third time lucky. And what I'm going to crimp on is my chain. And I'm going to crimp it straight onto the last link of my chain. Just a tip here. If you've been cutting your chain, just make sure that your last link... Um, isn't damaged because sometimes that happens when we cut ah, our chain cool. and then okay. it will uh, it will break so what I've done is you can see there I've popped on my chain and a crimp bead and then what I'm going to do is just take my tiger tail length back down my crimp bead and then I'll get my fingers out of the way I'm actually see that I'm actually just going to grab my pliers there you go so I've just taken that back down the crimp bead and I'm going to take my crimp back up to the top and give it a squish. Um, I like what you did with the pearls and Heshi in a necklace. Oh, thank you, oh, Francis. Thank you, Francis. I thought that it, it gave lovely, it that fun it? quality, didn't it? Mm, like it's just, just kind color, of bit fun, of fun pearls. 
Beautiful. <laughs> a bit of fun pearls. Now, yeah. you need to decide your colour scheme. Now, I immediately was drawn to the pastels, but then as I got going with um, the really bright colours, I did a lot of colour matching. So, you know, a lot of people say to me they're not confident with colours. Well, you can sort of start to put colours together that maybe you wouldn't have done before. And it yeah. sort of increases your repertoire as far, far as your gemstone combinations go so what should we do oh the pressure there's so many colors okay let's just go with some green i'm gonna do green and then i wanted something to offset the green and add some texture as well so let's go for oh, green and purple you can't really go you can't go wrong with a bit of green and purple got both thanks for the great price these would be fab for making for charity, says Janet. Yeah, I thought yes. that, Janet, actually. Oh, very crocusy, very Wimbledon. Yeah, so I've gone, I've gone green and green and purple. So what I'm going to do first is I've basically raided my, <laughs> my findings drawer. Yeah. Okay, and if I just bring these into shot, and this is what oh, I've used. Lovely. So I've got twos and threes, and these are all JM from over the years. Like sometimes you might have, like remember when we used to get the findings in the kit? Yeah. And, so I've just oh, raided my, really old. my my drawers oh, and, nice. and twos and threes, so you can use those. So decide what you're going to do. So let's put on five of the green. One, <laughs> two, three. Lovely. Now I am sitting back from my beading mat, which is why I'm using my fingers, because I'm not sitting over it. Four, come here, and five. Okay, so we've got this nice green and what I usually like to do with the tail is take it down the first few beads if the uh, drill hole allows so I'm just going to pop those down and then what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to cut that that off for, the, for demo purposes just so that it gets out of my way make sure that you're snipping the one that you want to do that went flying oh. okay so you've got five little beads there and now you can think right what am I going to use what what have I got so I've got these kind of jump rings that I've got the little uh, texture on it so I'm going to pop one of those on and look how sort of more high-end and grown-up that looks ah oh, both packs brilliant for my guide group to use in their agree last meeting before the summer holidays oh Heather what a lovely idea I'm changing my mind now about adding the purple as I go along. So I'm going to add another five of these. Two, three. It's going to be super cool with memory, uh, memory wire. With memory wire, I think. Both for bracelets and choker necklaces, says Linda. Yeah, nice. Definitely. Lots of There's not much that you can't, can't do with it, to be honest. Mm. Really okay. limited on this one. 16 chances left. My gosh, wow. If you add, make sure you've got enough, but if you start to add these, in between your hair sheets. Like I've decided to keep to the same colour now because I really like that. Um, and decide sort of how much you want that, sorry, to, to be on the front oh, and then cute. have the chain. It's like malachite. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? And Very if you nice. want to add a little bit of texture, you can add some of the more uh, subtle colours in there. Got both for granddaughter's birthday makes for her and friends. Well, add some elastic and findings so they can make their own jewellery. Jane, lovely idea. My daughter is 16 and she loves doing these. If you've got the different colour elastic. I think for teachers, for your football team, yeah. for your end of, end, of, end of term, end of school, for uh, parents, for all sorts, for Sunday schools, for guides, brownies, cubs, beavers, they're all perfect. And I think like my daughter has a little secret, you know, codes with her friends mm, and they, yeah. write, they write little secret initial things that's something to do with the youtuber but um so you know you can do that yeah so what i found also look really nice is when you get spacer beads and you br and you uh, bunch them all together so i sort of found these little flowers that they're came. sweet they came from years ago and they've just been sitting in my in my drawer so you can do it with bead caps as well and i'm just going to pop three of those on so what you're creating is some nice gold texture into the middle and this is going to be sort of my focal point actually I'm going to put another two on just because I can so I'm putting five of those on into the middle so that they move but they also I'll get my hand out of the way in a sec they add this sort of texture mm. and then all you need to do is repeat that down the other side and crimp it onto the other end of the chain so then you've got this um 
sort of bracelet that goes to about there and then the chain so is, nice. is behind you yeah. so that's sort of one way to do it if you have a look at I'm just going to show you um, if you have a look at this one all I've done here I've taken all of the colors that I like together so this is from the pastel kit and I seem to like to use five of each one so oh, I've put with a conch <laughs> yeah if anyone would like to give me a conch kit I will happily accept it um, as, as a demo kit there you go <laughs> um, and I've just put silver spaces beads <laughs> in there as well so they go just as nicely with the silver uh, spacer beads as they do with the gold um, I've no idea why but I just bought both lots because they look such fun they are oh fun. Suzanne yeah they are loads of fun oh I've no idea oh yeah well they are fun they They're are lovely they are fun and I think like I like to wear a stack so I've got um, some, my precious metal bangles here that yeah. I made. They're gorgeous, by the way. Thank you. And then I've got my selenite, and then Daisy made me this one. But I wouldn't think twice about popping, you know, this on there and wearing it with... That would look lovely. ...with my stack in the summer. That's so gorgeous. So, you know, I, don't, th I think, don't think that looks out of place. No. And I think lovely. it's a great way to add colour. So this is just put on to elastic I think you can have a good play and you can actually add things in there like pearls mm. and then it just makes it um, look a bit different they're gorgeous there's so much you can do with these and they're completely unisex as well you yeah, can get yeah. whatever colors you want get your football team colors get your, yeah. get your get your I don't know get your your car your, your um, shackle school colors, colors yeah. gorgeous your school colors yeah your house colors well done right <laughs> <laughs> shall we do a big fat star by. Oh, yes, please. Let's do it. Let's go. What have you got there, Carol? <laughs> White and golden ombre South Sea pearls. I love the way you just throw that out there. Yeah. Like, you know. Yeah. Well, Debbie, sometimes you just got to do it, haven't you? You just got to say it. South Sea pearls. Oh my gosh. They're so round. From the Pinctana Maximus, the world's largest pearl-bearing oyster. Oh, that's Oh incredible. my gosh. Look at the si Look at the ombre. The gradual ombre. Oh wow. Speechless. That is seriously good. <laughs> that is seriously good. Very, very good. Um, you have got here the most incredible ombre, the most amazing quality. These are all naturally coloured. Some of the world's rarest cultured pearls. These come from um, uh, the kind of the very warm seas off the coast of China right the way down to Australia and over to uh, kind of very close to kind of the international dateline kind of, at, you know, we're talking, we're talking literally the middle of nowhere. Um, for these oysters to be cultured, they have to be harvested by hand and then brought to the, brought to the nurseries and then they, and then they, and then they, they live there for the rest of their lives and they're cared for and they're cleaned on a daily basis. Um, they are cared for like, uh, you know, uh, like a family pet almost. Uh, they have all the barnacles chipped off them. The water is, um, uh, the kind of the water is monitored to make sure it's not too warm, it's not too cold. There's plenty of nutrients in the water. They are the most loved and cared for mollusks of them all. And you can just see they produce some of the world's finest pearls. I can't see anything wrong with those at all. I mean, they look absolutely perfect to me. They really do. They look, I mean, they, would, they're described as near rounds. I would uh, argue with that. Yeah. We all know what a round looks like. I mean, the, the outside of that clock, that's a round. Are these rounds? Uh, yeah. yeah, that's about as round as they come. That's about as round oh, as you're ever going to get. Beautiful. The quality, I know I've got them on a black background, but if you put them in front of a white uh, background, you are going to get... If I do this, here we go. Look at this. Just look at that colour against the white. Oh. See, that's how white they are. They're whiter than, I mean, obviously it's not hard to be whiter than this, but, but they are, they are white, <laughs> white, white. 
and the luster, the, the quality. And this is when we start to describe genuine pearls as having a gem-like quality. Mm. They are gemmy. And it's all to do with the level of, well, with the layers of nacre and, oh, what's that called? Aragonite on the outside of the pearl, which lets the light into the pearl, just literally maybe one millimeter, maybe half a mil, maybe just literally a few microns. And what that does, is it allows light in and then it reflects out. And it looks like the pearl is glowing from within. It is radiating quality. 999 is no end of your price maker and Dorset, I've got you there. 60 seconds, we're taking the price down. That's how white they are, whiter than anything. Whiter than anything. Whiter than white. Natural as well. Isn't that just incredible? I'm mesmerized by these. They, they, as you say, they are as near to perfect as you're ever gonna get, so much so. If somebody had said to me, that's a recording of uh, you know, white and golden ombre, South Sea colored shell pearl, I'd yes. say, oh yeah, absolutely. Look at that colour. <laughs> oh, my gosh, it would be a travesty to, to, to kind of separate these out. Yeah, the attention to detail from that gentle ombre to the size and the shape qualities you're getting here is amazing. Imagine how many oysters they have to go through to get the ones that are the same colour and then put them in a strand and ombre them. Well, I mean, you've got here one, uh, two, four, sorry, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-five oysters there. But Debbie's absolutely right. How many thousands of oysters? No, that one's not big enough. No, that one's more of a pear shape. No, that one colour, that, that colour doesn't work. No, that one there's two this. No, that one there is two that. That one there's got too much of this. Thousands upon thousands to get the 25, which are right for this strand. And by the way, we didn't co just commission one of these. We commissioned multiples of this. They are delicious. They yeah, are delicious. absolutely right. That's the only way to describe that. Make a world unto you. We're at 499 on individual split payments of £124.75. Interest free. Absolutely incredible. I, I would have to use them in all one piece of jewellery with black oh, spinel absolutely. sauces or something. Or... And, um, you know, precious metal clasp. Oh, 100% precious metal. Yeah, definitely. 499. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, yeah. Mark's with us tomorrow. Lovely. Hi, Deb. I'm not sure if it's the, uh, the PC, but the term glamorous gran doesn't do you justice. Beautiful. Inside and out. See you Tuesday, Carol. That's from. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, ah, she is unbelievably glamorous and so beautiful. Thank as well. you, my darling. That is an absolutely lovely mess. And Mark, thank oh, you. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> He's gorgeous. Thank you, Philip Mark. Philip and Maureen, well done to you. Anne, well done to you in Merseyside. Maker, well done to you as well. Jackie, I know. What a sweetie. <laughs> oh, she is actually starting oh. to cry. Stop it. Stop okay. it with your lovely messages, everybody. I know, she's an absolute legend. Thank you, Mark. Gorgeous, well done. Uh, For nine, nine. And you can never leave. I can't. You can never <laughs> <today>? leave. <laughs> you can never leave. Oh, that's so kind. Those individual split payments, £124.75. pence. Absolutely gorgeous. You're such a... I'm such a... Honestly, you, uh, someone says so nice to me and that's the end of me. <laughs> <laughs> Tracy in Norfolk, well done to you as well. Debbie, when are you back? I'm having a rest. I'm back in a few weeks. I'll be back oh, in yeah. July. Yeah, I'm oh, going away. Sweet. Oh, sweet. Where are you going? I'm going with my with my um, teenagers and just off. Uh, first of all, we're going to Centre Parks and then we're going camping, but it's posh camping. Oh, how <laughs> gorgeous. Have a wonderful time. Thank you. Oh, you've been amazing today. Thank you so much. Look, we've got three chances remaining. Janet, well done to you as well. You have got the most amazing weekend planned. You've got, uh, you've got Mark, you've got Claire, you've got Susie as well. All all three incredible guest designers are going to be with you all weekend. Very, very excited about that. Of course, you've got Ellen and the gang as well, which is going to be great. Um, yeah, Sunday's uh, with Sunday with Susie. She's got a brand, I want to watch brand new gemstone. I want to watch that. Brand new carved pieces. Amazing, Honestly, lady. amazing. Go to her Instagram page, Susie Menham. It's absolutely incredible. Uh, her stuff's just gorgeous. This weekend's going to be absolutely bonkers. Uh, you've got an amazing afternoon with Dave and the gang. He's got his shorts. Have you got your shorts on? He's got it. Oh, he's got his legs. He's got his shorts on today, everyone. He's dancing, Dave. Prepare for dancing. the thunderstorms. <laughs> he's got his shorts on. You've got an amazing afternoon with Dave and the gang coming up on uh, on our hobby maker as well. But can I just say, please go to our website, jewelrymaker.com. We bought you Queen Conch today. We bought you the Heshi kits. Yep. We bought you the incredible Mystic Topaz and, of course, the gorgeous Sky Blue Topaz. We bought you those incredible kits. We bought you uh, the gorgeous early bed, that gorgeous cherry blossom oh, agate yes, yeah, as yeah. well. We bought you so much. If you can go to 
to our website, jewelrymaker.com. Look and see what we've been bringing you for the last five hours because I don't, I wouldn't want to miss out on absolutely anything. Thank you so much, Debbie. Oh, thanks see for you in me. July. See you in a bit and enjoy your afternoon with Dave and the Bye. gang. Bye.